Check, hello, can you read me? Buck Thunder, Buck, Buck, oh, it's me, Phil, your divorce attorney. Welcome to Buck Thunder 2, Xeno Slaughter. Another Buck Thunder game. Your ex-wife is back and more evil than ever. She's sending a bunch of her new blood-sucking boyfriends out. So go shoot them, just kill them all, Buck. That's, that's the game. Buck, it's me, Phil, your divorce lawyer again. You remember how to move and jump and everything, right? There's shit on the screen that tells you how to do all that stuff. I mean, come on, Buck. This is the second game. You know how to do all this shit. All right, Buck, you're gonna have to use the brand new double jump to get over there. Oh, shit, I'm sorry, Buck. I forgot there's no double jump. Just crouch. We gotta try crouching, Buck. Fucking scheduling and scoping bullshit. A fucking crouch prioritized over a double jump. Who is this? Who, who, who are these people above us? Stay sharp, Buck. A bunch of your ex-wife's new alien boyfriends. There they are, coming right at you. Just shoot them, Buck. You remember... That's what I'm talking about, Buck. Kill those fuckers. You're the man. I love you, Buck. You're so fucking cool. Oh, I'm so excited and lit up to be your divorce attorney. You have no idea you're my favorite client. Oh, my God, Buck, you did it. You opened the door. You're a fucking genius. You are my favorite client. It's me, by the way, your divorce attorney. Don't forget, I'm Phil, your divorce attorney. Let's go. Let's get moving. Let's defeat your ex-wife. Your divorce attorney. Let me fill you in on what's going on. An alien spaceship landed in your ex-wife's backyard. She fell in love with the leader, and it turns out they're all a hive mind, so she's fucking all of them. What are the odds? I know that's probably what you're thinking, but just get out there and kill them, Buck. It's all you can do. Over and out. Open up. You gonna hide in there all day? Mom and Dad just left. Are you gonna answer me or what? I'm coming in. You better not be doing anything weird in there. Why didn't you say goodbye to Mom and Dad before they left for their trip? You know they were pissed, right? Whatever, we got the place to ourselves now. Oh my God, don't give me that look, narc. What are you mad that I'm throwing this party tonight? <laughs> it's fine. Mom and dad are gone for a whole fucking week. We can do whatever we want. Here, come on, try some. <laughs> you know it's good for your depression, right? Okay, we're totally gonna rage tonight. I cannot wait. I gotta text Jen and make sure she brings the good shit. Whoa, 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 it's kicking in. Oh, uh, what is wrong with your, ugh, finally, there you are. I felt like I was losing my mind. So, do you want any or nah? Fine, more for me then. All right, I'm gonna go get ready for the party. This stuff's gonna last me all week. It is powerful. Mom told me I was in charge. She did it in secret so it wouldn't hurt your feelings and dad said that he flat out doesn't love you. It was actually pretty messed up. By the way, mom left you a note on the fridge. Go read it. Then come meet me outside. I need your help grabbing party shit from the store. You come in or what? So I guess. Holy shit! Oh, what the fuck? Get down and stay quiet.
I knew aliens were real. Can you understand what they're saying? Oh shit, look, it's Mr. Pilfrey. He's got that, um, what's it called? Uh, dementia. Uh, what's going on out here? Martha, is that you? Oh my god! Oh my god, what did they just do to Mr. Pilfrey? Hola, mi amato. What the mama. fuck is going on? Cho, machiza, wana ho. Luma de tanda, ula ba giwa na kanga ma. So, no matter how tough she is, has tanda ba wa. Isa, wote kwa wuhan. Do you oh, hear that? Oh. What is that sound? It's coming from the dead idiot. Ha! Ha! I think it's home for us. What is Ho! Cho! 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 Ho! Oh! 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 So! 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 Ha! Damn! This is over. I I know my name is Ho! How did you have a day? Did that thing just spit all finally. over Finally! Oh my god, finally I'm free, thank god! What a nightmare! Listen, can you pull the inhibitor chip out of me? It's the metal thing stuck in me, just pull oh, it out! What the fuck is that? Oh, that feels so much better, thank you. Yeah, sorry about the spit. I I, I needed to get you infected with the translator microbes. That, that, that's sort of how it works. I guess you guys don't have those here yet. Listen, my name's Kenny, I'm a Gatlian. Uh, we, we gotta kind of, we gotta oh, move. what is it? Is it talking to you? Maybe we should go back to the Ignore house. Ignore her! It's very important that you listen to everything I say! Okay, it is your lucky day right now! We can survive this together if you just listen to me! Those G3 guys are gonna turn your whole species into drugs! Can you handle a gun? Because, you know, I'm kind of a gun, and if you don't use me to kill those G3 grunts, you know, they're gonna fucking kill us! What the fuck? You just paused the game! This doesn't help at all! Are you an idiot? Fuck yeah, there we go! Uh, you go on ahead! Uh, all right, first kill! I am so glad you picked me up! Well, let's keep going! Not bad, alien! Not bad at all! Let's head to that base! Well, here you go! It's a G3 warp base! Okay, let's just clean house and warp out of here! Nice! You, you, you know, you had to kill them, right? It was either them or you, and me as well, and, and I, I, I would prefer to live. You know, and I have a voice here. I have a choice in this. Oh shit, it's a merc! They're Why tougher! The you it's like two men into the base! Show your face, bounty hunter! Okay, the warp drive should be at the top. That's where it always is in shit like this. Just keep going. Keep going up to the top. Shit. This wasn't supposed to. Fuck yeah! Now grab the warp drive. We'll use this to warp the hell off this doomed planet. Sorry, no offense. I don't mean to upset you, but yes, your planet is doomed right now. Okay, listen, don't worry about the beeping. The beeping's fine. It's just, it's gonna blow up soon. We just need to plug this thing into power. You wanna have something down to your house? That, you know, do you live in one of these huts around here? Take us there. We gotta move, we gotta move, move, move. Listen, bring me up to your base. You can aim it. Perfect, perfect. Now just look down the sights and fire. You're doing great, by the way. Oh, I'm proud of you. You need some more encouragement? You're, uh, that's my little G3 killer. Oh, look at you, G3 killer. The thing my horoscope said, it's all led up to this. It has to be me. I am the ultimate hero. Jesus, Harris. I will not stand idle by you. Watch your lifestyle water goes across the driveway. This is business. This is about the fate of humanity.
Where'd you go? Looks like we made it. Welcome to Blim City. Did you just warp our entire house to another planet? Yeah, keep up. We'll be safe here. Now take me outside. Whoa, whoa. You're just going to leave me here in, in what, space? Are we, are we in space? Yeah, sorry. I know you're a bit shaken up, but you'll be fine. It's better than getting enslaved by the G3. Trust me. I guess that's true. How the hell are we going to get back to Earth? Uh, we can't. That was a one-way trip. We don't have the coordinates to your planet. Then what about our parents and everyone else? Look, we left because we're trying to save them. That, that, that's why we need Gene. So, so can we please go find him? You're going out there? Into space? Yeah! Welcome to fucking space! So this is Blim City. Not not bad, huh? I don't know how we're gonna find Gene though. Let's just ask around. There's all kinds of aliens out here. Let's just let's just ask. He he is famous. Hey, we're looking for Gene Zaruthi and the bounty hunter. Any idea where he might be? Who? N no. Do you know how many freaking people live here? And you expect me to know this this guy? No. Oh no, of course not. Okay, not. Yeah, fuck it. Let's move on. Let's just go. Hey, uh, we're looking for Gene Saruthian. I'm not sure, maybe you could help? Oh, I wish I knew where he was. He owes me like 300 pesos. Huh, that doesn't sound like Gene Saruthian to me. Okay, this isn't going so well, but j let's keep asking around. We'll find something, I, I swear. Oh, oh, you don't want to talk to me? Okay, no problem. Yeah, right. Excuse me, do you have any idea where Gene Saruthian is? What? That's my name. I'm Gene Saruthian. But why would you... Oh, wait. You're probably thinking of the famous bounty hunter with the same name as me. Sorry. I'm just some loser accountant. Oh, man. Uh, okay, I guess you don't need my help. Hey, uh, excuse me. Does the bounty hunter Gene Zaruthian live around here? The bounty hunter Gene Zaruthian? <laughs> uh, you must be confused. Uh, please go. What did you mean by that? Please stop talking to me. Uh, hello? Get away! They'll take my shit! Oh my god, I it can't be! What do you want? Y you're not the famous bounty hunter Gene Zaruthian, are you? Who's asking? You're, you're really Gene. Yeah, I'm really Gene. That's me, like on the ads. Disappointed? Guess how I feel. Uh, okay, well, whoopsies. Huh. We were gonna ask for your help fighting the G3 cartel, but... Kid, do I look like I can help anyone? I just got evicted. I don't even have a goddamn home. Can can you point us in the direction of you know a, a, a bounty hunter friend that's still working, you know, still has their legs? Oh ho ho ho! Look at that nice house. God damn! Where'd I come from? 
That's a great fucking house. You see that house? Huh? Oh, yeah, I do. Yeah, th that's this hairy alien's house, the one holding me. Ah, damn. Can't stop looking at that beautiful house. Uh, okay. The gears are turning. Maybe I can help you. You can? Uh, but you just said... Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I, I said I'd help you fight the... Who, who'd you say? The, the G3 cartel? Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Come on, that's crazy, but... Okay, well, whatever, whatever. Yeah, 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 sure. We'll, we'll kill them all. Easy. <laughs> I've got a fully operational bounty suit in my cart over there. Really? Well, that's that's convenient. Yeah, I can turn that hairy kid of yours into a true blue bounty hunter. But if they die, I want the house. That's the trade. Are you sure? I, I don't think they've even fired a gun before today. And and wait, wait you, you want the house in return? Yeah, this is a great deal for you. I mean, you get all my old bounty hunter shit and I might get a house. I, I don't know. Enough talk. J just be a gun for a second. You, hairy kid, put on the suit. See how you feel. Then make a decision, yeah? I can always just pawn this shit off. Okay, g go ahead. Try it on. What choice do we have? Wow! You look great, kid! A natural! <laughs> Definitely not gonna die on your first bounty. All right, I guess we'll give it a shot, but I, I don't know about this. Ah, oh, yeah, shit. It's still in trial mode. I pawned off the activation license. The ticket should be in one of your pockets. Some loose change, too. Should be enough. Take that down to Mr. Keep's pawn shop, and he'll get you all set up. The suit will help you get there. Hey there, Gene Zaruthian. It's me, Pseudo, your helpful bounty hunting assistant. Before I enable mobility, I just need to make sure your info scanner is online. Can you go ahead and give the area a quick scan for me? Okay, perfect. Great job. I've identified your current object. Perfectimundo. Everything is in working order. Mobility unlocked. You are free to move, Gene. All right. I'll get things set up at your house while you're gone. Uh, okay, let's just head to Mr. Keeps, I guess. Ooh, oops, sorry about all those pop-ups. I forgot to warn you about that. Um, you can close them with the interact button, but they are gonna keep coming back nonstop. Uh, that's just gonna keep happening until you activate the license. Sorry, you better hurry up. You, you able to see okay? Sorry, I, I didn't expect Gene to be l like that. I, I think Mr. Keep is just ahead. You, you, you got this. What's up, freak? Jorb! Greet the customer properly. Welcome to Mr. Keep's dipshit. We're your friendly neighborhood pie shop. Buy something or don't, nobody even cares. Jorb! Oh, so old Zaruthian doesn't feel like pawning his license key anymore. What? Did he win the sweepstakes? Ha! Okay, so you want this license key. But, but it's really nice. I kind of want it for myself. You've got enough useless shit, Dad! Fine, take it! It's yours! Okay, fuck yeah! Activation license accepted. Bounty hunting suit is in perfect working order. Time for an important question. Would you like to keep me on as your permanent in-suit advisor? That was the best choice you could have made. All right, bye-bye now. I'll be back a bunch. Whoa, not bad. It's got your vital readings, armor levels, even my biometrics. Gene really came through, didn't he? I told you he'd be great. Perfect. Just what this galaxy needs. Another good-for-nothing bounty hunter. Out of my star! All right, bounty hunter. I guess let's head back to the house and check in with Gene. You'll find it. You'll figure it out. Hey, you can run, you know. You, I don't know if you do that. Try hitting the button on your screen. I, I can't say the name of the button, because I have no fucking clue what kind of controller or keyboard you're using. Perfect, guys. 
Let me tell you, Jeffrey. I'm excited. Hey! Nice house you got here. Real ritzy. Way better than my bench. Oh, wow, you really made yourself at home, huh? Oh, there you are. Who's this weirdo, and why is he setting up a fucking huge alien computer in our living room? Okay, first of all, that alien computer is a very expensive and surprisingly operational Bounty 5000. So, uh, you're welcome. A what 5000? Your kid here thinks they're gonna be a big bad bounty hunter. I set them up with some fancy equipment, so they're letting me have the house when they die. Kid? They're not my kid. I'm their sister. How old do you think I am? Listen, hairball, I don't know what kind of alien you are or how fast you age. I'm just making my best guesses here. You were only gone five minutes, and you already told some random alien he could move in with us. That's what you did. Look, I, I know it's a lot all at once, but we need him to save your species. So do you think he could... So what? We just jump into the deep end and start hunting down G3 officers or, or what? I'm not sure you're ready just yet. I mean, they don't let you fuck the glumpers at glumpies without a level four fuck pass, do they? Uh, what? I, I, I don't know. Well, they don't. Maybe I should send you out on a little test run first, eh? Uh, okay, sure. I've got just the thing. A small-time local gangster by the name of Nine Torg. She took my favorite knife. She's got an operation out in the slums. Maybe you kill her and get my knife back. <laughs> then we'll talk. Maybe take you out to Glumpy's to celebrate. All right, so we, we just head out to the slums? No, moron. You gotta use the Bounty 5000 to initiate a bounty. That's what I went through all the trouble of setting it up for. Okay, Jesus. Shit. Normally, that door would open up a gateway that lets you walk right through it. So what do we do? Calm down. The bounty's right here in Blim. You mind just heading out on foot? The slums gateway ain't too far from here. I'll get the Bounty 5000 all fixed up while you're gone. Yeah, sure. All right, l let's go, Bounty Hunter. Don't forget to get my knife! We're looking for the gateway to the slums, I guess. Look, it shouldn't be too far. L listen, just follow the waypoint. That's why you're wearing that fancy suit, isn't it? I mean, it's, it's got the augmented reality thing on it, right? Hello, citizens. I'm Blim City Magistrate Clug Nugman, and I have heard your rates are on the rise. The city's water supply has clearly been... Hey, don't even think about going down to the slums. Yeah. This is a maintenance-only chef, so scram! Hey, uh, Kit, uh, excuse me, can we get our, uh, uh, we need to make our way into the slums, please? No. Hold on! So you really want to get into the slums, huh? Then shed a little bet for oh, us. Come on, come on, don't, 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 don't make him answer this, no, man. No, I want to know! It's fine, we'll, we'll help. Okay, great. If you saw us at the bar, which of us would you ask out? Uh, the blue guy. Exactly. That's what I figured you'd say. Yeah, everyone always says him. Hey, don't feel bad, man. You're still plenty hot. I'm just hotter. Blue's a hotter color. That's that's science. I know. I know. I know. I just I just wish one time someone would say I'm hotter. You know, I put so much work in. I watched all those skin care tutorials, and I got surgery, so I don't have to poop anymore. That's your problem. It should be effortless. Everyone can sense all that desperation, all the sadness, just radiating me i'm just true blue all natural hot baby is it true am I, am I just really a lost cause be honest well hold on we take it back the red one's actually hotter what are you fucking with me oh my god thank you i i am so happy i i, I really feel like i'm gonna cry right now hey you can't change your mind like that it's unfair and it's also stupid because i'm way hotter you just made a lifelong enemy pal hop in and out of the slums at your leisure it's on me I, I'm just so grateful you think I'm, I'm hotter. You know what? Please, please use my door. Use my door anytime you want. Are you serious? That is fucking amazing. Thank you. Wow. Yeah, well, you can't use my door, that's for sure. Dream on! You just lost any chance of it. I think we handled that as best we could, you know? I've never been topside. Oh, Lord. 
Oh, it's a top site. Hey, oh my god, I'm not interested in coming down that pipe. Well, okay. well. Sorry to hear <laughs> Look that. What we got here? Fresh meat. Hey there, fresh meat. Welcome to the slums, fresh meat. <laughs> oh boy, here we go. Fucking kid. What's wrong, fresh meat? You scared of a little kid? Eh, yeah, I'm a little kid. Look at me. Look at me. Eh, you're scared of me? Oh, I'm scary. Not. <laughs> well, maybe I am. <laughs> Look at me, I'm scary. No, we just... Whoa, 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 what are you doing? Come on, he's just a kid. D don't shoot him. Oh, you don't want to shoot me just because your gun said not to. Just because you're your little gun. Oh, but you look, look how shootable I look. I look so shootable. I am not shooting a kid. Go ahead, do it. Shoot me, fresh meat. Shoot me. See what happens. Oh, don't I look... Ah, you shot me, I'm dead. Eh. All right there, are you happy now? Well, I, I didn't think we'd be allowed to kill him. Yeah, normally, killing children in games isn't isn't allowed, but he's dead. We killed this kid. Are, are you happy now? We killed the kid. The kid is citizen. dead now. You They're... are wearing an unregistered bounty Shit. suit. Shit, we gotta Prepare take down these drones. Die. Finally happened. Someone killed my son. Y your son? Yep. The kid up there who always calls everyone fresh meat. We are so sorry. Listen, don't get used to that. We're not killing any more kids. I'm drawing the line, so savor it. Enjoy it. It happened. Tuck it away in the old memory book. No, it's fine. He was 30 years old, so don't feel too bad. 30 years old is still adolescence for our species, but it's not as bad as shooting like a five-year-old or something. So don't worry, you just did regular murder. And I warned him over and over. I said, don't sit up there calling strangers fresh meat or some gun-toting psychopath is gonna shoot you dead in cold blood. And you went and did it. Good for you. Anyway, please just leave me to mourn. Jesus. Hey, you can't pass through here. It's Nine Torg's turf. Jesus, enough with everyone getting in our way. We just want to kill Nine Torg. Yeah, right. You kill Nine Torg. Get lost, shit heel. Hey, what are you doing? You can't do that. What the fuck? Holy shit! You just killed Jason. Jason's dead. Oh shit! Here we go. We're gonna have to kill some of these Torg foot soldiers to prove ourselves around here. These people think we're weak. Not on my watch. What are you? Some kind of bounty hunter? The slums are full, asshole. Yeah, this is Nine Torg's turf. The coolest turf. Shit, they're shooting at us. Come shoot back. Come on, shoot back. It's gonna be so easy to kill you. Nine Torg trained us real good. We're the toughest enemies in the game, I think. I wanted a man to die, okay, but I don't even know. You've been squished! I'm losing blood. Oh. Wow, all right. You, we got them all. You, usually these Torgs aren't so hostile. Something must be going on. L let's look around for somebody who can help us. I'm so lonely over here. I got all this great information I could share. I'm just sitting here, fishing away, waiting for someone to come over and ask me stuff. I'm just gonna whistle to myself for a bit now, till someone talks to me. Hello there, friend. Can I help you? Uh, you're a wise old fisherman. Can you tell us a little bit about Nine Torg? Quiet. She's got ears everywhere. Or antennae. Whatever ants here with. Is she really that dangerous? Come on. I mean, she's just one gang lord. Just one? <laughs> what about the other eight Torgs? Wait, so the Nine and Nine Torg is... It's a counter? There's Nine Torgs? Nine clones, yep. And that's just what's left. There used to be even more of them, but they always kill each other. Fighting for dominance over what? This hellhole? <laughs> This month, nine Torgs in charge. Last month, it was 14 Torg before they killed her. Now, nine Torgs fighting with five Torg. It never ends. Which one do you prefer? Uh, eight Torg is the hottest. 
Do you know how we can get to Nine Torg? Buddy, all I know is fish, and I barely know fish. But let's just pretend there's a laundromat you can sneak through to get to Sludge Works over there. Are we pretending, or is there really a laundromat? Come on, kid, take the hint. Either we're pretending, or Nine Torg's goons kill me for squealing. Okay, I got it. We're pretending. Oh, Christ, just follow that path along the sludge. Hey, thanks for the info, uh, wise fisherman. We'll see you later. Have a good day now. Oh, hey, you want to see a cool party trick I used to do? Aim me at those platforms. Come on, come on, give it a shot. It'll be fun. Fuck yeah, I told you. Did you see how fun that was? I call it my glob shot. It comes out of my trick hole. All Gatlians have a different kind of trick hole. My, mine does this. Boy, you are... They aren't... Yes! Yes! Oh, oh. Oh, I could do this all day. That doesn't this fucking rule? God, I love... Glob's... We can't open those yet. We're, we're gonna need something sharp. Hold up, don't shoot. I, I got an idea. It's another trick up my little slimy sleeve. Try hitting him with my glob shot. Take your time. You're gonna kill us now. Oh. Whoa, perfect shot. You fucking nailed it. How sick was that? Whew, okay. I gotta recharge. It doesn't take too long, but it's a little longer when there's enemies nearby. You know, my, my, my body gets too tense. It's, it's like trying to piss when someone's watching, you know? Shot takes a little longer to recharge when we're in combat. My, my body's all tense during a fight. You know, it's like my muscles aren't loose. It just is, oh, it takes longer to recharge. Oh, God. This is exactly what I was afraid of. Exterminated. I thought we were strong, right? We might have went off. Are we? We're a little. I feel like we might just be like really weak enemies, like just the ones they put at the beginning. Please, please don't kill me, please! You shot it! It looks like he was die clean only. Hey, careful with the merchant! Whoa, whoa, hold up a bit. Let's listen. Up and everything. They're gonna be here any minute. Just, just patient. Oi, fuck you! I'm sick of this! I wanna tear through someone's guts! Oh, I think they're talking about Jean's knife. Ah, fuck you! Got it, freak. 
We've had enough of your bullshit. Yeah, it's your fault Stevulax is dead. I was in love with him. Did you know that? I loved him, and now his head's cut off. Just the way it should be. Fuck him. Hey, guess what? I have another secret trick you can use. The power of negotiation. Let's try reasoning with these guys. Knock on the door. Tell me how oh, you want to play this. Fuck you, insufferable fucking cunts. When I'm loot. Uh, who's there? Who are you? Uh, hey. Hello there, friends. Oh, I, I think it's the buyer. Hey, are you the buyer? No, it's me, your lover, Stebulax. I'm back from the dead. What? Oh my god, baby! You're alive! Your, your voice sounds different, though. Let's play along. No shooting. Wait. You're not my dead lover, Stebulax. You're just a person. Oh, what a good trick. You tricked me. Nice job. <laughs> they told us this buyer was a real prankster. Oh, you. Come on. That was pretty fucked up. That joke is gonna fuck me up. <laughs> you got him good. Okay, though, but enough of that. Uh, let's show them the product. All right, here's the product. A genuine talking knife. I gotta be honest with you. He's a real piece of shit. He's extremely violent. He basically only talks about wanting to kill people in very disturbing ways. Fuck you. I'm gonna carve out your anal cavity. Gonna make it three times as big. Your shit's just gonna drop right out of there. <laughs> See what I'm talking about? Oh, uh, perfect. That's exactly what we're looking for. Yeah, yeah, great. Go ahead. Oh, fuck yes. Thank you. Pleased to meet you. I'm Knifey. Now use me, use me. Let me fucking stab this. Oh, fuck. Yes, fuck yes! More, more! I need more stabbing! Hey you, listen! Point me at your raw, fleshy little tummy and jab me right into there! Let's get all those guts torn up! Let's see that fucking red goop spill out! I can't stop now! Oh, uh, that's a pass for us! Is this really the knife Gene was talking about? Gene? Did you just say Gene? Okay, change of plans. Bring me to Gene! So I can fucking decapitate him! Wait, what? Why? He sent us to rescue you! Oh, that's rich. There's no way I'm forgiving him, though, for leaving me with that fucking Nine Torg. He's dead to me! Huh? You know Nine Torg? We're trying to kill her! Oh, perfect! Finally, we're on the same page! Let's kill Nine Torg, then Gene! Okay, definitely Nine Torg, but l l let's put a pin in the, the whole Gene thing. H how do we get out of here? With my tether ability! I'm more than just a knife, you racist! I can tether too! Look up and latch on! Here, there we go! Fucking cool, right? You gotta use me to swing across this sludge. Oh, fuck yeah! Not as good as stabbing, but still pretty good. Well, all right. Where, where to next? The sludge works processing plant. Nine Torg was talking about some traitor she had to deal with. Probably another one of her clones. Five Torg or six Torg or whatever. I don't know. There's too many now. There's too many Torgs. How many clones are there? Who the fuck cares? Stop thinking so hard and just look for the big sludge work sign. I wanna stab somebody. Oh, a lug locks! Use me! I can open those fuckers up real good! And there's loot inside for you too! Win win! So you, um. Gene gave you the Nine Tour? Cave? Try gamble me away in a game of space poker? That sack of shit? Can't wait to stab all three of his fucking eyes. Even the wonky one. Especially the wonky one. Hate that one. Oh, they look stabbable. Use me on them. Oh, yes! Oh, do this every time! Never fire your Gatlian again! Please, just use me for killing now. Making a knife for you only any percent run. some Gatorall. That, 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 that'll fill me. Whoa! Thank Jesus. Okay, feed me that Gatorall, baby. Come on, put it in my little mouth. I'm trying to edge mama, mommy. Uh, that's the stuff. Sludge works. Nine Torch should be here. Arms at the ready, man. 
the legendary and killer approaches, and they've obtained the fearsome knife of death. Oh, brother! Fight, my end brethren! Fight for your lives and avenge our fallen! Get the hell headed this way! There's so many. We're gonna keep coming. We really don't need to put up with your bullshit. You ready, bounty hunter? The ant killer is soaked in the fluids of our brethren, but they can't scare us. Keep shooting them while they're in the air. You can juggle them, and it does more damage, and it looks cool too. You know what? No, we're all gonna die. Not sure why, we're still fighting, but let's just keep going until we all get killed, cause why not? I always hated Alien Ant Farm. Oh, I'm in my... We're ants. Shot every now and again, you know. Brethren, but they shed scare us. Protect night or Ah, let's ride this way. Come on, kill. Kill, yes, yes, kill, kill, murder. This is no game, you know. Ooh, okay, I'm not sure what came over me there. I think I got caught up in the moment or something, but hey, good work, team. Let's go get Nine Torque. Is that nine Torg talking? Fuck off! I've always said you were the worst Torg! You know, seven Torg said the same thing. Right before I killed her. Damn you! And you're next. You got this! Sludge, stay in the air. <laughs> Better not fall in. 
Hey, I'm still here. You can still use me if you want. I can deflect attacks. Did you know that? I'm not just all about stabbing. Well, I'm mostly all about stabbing and tethering, but I can also deflect attacks. I'll slice in the fucking dead. I'll cut their fucking heads off. I'll fucking, I'll rip their limbs. I'll fucking do everything. Oh, I'm gonna fucking cut right into them. I'll cut their fucking asshole off and eat it. That clearly hurts. No, would you just die already? Nice work killing nine torque. Thanks. Wow, we killed a bounty. How do you feel, bounty hunter? I, I feel pretty good. I, I, I really didn't know if we'd be able to pull it off. All right, it's time. Time for what? Time to carve out a piece of it. I'm thinking we go with a full slab of thigh meat, but si Oh, God, I can't look. I can't. I can't. She's a gusher. Couldn't we have just taken, like, a fingernail, some spit, uh, maybe a blood sample? Yeah, sure. Could have, I guess. Hey, I'm Five Torg. Thank you for killing my evil clone. I don't mind if you mutilate her corpse, really. It's fine. You did such a good job. That was, like, off the hook. You're not gonna take over and end up being just as evil as Nine Torg, right? Oh, don't worry. Things are gonna be a lot different around here. So, no more crime then? Oh, not that different then. Technically, all of us Torgs are evil clones, so I'm still gonna do a bunch of crime. But we're cool. Huh. Far as I'm concerned, you're a friend of the Torg family and welcome here anytime. An honorary Torg. You can be 10 Torg. Now, if you'll excuse me, my day just became very full. Are you gonna be okay if we just kind of leave you hanging up there? Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, I can get down just fine. Hanging from ropes feels nice for my species. Hey, it's good for our backs. I'm, I'm actually the one who put myself here. Thanks for the rescue. Uh, don't mind me, I'm just gonna hang here for a bit. Yeah, next time you come back, I'll be off being really busy running everything and, you know, doing stuff. Ah! Well, hey, hey, what are you doing? Ah, ah, I can't feel that, you know. Ah, I never should've let you be an honorary torg. Oh. One is ten torg. Stop it! Oh, come on, that hurt. Actually, this is pretty spot on torg behavior. Yeah, I made the right call. Oh, fuck! Cut it out! You don't want three torg in charge. Trust me, they're still a Nice! We killed another boss. I I, I think like a, a bonus secret boss. G good work.
All right, let's go home and turn in our first bounty. Hey, you know, that was some pretty solid bounty hunting back there. I mean, I mean don't don't get too cocky about it or anything, but it was pretty cool. Yeah, not bad. That was some good killing. And I'm somewhat of a killing expert, actually. I can't wait to see Gene's face when he sees we pulled this off. Let's head back up through the slums tunnel. Hey, you thought you'd be on the torch, huh? Well, you'll never be me! Just one of them? Easy. Done. Get him. I don't know why that guy even bothered attacking us. I almost feel bad. You know, feel free to keep exploring, but whenever you're ready, we just got to go through the tunnel that we ca came here in. You know, that tunnel? What's that sign? I don't care. I just want to stab it. Gagging, take me to Gene and let's stab him in the gut. Wow. Ow, I know this is hurting you too, so get the fuck out of this shit. Christopher Walken? Hey, I'm walking here. This is New York City. Yeah, pretty good, right? Ah, oh, the translator, my Chris. We're thinking about two different people, but same kind of thing, same kind of idea. Oh, you're back. Hey, yeah, my leg's still very broken. Time in the slums. Come visit any time. Just don't Fires talk to this me. This time making them far, far hornier than ever. However, there's something you plaguing our city again. far Let's worse than any of those issues. Cold, hard drugs. These figures don't lie. However, things don't have to be this way. As chancellor, under my five-year plan, all drugs will be eradicated. And that's the Klugnugman promise. Thanks to our new Keep Blim City Clean initiative, we've managed to keep drugs like Huh, why is the door closed? Who is it? You got my munch dash delivery? What? No, it's us! Oh shit, really? Good job! Oh, hold on! Is that Jane? Okay, get ready. I want you to stab me right into his fat little belly. What the hell, Gene? He installed new locks because he assumed you'd get killed. He keeps saying it's his house now. What? No. I just took the liberty of upgrading your security. Did you really kill Nine Talk, though? Yeah, we actually did. Well, well, well. Didn't think you had it in you. I'm really blown away. I'll be honest with you. I expected you to die. Oh, thank you. So, what did it feel like, killing Nine Torg? Look, I gotta be honest, it felt good. It felt great. I mean... Hey, Gene, lift up that shirt and expose your soft little belly for me. I'm coming in hot. Yes. 
Forgot how psycho he was. Why don't you just, uh, hold on to him for now? Oh, sure, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll keep him far away from you. Yeah, thanks. Now, uh, go turn in your bounty at the Bounty 5000. I got it all set up for you. No, seriously, let me stab him. Ah! What the fuck? You don't have to do everything the fucking UI tells you to do? Yeah, fuck yeah. Fuck you, Gene, you piece of shit. Oh, shit, sorry. It's fine. I've lived through worse. Okay, he's tough. Let's try again later then. Well, there you go. You're a real bounty hunter now. Huh, would you look at that? I, I guess we're really doing it. Yeah, I didn't expect you to get your footing so quick. I don't even have any leads on any G3 bounties. You're, uh, serious about going after them, huh? You bet. We'll, we'll take them all down, including Garmantuous. Well, you're welcome to try, and if you do, you might want to go to the pawn shop and buy back the Dodge unit I pawned off. Forgot to tell you about it. Go scrounge up some pesos and buy that, or whatever else tickles your fancy. I'll have some G3 bounties ready for you by the time you get back. Sure, sounds good. Thanks, Gene. Just maybe next time don't assume we're just gonna die. Right. Got it. All right, let's do a cooldown lap. Uh, Gene said you might have the old Dodge unit that goes with this bounty suit. Oh, yeah, we got that. Why? You want it? I want it, too. So it'll cost you. Uh, yeah, yeah, no, we, we know how buying... All so... right, there you go. One Dodge unit. Have a nice life. All right, we got it. L let's try this bad boy out and then head back to Gene. Took you long enough. The concrete I poured's dry now. by telling me you're gonna do a prank. Whoopsies, my bad, hanging up. Okay, I'm not so good at this. I'm not having a good time, this is a bad episode. This one's really fucking going down the drain. All right, let's try another freaking silly ass prank call, prank phone call. Ring, 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 ring. Hey, uh, how you doing? Hey, I'm the prank phone call guy from TV, Jimmy, Jimmy Gooster. Don't pull a muscle, bounty hunter, Jesus. Okay, great. You got the Dodge unit. So how about it? Think you're ready for the big leagues, kid? What, what do you mean? The big league. The G3 cartel. That's the next step. Taking down their head officers. Okay, um, are you, are you positive that we're ready for that? Yeah, whatever. Might, might as well try. But they won't be pushovers like Nine Torg, so, uh... Well, to be honest, I don't care if you live or die. You know that. You know my whole deal. But, uh, hey, it's your funeral. So go check out the Bounty 5000 whenever you're ready. Myself. Got two G3 leads for you right now. Krubus and Douglas. You can pick which one you want to let kill you first. You're crazy, you know that? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe that's what I like about you so much. Ugh. So you're gonna go to the party this weekend? <laughs> okay. All right. Okay. Yeah, sure.
Zephyr Paradise. Gorgeous, huh? Howdy! I'm Quentin the Grantin! Welcome to Zephyr Paradise! Oh shit! A G3 Grantin! Okay, now the cartel knows we're here. Wow, they only brought me here a couple of times. Looks like they haven't ruined this part of the jungle yet. Listen, if any part of you is feeling bad about killing these little mites, don't. Uh, leading scientists looked into it and uh, they, they, they have no feelings. They, you know, they're just like, I don't know, what do you have on your planet? Like fish? Did that, did that translate right? Translator microbes. We're gonna kill you, you fucking mites! Here we go, got them open for ya! Sanitary and, and it hurts like fuck. Oh, these things. Okay, do you know what fan plants are? You shoot the little bud and then the, the thing does. Okay, yeah, you, you figured it out. I can't hear you, I'm heading into a tunnel. No, I'm just kidding, just some uh, cell phone humor, just to lighten the mood, you know? Oh, a Fergal den. Oh man, you, you, you know, you actually have a lot in common with these guys, you know, aside from all the hair, you know, you're both being sold as drugs to, for aliens to get a high off of, you know? You guys are, uh, it's, it's like you're almost related in a way, you know, if you think about it. Jeez, I didn't want to embarrass them back there, but that tunnel reeks of Fergal shit.
Well, hey, good work. You know, we made a great team, huh? I didn't want to admit it at first, but fine. You know, you got me. We, 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 we're good together here. This is great. G3. They enslaved our whole village. I don't know what to do. I think we can help. Really? Thank you. It sucks so much watching everyone you know getting enslaved. I get it. You're not gonna help us, are you? I got an idea. Tr try launching that Merc with the fan plant. Oh, look at him go. Fuck off. Okay, shit, that village is swarming with cartel guys. How, how, how do you want to deal with this?
worn those jumpy shoes. Rescue some guys? Hey, listen, guys, we, we got you. You're free now. Go be free. Welcome, welcome. We are Moplets, native to this planet. Our tribe is forever in your debt. Our leader would like to speak with you. Oh, okay, sure. Hello there, savior. My people were enslaved by the G3 and forced to desecrate the land mining for Fergals. You may have freed this small tribe, but our brethren underground are still being worked to death by Krubis. Krubis? You know, we're actually looking for him to kill? What's this? You aim to take down Krubis of the G3? You are truly a hero to Moplets everywhere. Yeah, yeah, sure. Uh, where is he? We'll, we'll get rid of him for you. Hmm. That's difficult to answer. His work, though evil, keeps him very busy. He oversees many different mines across Zephyr, and it's impossible to predict where he may be on any given day. My liege, what about the man in the mansion? Ah, of course. A brilliant plan. My advisor is right. There's a man nearby who knows Krubis and has access to a warp device. We may be able to use him. He lives in a mansion across the river. If you could get your hands on his warp device, that could be very useful. Okay, sure. A guy in a mansion. Th 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 that's the plan? Yes. He would appear to be our best chance. Godspeed, Savior. What's the guy in the mansion like? Oh, his name is Ranchi Delarma. He warped in not too long ago. Seems to be old acquaintances with Krubis. We haven't dealt with him much, but he seems to have a penchant for Fergals. Oh, God, he's a drug addict. Nonetheless, we may be able to use that to our advantage. He does have close ties with Krubis, after all. And he seems a bit disoriented. Right, because of the drugs. A and he's evil still, right? Well, yes, he's evil, so it should be morally just. Yes, let's all just agree right now that it's morally just to manipulate him. I love it when we can agree. Hey, thanks for your help. Very well. Godspeed, saviors.
Hey, somebody warped in over here. I bet we can cross now. You're the one who fucked up the coordinates. Hey, fuck you! The river! Yeah, fuck you! Whew, that was some good old-fashioned conflict mediation. More G3. No, I'm not G3. I quit. I'm a designer. I was just flying around here trying to make new friends. Oh, that's cool. But, you know, listen, we're busy. Oh, don't worry. I won't be too much of a bother. Whoa, nice try, but I'm too fast for you. Shit, this guy won't stop. It's nice out today, I'd say, you know. Sometimes there's storms that get destroyed. Well, oh, look at you go! You're really flying! You're trying to copy me! <laughs> I bet you want to be just like me because I'm so cool! Well, tough luck! I'm the only me! Don't try to be me! Hey, fuck you! <laughs> Why well, do you really want to shoot me, huh? Oh, it's a nightmare. But I died. No. Did you know that I, I used to work? Actually, I used to work for the G3. <laughs> Can you believe that? Yeah, and I, I deserted it, obviously. And uh, there's a, there's a death warrant out for me. I'm fine with it. I'm fine with it because I'm happier. Thought I could take care of the little Fergals around my, my site. Fed them and clothe them. Room when they make mistakes. And you're oh. Oh, baby can't shoot, baby can sniff in their shots. <laughs> Just messing with you. I've given you a hard time. I'm sure you'll get it. Does he ever shut up? She always would say that about me. You're not good. As if my three hearts couldn't have goodness in them. I don't even want to get started on her. You have no idea what it's like to have a... Ha ha, yeah, keep trying to shoot me. This is fun. All I ever wanted to be was a jungle seamstress. I wanted to grab the purple... My, 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 you're zipping on my. So anyway, I wanted to grab the purple trees and... Haba, haba. Quite the landing. That's not your first time on a zip line, is it? Oh, oh he hello. You gotta stop by. I got a store. I got a store. I'm so glad you actually came to buy something. taken.
Louis, check out this mansion. How much do you think it costs to maintain a place like this, you know? Yeah. Oh, hey, you made it. You got my fresh Fergals. What? Yeah, this is the guy we're looking for. Come on, come on. Come on. Huh, I don't see a warp device on you. Oh, come on, is Krubus making you hoof it around on foot? Oh, that cheapskate bastard. Same old Krubus. I'm telling you, man. <laughs> Here, I got an extra. Don't let anyone ever tell you Ranchi's not a generous fella, okay? There's an unused warp disc in there, too. You know, warp in whatever's on there. I don't care. It's free of charge. There's a river near here. You can probably cross with it. Oh, man, go nuts. <laughs> you warpaholics. <laughs> wow, th thank you. Hey, hey, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Lean in close. Get close to me, man. I'm sure Krubus told you I'm here on Zephyr to break ground on a new Delarmo Land Resort. Yeah, I'm that ranchy Delarmo, CEO, Delarmo Industries. This one's gonna be even better than the one on Glassport 12. Trust me, man. That guy's busy as shit, always hopping from site to site. He's got like 30 different mines all across Zephyr. You think I can keep track of that? Hello, oh, we, 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 okay, we were well, supposed hey, to get that warp device problem. from him. Okay, yeah, bye, I guess. Jesus. Ah, uh, now, where was I? Ah, uh, shit, what was I talking about? That guy's busy as shit, always hopping from site to site. He's got, like, 30 different mines all across Zephyr. You think I can keep track of that? Fuck! I see him when I see him. All right, oh, okay, yeah, we got sure. a warp device. Um, you know, that's gonna be helpful. Off, Why don't we use it to cross this river so we can go talk to the Moplets and check in with them? Yeah, let's go into the toxic shit. What do, what, what, what do we get? Looks like they're working on fixing this portal. You know, hey, maybe we can use it later, you know? Okay, uh, let's use this warp device Ranchy gave us to cross the river, huh? Hey there, it's me, Pseudo. I'm back. Uh, looks like you're trying to use that new warp device you just got. You want me? Archives. Even AI can jack off. 
Shit, on, nice work. Hey, you know, we can use this space as a bridge. Huh? You want I should just disappear all this fucking traffic? You want to hey, check in with the mob the leader? Because, hey, you know, shit, that's kind of what we're supposed to do right now. Fuck you. Hey, both of you. Shut the fuck up. I'm going to be fine. Knew they'd be cool. How was the man in the mansion? R Ranchy? Yeah, that guy has serious problems, but he gave us this warp device. By the gods, you've done it. You got the warp device. This might actually work. You continue to provide us with hope, Grand Savior. With this warp device, you can warp Krubus directly to you. How fortuitous. But alas, you'll need his coordinates and a blank warp disk to encode them onto. Hmm. Oh well, no way you're getting those. That stuff's in the mines. We could just go down there and get it right now. Oh, right. Take this access code and head down to the mines. Everything you need is there. Okay, perfect. Thank you. You know, you, you guys figured out that whole plan for us. You know, that really means a lot. You know, it clears things up for, for us, you know, anyway. Yep, uh, we'll, we'll get it done. Please do not let us down. All right, jeez. And you are bored. Thank you. Very, very rude. All right, let's use the passcode and get in. Nice. Jeez, are the G3 even trying to domesticate the local mites? trouble. Uh, may maybe they'll sort this out themselves. That's for Gatlas. Is this the entrance to the mines? Jesus, they really fucked this place up. I didn't know it had gotten this bad. These guys just don't let up, do they? Oh shit, Grintons. Gotta be honest, uh, you know, they're, they're working for the G3, but still better than our friend from earlier. Don't fuck with us! Should have joined up with the bad guys. Who wants 
week, you know? Now let's try that elevator. This should take us down into the mines. Going down, huh? Sorry, I, I almost made a crest joke, but I'm, I'm gonna save it. I'm gonna save it. We're better than that. No crest jokes from me. That's a promise. Not from me, anyways. You might warp in some bases, and Lord only knows, but, you know, from me over here as a gun, character, sidekick, no crest jokes. 100% on the level with you and no bad stuff. Fuck, it stopped?
forget, we're looking for a blank warp ticket and some way to find out where Krubus is. Let's get to work. Let's give him a glob shot. Right out of my trick hole. Fine machine kill that bully. One less G3. Just a bit outside. Oh shit, oh shit, 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 shit. Take any breaks. Thank you. I wonder what the G3 are going to use that money for. Your purchase today will make our G3 overlords a very happy. Attention, mining operation 12C. It's me, Krubus. Speed things up! I'm fucking underwater here trying to keep things on schedule. And I figured, maybe you forgot that if you piss me off, I will kill you. It's really easy to find more slaves. Look, just do your job and mine more Fergos. Crew is out. Holy shit. Hey, he's got a Gatlion. We, we gotta rescue it. Okay, yeah, there's no way we're getting past that laser grid. There's got to be some some way to shut it off somewhere around here. Mining Operation 12C. This is Krubus again. One of you weird moplet fucks just delivered me a... Hi. Oh, so soon. Must have remembered something you needed. Better to live on my knees than die on my feet. That's what I always say. I mean, the other way. All right. Dead, right. Uh, all the other moplets. One of you weird moplet fucks just delivered me a batch of defective Fergals. You want to know how I know they're defective? Because they're fucking dead. Most of them got crushed in a cave in and I punished the mob that's responsible, but it looks like they died in the cave. Sorry, I 
didn't see you there. I'm Helen. I just need to know, are you the new hire or the new boss? Uh, as a matter of fact, um, I, I am. I am the new boss. Absolutely. Yeah, right. You're not, honey. <laughs> That's funny, though. I like it when the new hires have a sense of humor. <laughs> Let's get y'all set up. Head on into the next room and find a place to work. Go on without me. I haven't left this chair in years, and I don't plan... Oh, thank God they're here. Hey, you must be the new office clerk, right? Just sort through that paperwork for us. We're so small. Uh, sure. Uh, yes. I will see what I can do. Oh, jeez. Okay, this is more paperwork than I anticipated. All right, better get to work. We still good for Hyper Feast later? What time did you say again? Uh, Zorg. Oh yeah, Zorg totally works. Hey newbie, you know Hyper Feast? They create new life in front of you and you get to eat it alive? Shit's wild, man. Hyper Feast. <laughs> See you there, girlfriend. You're my girlfriend. We're dating. Oh my god, I'm going insane. I'm going fucking nuts. What? Yeah, I, uh, God, I think my brain's breaking. I, I think doing this job is making my brain break completely. Oh, yeah, me too. Me too. It's and you don't, done, finally! You don't mind your brain breaking? Well, you don't mind the, this fucking monotonous nightmare work? No, no, it's nice. It's cool to just give in to a broken brain. I can't do math anymore. And if I stay here another year, I think I'll forget how to say three-syllable words. Okay, that honestly doesn't sound so bad. It's not bad. It's terrific. Fantastic. Amazing. Three words I won't be able to say next year, so savor them now. Oh, buddy, I will. You know, I, I kind of don't mind this at all. Ow, paper cut! Uh, just kidding, huh? <laughs> It would have been you. You would have been the one to get hey, the paper cut. What time did we say for Hyper Feast again? <sighs> Don't you listen to anything? We said door. All in a day's work. Glad we got that all done. There, are, there definitely is not going to be a third stack. Ah, uh, the cold sting of irony. Is is that ironic? I, I never really know. We said door. Zorg. Ah, right, right. Damn. I just remembered I had something going on at Zorg. Holy shit, I, I'm, I'm gonna blow my fucking brains out. What? Oh, I didn't see you there. Do you, do you still sit here? That's so funny. Yeah, this is still my spot. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. It does, it does, yeah. I, I, I think if I if I sit back down at my desk, my soul is just gonna leave my body. Okay, well, I've got work to do. Yeah, I know, me too. I, I have to do all this fucking work. This is the whole fucking problem, man. Look, just because we used to be married doesn't mean you can keep leaning on me to work through your issues. That was one night. We got oh, okay, we're done. No more paperwork. Did you hear me? I said no more paperwork. Not even a fourth stack. Okay, good. God damn, you filled out those papers like a son of a bitch. Like a real bitch you are. Fuck you, you're, you're promoted. You're free to go into Krubus's office. Why? Because fuck you. That's why I don't need a fucking reason. I'm boss McBossington. And I'll be in here jerking off or whatever. Fucking other stuff too. I don't, I don't give a shit. Huh, so this must be Krubus's office. There's gotta be something here we can use. Wait, I feel like we missed something in there, you know? Look, I know it seems hard to find out where Krubus is, but you can do this. You know, you can find it. It's not, it's not like there's that many things in here. Krubus, where are you? This is Garmantuous. I just checked the log and you're three days behind schedule with the latest shipment. But you know what? It's not that big of a fucking deal. These Fergals aren't going to be worth shit now that we discovered humans. Might even have to shut this whole operation down just to get all hands on deck over on Earth. I can give your territory to the Screndel brothers and have them expand their facilities to find out more about these humans. Oh, have you tried one of these fuckers yet? Oh, God, the high? It's otherworldly. Can't believe a species like this really exists. Humans! <laughs> even thought. Anyway, don't fuck up again, even if it doesn't matter, or I'll smoke you myself. Oh, would you look at that? He, he marked his coordinates on the calendar. Shit. All right, now we just need a blank warp disk to encode this on. Shit! 
What's up, fuckers? It's me, Krubus again. Someone filled out the wrong shipping destination on an entire stack of Form 40 Qs. You fucked up my whole day when you did that. Just come forward and tell me whose fault it was. I wish I could promise you I won't kill you, but I'm definitely gonna kill you! Careful! Hey, it's Krubus again. Just bored this time. I've been staring at the paperwork all fucking day and my brains melt. I, I fucking hate paperwork. Why the fuck does God mad to us always stick me with the... Doesn't he know I have fucking drills for hands? For one thing, that means I should be drilling. And for another... Another, it means I, I I keep shredding all this important fucking paperwork. Mining Operation 12C. This is Krubus again. According to all the hot monitors we forcibly implanted in all you mobs, you're working at eight percent less efficiency today than you were yesterday. Three. Fuck you! Don't do that. Work harder. We got a lot of Fergus to mine, and if you want to keep up with the next week's shipment, and yeah, we'd probably have an easier time hitting quota if I didn't smoke so many of the Fergus, but fuck you! I'm the boss! Yo, Krubus again. Just complaining this time. Did you hear about these new humans? Everyone's saying Fergus are gonna be old at soon. Nobody's gonna wanna smoke Fergus. Captors, but uh, um, we do not know <gasps> what to do. Hey, listen, we're here to help. What, 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 what's going on? Uh, don't, don't get me in trouble. No, no, it's okay. We're <laughs> friends. We, we hate the G3 too. Oh, wonderful. Thank God. <sighs> listen, we're looking for a blank warp disk. Do, do you have any ideas? Ah, uh, yes. Our prince has a stash of them. Really? All you need to do is clear out the warp base the G3 plopped down in our holy land. Then you'll reclaim the sacred grounds and rest <clears throat> Prince Chosen One. And then he'll give us a blank disc? Yes, so oh, yes, we, we can help each other. <gasps> oh, what a fortuitous happenstance. Oh. 
to rescue a prince you know I'm a, I'm a little nervous you know I, I hope he lives up to the hype hey listen when is a prince ever let anyone down you know what I mean oh shit this must be the place okay let's clear it out Outside and use this to reverse the warp. appropriate and what the hell do you want jeez it jeez we, we just saved you you know maybe you could be a little grateful saved me from what i'm fine look we were told you had some sort of blank warp disc huh yeah 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 sure i've got a bunch okay we got everything we need let's get back to ranchy's place and see if he you know can help us encode them onto this machine Prince Chosen One has returned! All has been restored! Prince Chosen One, I am so sorry, but we're out of Pagorsh. Can I enter here? We're back. Let's let's head inside. Hey, uh, you're back. Ah, oh, thank God. Thank fucking God. Uh, did you bring my Fergal? Uh, I need a bed. Uh, I need my fix, kid. Oh, I need a bed. I need it real bad. Oh Jesus Christ, man. Hey, are you all right? Uh, are you are you having a heart attack or or? Is it, is it Fergal withdrawals? Does that make you happy? Oh, you love that, don't you? You love to see a uh, master of industry all flummoxed like this, all low and... Uh, yeah, maybe. Maybe. Uh -huh. uh, maybe this is a bad time, but could we use your disk encoder real quick? What? No! The encoder is off limits until I get my goddamn Fergal fix. F 
Virgils. Get him. Hurry. 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 Uh, hey, tell you what, we're gonna go ahead and use the disc encoder while you're sort of uh, stuck on the ground like that, doing whatever it is you're doing. So don't be mad at us. All right, looks like it's working. Oh, oh, I'm in a bad spot. All right, there we go. Time to warp in Krubus and then so you know good. kill him if if if, if we're oh. able to. Y you ready? Please, get me Burgles. Hey, I've got a crazy idea. What if we just swap out this mansion for Krubus's base? Who the fuck are you? We'll all be damned. We found Krubus officially. Hey, come down here, asshole! No, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey. Where you going, you rude jag off? I was dark in here! doesn't end soon, because if it does, I gotta go back to doing my pickle work. Now, honestly, I do appreciate the break. You know, it's all paperwork, it's scheduling, day in and day out, but I'm more suited to fucking up some intruders like you. Boom! Boom again! <laughs> I'll kill you twice. Die already! Take these deaths, you son of a bitch! Eat shit, you jack off! You're done for! Ha, 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 ha. 
I'm not gonna let you fucking kill me. No one says you can't get high off your own supply. So you're an officer in the galaxy's biggest crime syndicate and they have you just doing tedious paperwork? Look, man, just let us kill you. We'd be doing you a favor. And I'm coming right for ya! You're finished, Amazing! You have no idea! Oh god, I'm in I'm in heaven right now! Oh, oh you should see this! Oh, ripping through his drill tenants like their butter! Oh fuck! Oh, oh. oh, I was really getting my glumps off there, wasn't I? Sorry about that. The name's Gus. Feel good to meet you. Look at you, man. Pretty slick taking out Krubus like that, rescuing me from indentured servitude, etc., etc. I love that kind of stuff. You know what? I love that. That's the kind of stuff I love, man. Do you mind if I tag along with you for a bit? I, of course. I, I, that's what I was hoping you'd say. We can use your help. But I should be clear that we are trying to take down the whole G3 cartel, and we might die. Music to my ears. You think I don't want to take down the cartel? Buddy, that's all I want to do. That's all I dream about. Amazing. God, I'm so glad to find another Gatlian alive and well. I love <laughs> By the way, I, I, I had a cousin who had those tiny hands. He died in the zombie apocalypse on Gatlas, but, you know, look, I'm sure you don't want to hear about that. We had to live through it. I mean, you know, who wants to talk about that? Here's what I do. See, 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 that's what I'm talking about. Now climb up there. Aren't you glad you met me? Oh shit, time to fight. Woohoo, okay. Hey, you're not supposed to be down here. No, 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 don't shoot this guy. Let me show you what else Papa Gus can do. Fuck you, whoa, what the Here fuck? Here it comes. Pretty chill, right? Use that whenever you want. It's cool. <laughs> and I see another wall you can climb. You see that, right? Hmm. Still a little far away. I'm not sure you can jump to that one. Oh, hey. It's me, Quentin the Quentin again. Your best friend. I actually decided to patch things up and rejoin the Jake 3 Do you mind if I kill you real quick? <laughs> Finally! Enough of that guy! They kicked him out of the G3 because he was so damn annoying! He's lonely, he's bitter, and get a life! Some people- Freedom, baby! I already felt free when you saved me from Krubus. But now that we're out of the pit, I really feel free! I'm coming for you. Phantom Constrictor! Grenade! Yeah. I'm gonna give you the old sexagenarian shag, baby. Huh? Somebody's done? Look, not to be a backseat shooter, but I got a desk here if you want to launch them. Fresh delivery from the postmaster. Bang! 
You having a good time, partner? I am. Let's head home and turn in this bounty. Think I'm supposed to be impressed that you killed a G3 officer? Y well, okay, you're yeah, fine. I am. I think it's pretty insane you didn't die. That's all you're getting out of me. Now, oh turn that bounty in. Uh, it's, it's hell to be right all the time, huh? <laughs> okay, you are right? Oh, cool. You got yourself another talking gun? And this one's green? Wow, who cares? No one. Oh, okay, okay, that's fine. Be rude. My name is Gus, not that it matters to you. There we go. Look at you. You're getting the hang of this bounty hunter thing already. How'd the mission go? They killed a G3. Looks like I taught them well. Wow, really? Whoa, okay. Well, I'm impressed. <laughs> yeah, I was, I was always hoping you'd find your calling. I just I didn't think it would be bounty hunting. But then again, I don't know what I thought it would be. Maybe hairstyling and not good at it. And what's wrong with bounty hunting? Ugh, can you please tell this dried up sack of shit to go home? I don't want to share a couch with him. Tough titties, Leslie. You're kidding me had a deal. It's Lizzie. And that's not my kid. Jesus, we're siblings. Sorry, I don't know how your species works yet. Sibling, fine, got it. Doesn't change a thing. I live here now. Come on, can't he find his own place to stay? Hey, that's not right. I'm barely taking up any space. You know we had a deal fair and square. Oh, come on. We barely know this guy. You're really going to side with him over your own sister? Hey, you should be proud. You raised your child to have proper respect for a good, fair business deal. Oh, now I know you're doing this on purpose. I'm the sister, not the mom. But you knew that, didn't you? Sorry. My bad. You come waltzing back in here stinking like dirty Flimborg, of course I'm gonna get distracted. You shouldn't be hanging out with that Flimborg boy, you know? Can't trust that species. Tweak's harmless and nice. You're being spacist. And he's not my boyfriend. Yet. Trust me. Flimborgs are bad news. Come on. Have my back here. Whoa, really? Uh, you don't have to side with this guy just because he gave you some cool toys. Plus, I feel like he's just using you. Look, I appreciate the loyalty, kid, but I am actually a bit of a spacist. I'm trying to work on it. God, I just don't think I can take much more of this guy. What, you think this is easy for me? If I'm pissing you off, at least you can leave. But my legs don't work. I'm stuck listening to your boy trouble every time I'm trying to watch my stories. I can't even get peace and quiet in my own home because there's an alien cripple jerking off on my couch 24-7. Hey, come on. That's a high estimate. Ew. I was kidding. Yeah, me too. I was kidding. We all know I was kidding. Aren't you going to say anything? Whose side are you on anyway? Hey, uh, all right. I, I, I can see I'm being a little bit of a bother. I mean, look, I'll, I'll try to keep it down when I'm uh, watching my stories. Just don't uh, put me back on the streets. I, I really do want to help you. Fine, he can stay. But only until he finds somewhere else to go. I'm grateful. I mean it. But I've already missed half my program, so can everyone just shut the hell up? Ugh. All right, that's enough excitement for one day. You got more bounties to get to, kid. And you might want to check out the pawn shop to see what you can spend your new payout on, eh? Oof, that was tense. It's times like these, I'm, I'm almost relieved I don't have any family left alive. But, but not really. I, I miss them a lot. Hey, uh, just so you know, you can use the Bounty 5000 to revisit any planet you've been before. There's portal doors all over. You can just uh, use them whenever... Stamina, you, you must have been on track team or something. Welcome, welcome.
You're sure that's what you want? For some uh, deals, am I right? Why? Why? You the owner of this house? It can't be here. Gotta give you a ticket. Hey, uh, just so you know, you can use the Bounty 5000 to revisit any planet you've been before. There's portal doors all over. You can just uh, use them whenever and grind for money, look for loot you miss, whatever. Up to you. Just thought I'd tell you. We can start to shoot. Ah! Okay, so we have the best shock rods, the most powerful, awful shock rods. Ah! That fucking shock you really bad. If you need to shock somebody or shock anyone else, shock yourself. That's See you later. Don't come back. Hey, you look hungry. Hungry for some uh, deals? Am I right? Your horrific homo sapien host, Humandor, the human. That's right, I'm a real human. But don't go hiding under those blankets, or you'll miss today's chilling movie. Tammy and the T-Rex. We may not understand. kidding me we had to get here when there's a goddamn sandstorm going on bunch of fucking sand in my eyes no you're you got a helmet on no i don't i don't Feed me some of that. It gives me more energy. It gives me energy back to do more cool shit. Oh shit, Greebles. Look, look at them go. They eat up broken ship parts. Does it taste good? I no idea. I'm not I'm not about to give it a taste test. dangerous out here with this fucking weather you never know what kind of shit's gonna fly into your face with the wind and the sand but but wait what's that sign sandworms oh shit that's right okay yeah we we, we gotta be really careful watch it Really nice to see you again, partner. You been hiding from me? Woo-wee! A big 
shipwreck. Now we're talking. You think there's still people on board? Maybe now you see that little speck of a town out there? This is a little speck of a piece of shit out there. That's called Old Town. Although there ain't no old people there, but it's still called Old Town. I mean, it was old before it was new. But we're gonna go there, right? It was the first settlement out here, like pre-G3. We'll have to pass through there. Now, don't let the locals hear you say this, right? Keep it under your breath. But Port Turin is really G3 territory. They've got their claws in everything out there. Three for one deal at Best Buy this week. See that coming in handy? Grab it up. Smart enough not to hop into that toxic green shit, right? All right. Maybe you want to use my discs. Maybe not. I don't care. Come on, let's get a move on. We haven't even reached Old Town yet, and that place is straight up Snoozeville. Like it's nappy time. Every time you go there, it's nap time. We gotta get to Drag Town where it's popping, baby. Hey, let's get this boy a coffee. Let's get ready for supper. I'll, I'll prepare the meal. I'm afraid. I, I am afraid. Old Town's just past this bridge. You this can't boy, miss it. And, uh, you know, I'll tell you what. So, boy, whoa, 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 Wait, tough whoa, guy. Whoa. Hey, hey, look, walk wherever you want. Hey, what fucking the mac fuck? and cheese brothers Hands off, pal. Sites. We no done touching. Here. You gotta be careful. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yo, chill out. We're cool. Oh, whoa, whoa, you just killed oh, my I fucking can't believe brother, this. Johnny whoa, 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 mac whoa, whoa, and whoa, cheese brothers. How dare you? Hey, what's your big deal, you? Oh, my God, you son of a bitch. Oh, my... Look at you, you're the alpha now. If any of those guys were still alive, they'd be telling you how much they respect you. Finally, what did I do to piss you off? Okay. Right. I, 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 I'm, the, I'm, the, I'm, the, I can help with this. Hey, nice work. You know, it wasn't a hard thing, but ni nice work. All right, Old Town. We just move through this place, and we'll, we'll get to Douglas. Hey, you whippersnappers looking again to get into Old Town? Hey, we should talk to this guy. I calls him like I sees him. He, he seems helpful. Howdy there, partner. Welcome to Old Town. They call me Old Wet Grundy. How can I help you? So, uh, why do they call you Old Wet Grundy? It's because I'm old. 
And I piss myself every day. I'm doing it right now. You're, you're pissing yourself while you're talking to us? Oh, yeah. Big time. It's still going. Ooh, this is a good one. Hey, do you happen to know where we can find a, 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 a guy named Douglas? Douglas? The G3 fella? <laughs> oh, wee. He's a rough one. Never seen somebody drink as much as him. Why, just last night, uh, nope, I, I shouldn't speak out of turn. The G3 don't like that none, and I don't like them. Just head down to Drag Town. I'm sure you'll find them. And how do we get to Drag Town? It's, it's, it's been a little bit for me. Oh, that's easy. You just go through this gate, pop into Old Town, and shoot straight down the main strip. You can't miss the big Drag Town entrance. It's a real goddamn eyesore. Wish they'd get rid of it. I'll open the gate for you. Oh, well, thanks, Grundy. That's always Grundy. And of course, opening the gate's my whole job. And have a good time in there, young <laughs> That party last night was crazy! Hey, Did you see how weird it was? Douglas? scary bounty hunter suit. Let's get him! There's more of them? Ow. Yeah, f kill them! Ow. Hey, that fucking hurts! Yes, yes, of yes. Never should have joined up with the bad guys. All right, let's, can we just wrap this up and find Douglas? I think Drag Town's past here. I just stand around and tell people that. Let's get ready for supper, dear. I'll, I'll prepare the meal. I can't let anyone in right now. There's too many recruits causing trouble in town. I get in trouble when that happens, so I'm gonna keep the gate locked until they stop or get killed. Wink, wink. Are you telling us to kill them? Whoa, I didn't say that. I just said wink, wink, and okay, yeah, that's what I meant. So go kill them and, and I'll let you through. Oof, more drunk recruits. Have you learned anything? And who the let's fuck are you? Hey, Honcho, let's clean this town up. Pucker up for these bullets. Another wave, no problem. feeling that there's probably some more G3 causing trouble, you know, somewhere around town. We, we should we should maybe d deal with it. Yeah, good idea. We got you now, bounty hunter. Fuck yeah! I wouldn't try anything.
You know? Oh shit, more G3. Causing trouble. I gotta have fun, little kid. I to harass people. Time to take out the trash. Oof, I, I got too confident. Uh, I don't know. I'm not sure about that. I'm sorry. You know, th thanks to us, you know, quite a team we are. Anyways, uh, l l l l let's uh, let's poke our way into Dregtown now. Let's go to Dregtown. Thank you so much for saving me. Oh my God, thank you. Uh, but you know what? I kinda, I'm kinda thinking I would have fucked him. So now I, I don't know. I'm gonna go think about that. See you later. Doing a power slip. You did it. The town's all cleaned up. I keep tab till I don't know how many times I've told the recruits not. Very rude of you to just breeze past me like that. But I get it. I'm just a gate guard. Who cares about me? The G3 really spruced up Dragtown. You can get anything you want down there. Ooh, you heading down to Dragtown? Well, ain't you in a rush by? Are you looking for glory? Then join the G3 cartel! My name's Douglas, the G3 Chief of Training and Torture. Ignore that second bit for this ad, this was just about the training. Well, goddamn, that, there, there's Douglas right there. Uh, that's how you know we're in the right spot. Mothers against violence. Oof. Well, that, that falls in our favor, huh? We don't, we're not gonna have to worry about. It. Wow. So this is what a G3 run city looks like. So, like I was saying, my brother told me Douglas is really into torture. Like sexually. Does it matter? Yes to me. Feel like there's another batch of new recruits every day. Damn, can you believe they built all this on the bottom of an asteroid? I mean, I, I, I'm not gonna lie, it's, it's a good place to hide out, I mean, but yeah. Whoa, look at that, look at that, they got, they, they're, they're fucking dealing with some grievels over there, dumb fucks. Okay, shit, I, I guess let's just kill them all. You're evil, you, we don't have to listen to you. Not gonna let me take a break, huh? I'm so proud. 
down with you, son. Back at you, duck. Look, man, we're just trying to kill you and move on with our day. Mother's four violence zone. I was missing the violence. I'm gonna make love to the bounty hunter's corpse. Quit wasting our time. All the bounty hunter's organs. We still want to deal with best for this week. Is about oh. to torture. Uh, the last Wanna one was sneak about in? the G3, but this one is about how I love torturing. It's not an ad for anything, it's just like a reminder that part of my job is also torturing. Sorry, G3 recruits G3 only. No yellow goop armor, no entry. Beat it. Look, don't, don't worry. I'm pretty sure we can figure out how to get in. Okay, that's it for this one. That's a wrap. Hey there, freaks and geeks. Check it out. It's the G3 cartel. Don't we're touch me. hiring. We're, we're recruiting. You want to be a, a henchman in the G3? Hey, hey, you can trust me. He's fine. I'm trustworthy, I promise. Hey, hey, you can trust me. He's fine. I'm trustworthy, I promise. Hey, hey there. Thanks for coming over here. I'm the goop guy around these parts. You wanna sneak in the G3 facilities? You gotta get covered in goop. That's just how it goes. My stuff's quality. So you, you, you want some goop, right? Hey, it wouldn't be the first time I got gooped. Let's do this. Perfect. Head down the alley there and just, uh, let the magic happen, I guess. Uh, d don't, don't worry. First goop's on me. Just tell all your buddies about it. I'm the goop guy. I do goops. I'm not one to shame people, but that's disgusting. Hey, look at you. You're all gooped up. I gotta be honest. It won't last long. It's not the real stuff, so you better be quick. Get in. Oh, look.
Looky here, we got another gooped up G3 recruit. Be advised that the G3 cartel is not responsible for any life-threatening injuries you may incur on these premises. But even if we were, we wouldn't give a shit. Who cares? I hope you get shot. Good luck. Hey, I appreciate that. Oh, sick, we get to watch a movie. Shut the fuck up, it's starting. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I'm sure you already know who I am, but for anyone living under a rock, I'm Douglas, G3 Chief of Training and Torture. And wouldn't you know it, I like to blur those lines a little. Training, torture, what's the difference, I say? I look to your left, now look to your right. Both of those people are gonna die today. You are about to jump right into an accurate warp-based simulation of what it'll look like to be on the real battlefield. And let me tell you, you're probably gonna die. But hey, if you don't, you get to join the G3, big whoop. All right, that's it. Lock and load, fuckers. All right, Whoa, shut it whoa, up. you see that? Looks like Douglas do. has a Gatling in. We should probably rescue her. Okay, put your G3 face on. This'll be a piece of... Okay, it's time to pop off. Okay. Mike down. Can't hide forever. Shoot me, shoot the bad guy! of them right oh okay you beat all the weak guys easy really easy now go do the obstacle course oh okay You know what? It looks like some simple platforming. You know, like what you'd see in like Lucky's Tale on, uh, you know, or um, you know that one uh, that one game that we that we all know and love, Mario Land or whatever. You know, uh, listen, uh, you're not gonna impress me if you if you if you get through this. Cause it's pretty simple. Uh, I have a pacemaker. Get that fucking jump! God damn! That was a little that, that we we made it. That was a little tough though. Congratulations, shitheads! So you made it past the first training exercise. Big deal. That one was easy. We lied and said it was hard to scare you. Oh, it's fun to freak you out to fuck with your heads. Now get ready for exercise two. It starts in one hour. That's right. You have to wait a full hour. We're testing your resolve, so just stand there patiently and wait. Then this door will open and you can continue. Uh, okay, there's no way we're waiting a full hour. Okay, thank God. Okay, let, let's ditch this whole recruiting bullshit thing.
Oh shit, okay, well, there goes that bootleg goop. Uh, I guess that didn't last for very long. Oh my god, hello! Thank god you're here. My name's Dr. Jupy. Douglas kidnapped my whole family, and I'm trying to sneak in and save them. But I just can't get through these pipes in the next room. Oh my god, I'm freaking out! Hey, whoa, whoa, l l listen, little guy. We're trying to find Douglas, too. You know, maybe we can help each other. God, I'm so worried I'm gonna gonna throw up. You really helped me? Oh, gee, I'm, I'm so grateful. Follow me! You gotta connect these pipes for me so I can get through and save my family. Hey, don't worry. This is a classic textbook puzzle situation. I think me and my bounty hunter partner can figure this one out. Don't even worry. Oh, how wondrous. I'm forever in your debt. I don't know how I can ever repay you. God, my poor family, my wife, Plimmy, my kids, Swoopy and Froopy. I'm gonna get to see them soon. You're really gonna do it? I bet you're gonna solve this puzzle in no time. Wow! You did it! You got the door open! Listen, I'll never forget this. You're my personal hero. Oh, come on! You're too, you're too kind. It, it was easy. Oh, did you say you're heading to find Douglas too? His office is that big building up on top of Dregtown. Uh, there's a zip line just past here that'll take you right to him. Huh. Well, all right then. I, I I hope the guy gets his family back. All right, Douglas, here we come. That was the hardest part behind us. This is basically done. We finished this shit. We are fully out oh, fuck. What is this? Congratulations to all of you worms who made it this far in your training. It is now time for the final test. A bloody free-for-all. Last one standing gets to join the G3. No rules, just killing. Good luck, shit heels. God damn it, another fucking thing with this. Holy shit, just kill them all. Yeah, good job. Congratulations, recruit. Now, uh, I don't know, fight some more guys. All right, here we go. You can do this. Okay. You can kill him. You can kill him. Come on. You can do it. You can kill him. We're gonna kill this guy. We're gonna kill this guy. Okay. Ready? One, two, three. We're gonna kill him. Okay, you can do it. You can kill somebody. for a glob shot. After this, we're going to deliver You're a real tramp trader. Grenade! You think you're gonna hurt me? Yes, the gonna party isn't me? over yet. I'm fine with being killed, actually. Oh, God 
Damn. I don't even baptize because you're about to die. Congratulations, graduates on joining the G3 or whatever. I really can't stress enough how little I give a shit. Now report to your commanding officer and we'll send you off to die fighting for us on whatever dumbass planet we decide. See ya. Glad to see you. I'm so happy we keep running into each other. Oh, look who it's our old buddy. It's our old friend, Dr. Jupy. What are you talking about? How, wh how's it going? Uh, there's another locked door. I'm running out of time. God, I'm so worried about my kids. And a little bit about my wife, but mostly my kids. Okay, well, we'll, we'll see what we can do. Oh, my poor kids. I hope Douglas doesn't kill them. I can feel my wife, Plimmy, calling for me. Solve this one too. Thank you. Swoopy and Poopy would really like you to. Oh, they're good kids. I can't wait to introduce them to you and tell them about everything you did for me. They need good, strong role models. I don't want to rush you, but I'm getting nervous. Oh, Plimmy and the kids are probably so... Amazing! Amazing! You did it again! 
again. Douglas's office isn't too far from here. I'm going on ahead. I'll see you there. Jesus Christ, Douglas is gonna kill Dr. Jupy. Look at look how weak and, and cute Dr. Jupy is. Forget about it. Oh my god! Oh, oh, oh. This is an urgent announcement. This sector has temporarily been designated as a mother's four and against violent zone. That means there's probably just going to be a lot of violence. An intruder has infiltrated the G3 recruitment program, and there will be. Oh, fuck! Until we find and kill them. And hey, it's an asshole who's been fucking with our training exercises! Oh, shit, here we go! Eat my postmaster bullet! Whoops! You having a good time, partner? I am.
delicious. Ah. They are still sending motherfuckers. Why? Why? This ain't about them. This is about you. Don't feel bad. They knew what they signed up for. I miss you more and more, man. Look at Dr. Jupy. What's up, Dr. Jupy? <gasps> oh, my best friends. This is it. Douglas is right beyond this door. Can you help me out one last time? Sure thing, buddy. Oh, huzzah. Plimmy, Froopy, Sloopy, here I come. Maybe I'm tripping, but I could have sworn your second kid's name was Swoopy. Yeah, that's what I said. Plimmy, Froopy, and Swoopy, here I come. I'm starting to think you forgot about me, Bounty Hunter. Here we go. Oh, you're so good at these. I wish I was as good at these as you. You're really good. Did you go to puzzle school? Boy, this is a hard one. P please hurry up. My family could be dying. I'm really, really trying not to think about my wife's body being ripped in half by one of Douglas's torture devices, and it's not working, to be honest! I decided that if my family is dead, I'm going to kill myself and join them in the afterlife. Yes! You're halfway there! Keep going, you can do it! Oh, I can't wait to see my little flimmy, proppy, and droopy. Don't feel bad if it takes you a while. It's tough, right? Okay, I know that earlier I said, don't feel bad if this puzzle takes you a while, but I also want you to remember, every second you take solving this is another second Douglas might be torturing and killing my family! A good team. <laughs> you fell for it, idiots! Thank God! Do you know how hard it is to solve a fucking puzzle with a hangover? <laughs> oh, fuck off! <laughs> I was never Dr. Jupy. There is no Dr. Jupy. Are you shocked, you idiot? You complete fucking morons! Of course you are. Ha <laughs> 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 And to think you never once suspected your helpless little friend, Dr. Jupy, was actually hiding his truth. 
true identity. Ha! It's naive people like you that get killed by smart geniuses like me. You know what? This is perfect. We're, we're, we're here to kill you either way. Fucking You're die, dead, bitch. Wait, what? <laughs> you morons still have it backwards. I'll be the one killing you. Let's see how you deal with my trained recruits who are also my torture victims. ready whenever you need it.
Fuck yeah, that's definitely the stuff. Oh, now that felt good. He had some very nice choppable flesh, actually. It was actually very nice. Oh, fuck. All right, dipshit, let's go. What? No hello? Nice to meet you, or thank you for saving me? Why? Like you not dying there with some sort of favor to me? Hi, I'm Sweetie, thanks so much. Pretty cool, right? You're gonna find out real fast that I'm the best Gatlian. Smartest, most useful, best looking. Oh, come on, come on, I'm pretty good. Douglas, it's Garmentuous. Where the fuck are you? I heard you made a complete fool of yourself at that party Hey, last if you want to slow down time, not it's good, ready. Douglas. Not good. I'm gonna need you on top of your game now that we've got a hold of these humans. Time We're spread for thin over on Earth, and I need more truth immediately. Not to mention things are gonna start heating up all over the galaxy. My trickle's ready to up. blow. Big things are happening, Douglas. Get excited! Let's get go, your God, fucking God, shit together! Up and shoots us. You know, I hope nobody got a brand new cool talking gun that they wanna use. You wanna and fuck use these it, guys uh, up? It on us. I hope that doesn't <laughs> Trick, my crystal stick in the baddies and they'll explode if you hit them real hard. Like with your knife. You get it. Go nuts. Stand in there! We meant to me have some fun! Ah, oh, done already? I was just getting into it. You just made a big mistake, asshole. Aim me at those fuckers and I'll charge up a super crystal. What are you, scared? You can use that to detonate my smaller crystals. So just blast some normal shots, then finish them off with my super crystal. You got that, dipshit? Fuck yeah! Hey, do you not know how to use me or something? Oh, Jesus, it's not hard. Just follow the instructions on screen. Hey, don't forget about my time bubble. Grenade! Let's kill these fuckers. See what else this time bubble can do? Great! Perfect! Now hurry and cross before it wears off! Incredible, right? What a thrill! You know, you can use that time bubble on the G3, too. And try loading the bubble up with my crystals. Then you'll see why I'm We're gonna make a good team. I can feel it. Just listen to everything I say and never use the other Gatlians. What's next? You turn in the bounty somewhere? Go do that. We can wrap... This up.
kid? Another one down, huh? Great work. <laughs> but, uh, hey, there's something you should see. Take a look after you turn in your bounty. All right, good. Get over here. Check this out. That's Clug Nugman, Blim City Magistrate. As you all know, I'm working hard to flush out all the crime and drugs from our streets. I'll be the first to admit, we haven't made much headway in the fight against the G3 cartel. All right, all right. Now catch this next bit. All about to change. We've learned of a bold bounty hunter who's been bravely taking this G3 matter into their own hands. You hear that? He's talking about you! They've already dealt with two of the cartel's most powerful officers. Yeah, you got lucky. I am not too proud to ask for help in our war on drugs. Bounty Hunter, if you're listening, please consider joining forces with the good people of Blim City. I hope you'll choose to come forward and meet with me personally at my office in City Hall. Yeesh, desperate much? Can he even help us? I already told him you go. Oh, great. No, don't start. Trust me, he's legit. This guy's been anti-G3 since before any of you were even in diapers. Honestly, I don't know if Gatlin's even wear diapers. Head through there. Clug's expecting you. Thank you so much for coming, Bounty Hunter. It wasn't really our idea, but hey. Look, I'll cut to the chase. I need your help. You're a human, correct? My men looked into it. Sorry. You survived the G3's attack on your home planet Earth, right? Uh, no. We're Gatlians. Unless you're talking about my personal chauffeur. Of course. Sorry. I'm familiar with your plight as well. It's such a tragedy what happened on Gatlas. It makes much sense that you and the human would join forces, but perhaps you have room for one more ally as well? Yeah, I'm sure the big hotshot politician wants blood on his hands. That's precisely why I need your help. I'm having the darndest time curbing the species drug trade. I can only do so much, and only within the confines of the law. I mean, I've got my hands full with Gary the Poisoner. He's not just poisoning the water supply, he's moved on to poisoning weirder stuff now, like street lamps. We don't even know how that works, or if it's actually a problem. Maybe it's fine to poison street lamps. I'm a bit overwhelmed, and I wish I could focus more time on the G3. But you, you've taken out two top G3 officers in less time than it takes us to file a single report. So you see how you can help me, but... There's also one way I can help you. Oh yeah? And how's that? This tool on my desk here will help you rescue your fellow humans. You can use it to teleport them to a safe haven my team has arranged for them to stay at until the G3 are dealt with. Please take a look at this tool! What's the catch? Well, the human species is technically a drug. I can't have dangerous sentient drugs in the hands of my citizens, and you can't have your people getting captured and consumed. This solves both of our problems, assuming you plan to continue taking out the G3. Yeah, no shit like we're gonna stop now. Then, thank you. Sincerely, you humans and Gatlians, you're both very noble species. This means a lot to me. I've made it my life's work to use my power to help people in need, but even I have my limits. I'm just glad I have someone like you to turn to. As a token of thanks, my team will be feeding any intel we find on the G3 directly to your handler, Mr. Zaruthian. We've already sent him everything we had. The rest is in your hands. Yeah, yeah, whatever. We just like killing freaks. If you want to help, you're more than welcome. That's all I have for you. Feel free to stay as long as you like. The view is breathtaking. Yo! So, it went well, huh? I got a message saying they'll hook us up with any G3 intel they find. Yep, and he even gave us this weird thing we could save humans with. God damn, you got it easy. Nothing as convenient as this ever happened when I was bounty hunting. Hey, uh, speaking of, we should get you a jetpack before you head back out into the field. You're really gonna need it. Head on down to the pawn shop and see if they got one in stock. Oh, and yeah, you might want to hit up Broto's chef stand, too. It's a little shady, but uh, those warp discs he's selling can be pretty helpful. Hey 
look at me. I'm the guy who sells stuff. I'm an illegal concessions guy. I like to, here's what's up. My name's Stan, and I sell vials of alien cum. I know that's probably not what you wanted to hear when you walked over here. You wanted cum or what? I'm not mad, I'm just curious. Do we really look like your typical customers? Sure, look, I have absolutely no idea. I'm shocked to my core every time somebody buys literally truckloads of alien cum from me, but they do it all the time. There's no rhyme or reason to it. I've been completely unable to narrow it down to a set of demographics. Grannies, cops, movie stars, politicians, everybody likes my delicious alien cum. I've had every type of weirdo coming up here saying, I like 600 gallons of your absolute highest quality alien cum. And, and, and I say, does it matter which aliens the cum come from? And they say, no, sir, it truly does not. I just want some alien cum. No further details needed. So what, what's it gonna be? You want some alien cum or not? All right, I get it. You know, you don't, you don't want my alien cum. I totally, un okay, you saunter away. I wasn't saying nothing. Yo, Mr. Keith, got any jetpacks back there? A jetpack? Oh, certainly. I can help. Uh, I can help. Ah, jetpack, huh? Great choice. Really phenomenal choice. Let's lock that purchase in. Nice. Don't we get a jetpack now? Not so fast. I gotta back order that bad boy. I'll have it ready for you in a couple of days, I promise. No refunds, by the way. This purchase is final. Oh, way to rip us off. Guess we'll wait, not like we have a choice. Let's go tell Gene. The longer you take it here, the longer I have to look like I give a shit. And stay out. I better lock those doors. A match made in heaven. Dad, can I clack out early? No, why? What are you, the cops? I don't owe you an explanation. Yes, you do. I'm your father and your boss. I'd like it better if you were the cops. Why, well, you have to be a complete and utter dum-dums to pass up a deal like this. Great choice. Wow, you bought something. I'm so impressed. You there, how about some uh, food? Hey, welcome to Blordo's. I'm Blordo. You here for the food? Or the other stuff? <laughs> what, what do you mean, other stuff? Nothing, nothing, nothing. Forget I said anything. <laughs> no, come on, we're, we're good. T tell us. Oh, fine, I sell secret shit if you know what to ask for. But don't tell the cops. Now order something or leave. Perfect. See you later, valued food customer. And here's another ancient secret. Hey, actually, actually, hold on. I can't remember that secret. Oh, nice. 
not even this secret? How'd it go? Did you get a jetpack? Yeah, but it's on back order. Great. Perfect excuse for a rest. We're still waiting on Clug's intel anyway. Why don't you go to bed and sleep off some of that excitement? Gene's right. That, that's, that sounds like a good idea. Come on! Come on, Come on let's go! Get me out of here! Come on! It's fine! You deserve a rest! So this is your bedroom, huh? It's fine. I mean, I don't, I don't, I don't really know what I was expecting, to be honest. Yo, how far are you going, Bob? Hey, good night, partner. I'm just gonna sit right here and watch you fall asleep. I'm really glad we met. You know, I, I think I think we're doing something amazing here. How cool would it be if we actually stopped the G3? Sorry, sorry, I, 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 I'm just, I'm excited. I'll shut up, L let's get some sleep. Pretty soon, you know, we'll be jetpacking across all the space. Sorry, I'm, I'm being too loud. You're probably trying to, let's get you to sleep. Partner, let's take this jetpack for a spin. Can you make it over that gap? Holy shit, this rules! Damn, you're just like a TonyHawk.com jetpack bro. Two brothers and a brother-in-law, and we we love shooting guns. But now it's just like, oh, we got the sponsors giving us money, and you know that feels nice because I like money, but I just don't like losing that passion, my soul. Hey, Bob Gunshot. Nice! Well, I gotta tell you, Gene was right. That is gonna come in handy. It's also fun. You could fly while doing combat. It's a very cool uh, feature that we have here. We put a lot of time and effort into it. Let's head back and talk to Gene and see if there's any new bounties. Who got the lumber? Who got the nail? Well, who got the hammer? Who forgot to put a roof on it? I've been telling you to clean up. This place is a mess. I need you to clean it up before Tweet gets here. Oh, got a big date with your sad sack Flimborg boy toy? Fuck Gene, like you've even never been on a date. Hey, don't even start, sister. I know a lot about dates. I fuck more aliens than your brain can comprehend. And even I don't want to touch your boyfriend. So sick of hearing about this guy. Yeah, right. My boyfriend is so fucking hot, though, right? Oh, come on. You haven't even seen him. Why'd you answer that? Trust me. You don't have to support her just because she's family. This guy's a loser. He is so hot. He's like a low seven or a high six. And he's really nice to me. Yeah, no ulterior motives there. Just clean up after yourself, Jesus. Hey, look, I'm sorry if I'm coming off harsh. He's messing up the group dynamic. We've got a good thing going here. We do that fun sitcom banter back and forth while your nibbling here goes and blasts alien baddies in the face. It's great! Dude, you're lucky you even get to live here with us. I don't care about your damn dynamics. I'm just saying you barely know this guy. Are you sure you're even attracted to him? Most aliens only bang their own species. Oh, what about you? You just said you've slept with basically everything in the whole galaxy. Yeah, but I'm a washed-up degenerate. You've got your whole life ahead of you. That's more condescending than it is sweet. What? No, uh, look. We've spent all this time living together. I... I care about you now, Leslie. For fuck's sake, my name's Lizzie. Come on, tell her I care about her. Excuse me? 
No, sorry. But I am not about to let this fuck-up degenerate school me on life decisions. The fact that I'm a fuck-up degenerate is exactly why you should let me school you on life decisions. I, I know better than anyone what not to do. You're both assholes. Yeah? Well, you're gonna get this tweed guy pregnant. And then I'll be here to tell you I told you so. Then who's gonna have to deal with all your mutant kids running around this house? Me! Yeah, not that it matters, but I'm the one who would get pregnant. Not the way his species works. They get pregnant real easy. I'm so sick of this shit. Look, I just don't want Tweak to think I'm messy, okay? It's that simple. And I don't want you dating him at all. Why don't I set you up with my nephew, Grimble Dick? He's got a steady job. And yes, before you ask, he's got both his legs. That's not like a family ailment or anything. Fuck off. Just grow up and get used to me and Tweak. Come on, tell Jean I can date whoever I want. Thank you. Not that I needed your approval. Oh, fine, yeah. Team up against the depressed paraplegic. I didn't know you were depressed. I mean, I knew you were depressing. Har, har, har. Just clean up, Gene, okay? Sorry to drag you into all that. Anyway, a nice little arrangement with Clug is paying off. They sent us intel on two new bounties. So, uh, go ahead if you want to get started on those. Are you tired of your regular taking your pills situation where you have to put all your pills in like a first day through last day kind of container? Well, now there's a new solution. This company that I'm re representing here on this commercial has everything you need. We are PillPeople.com. We do have the internet here. It's PillPeople.com. I It's you, the savior. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's us. Uh, where is everyone? Oh, uh, it was awful. Everyone else got enslaved again, if you can believe it. Honestly, I think they like being enslaved. Oh shit. Okay, well, no guarantees we're gonna save them again. But wh wh where are they? They're working at Screndel Labs now, just past the Mushroom Valley here. Just be careful. That place is freaky. Thanks. Damn, you called me up just when I was in the middle of a nice dream. Damn, what's up again? Get us out of here! Why are you guys always flying around? You missed me, didn't ya?
crawl. You gonna jetpack across this or what? Nice! You crossed a big gap. You want me to order you a trophy off of Delarmo Prime? Good, this is the right path. If it isn't, I'll freak out. Oh, bounty hunters left the vicinity. I hate those fucking drones. by Dr. Giblet. In case you were wondering about the Lord. Oh, you finally brought me out again. Well, what did I offend you or sir? Shit. 
I took Sarvantua to the G3. Smell that? Lug locks. John, oh, hold on, don't, don't pass through here. I've got to make you sign this form. Finders keepers. Fucking sniping at us? Hunter. 
We've been reprogrammed by Dr. Giblets. You know, just in case you were wondering about the lore here. So, uh, you know, what, what do you think Scrandle Labs is like? I mean, I, I, mean, like, I, I know a little bit. I mean, I, I, I heard a bit, so, so I kind of know. But I, I'm just making small talk right now. You know, I'm just trying to, I'm just trying to fill the dead air. It's really uncomfortable. I mean, don't get mad at me if what I'm saying isn't that interesting, because you know, I'm, I'm doing my best here. You know. Welcome to Scrandle Labs. Only authorized personnel are allowed beyond this point. You gotta oh, be. You're the bounty hunter who helped us out with all that paperwork and killed my boss, Krubus. <laughs> we really appreciated that. But sorry, I need to let the G3 know that you're here. Just my job. Nothing personal. You're uh, gonna set off the alarm. Yep, I'm gonna set off the alarm. We've got an intruder. G3 are coming for you. And I don't care for you. Oh shit, here they come. You know, hey, at least the elevators are working now. Shoot some slime out of my trick hole. What's so gross about that?
here we are! Get the intruders! Don't let them find the test subject! Oh shit, okay, yeah, that's right, we're trespassing. interest you in my trick hole full of deadly launching discs? No blood? Oh, what a fucking ripoff. around and see what kind of weird experiments they're doing in here. Why'd you let me sit there gathering dust? This is our best human Fergal hybrid specimen. It may not be as cool as our subject in the weapons lab, but it's still rather beautiful, isn't it? We call it a fur man, or, or maybe a hurdle. I, we haven't decided yet. Why am I telling you all this? You know, to be honest, it's because you look cool and a little bit badass, to be frank. It looks like a Fergal sitting on a dead human. Who is the scientist here, me or you, huh? here really needs to get their shit together. What a mess. Hello, Jonathan. It's Dr. Gurgula. I've been asked to send you some of my findings on the human genome. It's only a small portion, and I doubt you'll even be able to comprehend what you're looking at. But I promised Garmantuas I'd provide them. And now please don't contact me again. I'm busy. This Dr. Gurgler guy creeps me out. Oh God, are those Gatlians? I think I'm gonna be sick. Wait, I think that one's alive. 
The bad guys did experiments on me and fucked me up real bad in basically every way you can imagine. Holy shit, am I glad to see another cat laying alive in here? Uh, are there any others? Oh my god, yes! There's so many! Oh, but unless you've been alive, then no! These fucking G3 bastards! Creature, we're taking on the cartel! You want in? Oh, no, no, no. They take good care of me. Holding me against my will, cutting me open, doing experiments on me. Okay, you know what? Say it out loud. I think they might actually be bad. I'm part of your team now. Hell yeah. Welcome aboard, uh, creature. Th 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 that's your name? I guess so. Oh, hey, we're locked in. But that's fine. Don't freak out or anything. I can give birth to a bunch of little freaks and they can disable the door lock. It's fine. Oh, yeah. Ah, beautiful. Look how one of my little fuckers just saved us. Being a dad is the best feeling in the world. Then a few seconds later, when your mutant kid dies because it has a microscopic lifespan, that's not so good of a feeling, actually. But I'm numb to it. Time for me to shine. Oh, sorry to speak up without asking. It's just, you should use me here. There we go. Why haven't you been losing me? Start. That's right. Kenny. How's it going? All right, we're in. How was that? Was that helpful? Was it helpful that I gave birth to a lot of tiny guys really fast? Hey, is this gonna hurt? Is this gonna hurt getting a weapon grafted to my arm? You're gonna graft a Gatlian to my arm, and that's gonna be permanent, is that right? Because I'm- Hey, I can fight too. Let me help. Oh, watch out! I'm the guy who shoots ligaments! everyone wow you are strong good thing i'm safe behind this glass oh use one of my kids to fuck with that guy's mom he'll go into a frenzy did i tell you they can do that they can do that oh oh and if you keep piling my kids on top of a guy they can do mind control shit they can make a bad guy fight for us oh shit 
That mind control thing doesn't last very long. Sorry about that. I keep yelling at my kids to make it last longer, but they're shitheads. They do not listen. Wow. They usually put me in an airtight crate whenever they take me outside. And I really liked it. Look at my little guy in there rustling up the hive. Isn't that cute? I'm so proud of him. Hey, this is fun! Do you do this sort of stuff all the time, bounty hunter? They got a heal. So dumb, I hate it. You know. More going, little fuckers. Quit being mean to us. of G3. Oh, you're gonna save some humans with that thing Clug gave you, right? Help us. Please. Hey, I'm ready to give birth whenever. Do you have a way to rescue these humans? I'm new, so I don't know everything yet. Jonathan, I think we're gonna kill you. get captured, I guess.
your home base and regroup? These guys rule! I know they're annoying and we gotta kill him, but they fucking rule! What's up? What's the plan? in the place. Ooh, hoo, hoo. I don't want to have to kill this many of you. Yes, I will, though. knew this but I can help you here this is totally my thing I'm good at it that's Angela Scrindle wanna kill him oh fuck 
bounty hunters here. Oh, Angela's leaving. I guess he's busy. Bye, Angela. What you watching today? Uh, I guess it's supposed to be porn, but it's like alien porn, so I... Ugh, what the hell? What, what is this? What is this? Why is this in here? I'm trying to jack off. This is really distracting to me, but I'll still be able to do it. Trust me, I, I've been through a lot. I, I honestly have no idea what I'm watching. I mean, I was able to get off to it, like, after a while. Um, honestly, now I love it, though. Uh, not sure why they want me to jack off this much, but, you know, I'm happy to do it. Like, all the tentacles and the moving parts, it's, I don't know, there's something really endearing about it. Yeah, I, I like it a lot, actually. I mean, if, if I ever get out of here... Oh, okay, uh, bye. <laughs> Okay, uh, never mind. That's for making my brain all fucked up. Shit, we lost him. Good day. You know we can see you, right? No, you can't. 
Fuck off! Ooh, you one always game! Fuck you! Ah, oh, I'm sorry, we can stop chasing you if you want! Ah, Jesus Christ! I, why are you still following me? Oh, he really doesn't want to follow me. Maybe we should just go grab him. Running? I wasn't running! Oh, our misunderstanding. Whatever, fuck you! These scrindles seem hard to kill. Whoa, that was creative. That nice work. How's it going?
whatever's clever. All right, let's shoot my cops everywhere. You know damn well this isn't sanitary and, and it hurts like fuck. You and me, two freaks. Sorry, I don't know if you consider yourself a freak, but I'm a freak for sure. about to die.
drill into my skull and peel apart all my brain matter? I want to grab one of those for myself. Later. Ready for carving? No, wait. Three of them? Fuck. Oh, alien biology. Always fuck. Uh, it's just, it's just fucked. It's just fucked, really. Good, delicious. Now let me dig into the last bro. Yes, three in one sitting. Each one more visually better than the last. You know what? I don't see this often, but I'm fully sated right now. I actually need a rest. You there, bounty hunter? Mantuous? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> I know who you are, and I want you to know how fucked you made things for yourself. You were living in heaven before you meddled with the G3. Oh, okay, that sounds bad. <laughs> Bounty Hunter, I've got the two most important people in your life, and I'm going to kill them. <laughs> oh, but not right away. First, I'll make things miserable for them. They're going to suffer as much as you've made me suffer. Uh-oh! I'm not going to ask you to stop. I doubt you'd listen. I'd just like to inform you that I'm going to make sure you die. And that it's going to hurt. <laughs> A lot. <laughs> Besides, you won't even be able to get to my new base on Earth without the proper coordinates. So just sit tight until I come to kill you myself. I'm sorry, bounty hunter. We'll stop him, I promise. Well, that was fun. Thanks for having me. Where do we go now? To your home base? Ah, you killed the Screndel brothers and freed us again. Thank you. Thank you. Everyone else is too traumatized to talk right now. Sorry. We just keep getting captured over and over again, you know? It's a lot to take in. I'm still able to talk because I've been captured the most. I'm just kind of numb to it now. Means nothing to me anymore. God, you're really on fire, aren't you? Obviously, you're not as good at bounty hunting as I used to be, but hey, I'm gloppy enough to admit you're doing pretty damn well. Turn in that bounty. Yeah. I actually wanted to run something by you. How would you feel about me maybe fixing up my old bounty hunting ads? Maybe putting you in them to drum up business? I mean, my name will still be bigger than yours in the logo, but... We'd be stupid not to capitalize on your growing reputation. Yo, you guys are fresh out of Frendelos. Oh, hey, I I'm Tweeg. I'm dating your sister. Uh, this fucking guy. Tweeg, 
You need to leave. Um, Lizzie says it's cool if I'm here. You're just gonna let this sack of shit eat all my friend alos and tongue kiss your sister? I'm the one who bought those fucking friend alos and leave Twig alone. You know he has a barbed tongue and he's very sensitive about it. I can go. No, Twig. You're staying. Tell him he's staying. Look, he doesn't even love you. He's just after our house. It's our house. Exactly. Hey, Twig, you gotta be careful around Lizzie. She's just gonna hit it and quit it. Real heartbreaker. I'd get out now while you're still in the green. And hey, you want a real lover? Talk to me. Don't you have a galaxy to fuck? Come on, tell him to leave. Thank you. I appreciate it. But honestly, it's my house too. So I don't even know why I have to fight for this. I'm just so pissed at everyone. Aww. Not you, Twig. I love you, baby. Ah! Disgusting! Look at this! They're not even the same species! Do, do you know how many holes he has? And they're all really advanced level holes. You really gotta take my nephew instead. His holes are more your speed. Shut the hell up, Gene. I am sick of your shit. All you do is sit on our couch and mope about how sad your life is. You're a leech trying to eat all of our friendalos and use the only family I have left to relive your glory days. Hey, your family's doing a great job. You know how hard it is to kill that many high-level bounties in such a short amount of time? I mean, it's not as fast as... I could have done it, but, uh... I know they're doing a great job, and I'm proud of them. But I'm stuck here dealing with you all the time, and you're fucking pathetic! Tell him how pathetic he is. Yeah, no shit! I'm pathetic! That's my whole deal. I'm homeless and legless and probably riddled with mental illnesses, which I'd know for sure if I didn't think therapy was a fake idea. You don't need to rub it in. I'll rub it in all I want. You're like 80 years old. You can't take a little shit-talking from a teenage girl? Jesus, I'm not 80. I'm 230. And that's really young for my species. I just don't want your creep boyfriend to steal my couch. You can call it your couch when you start paying rent. Until then, no complaining about who lives here. Lives here? He's gonna live here? I mean, if you think we're ready, Twig. <laughs> oh, yeah, sure. Hey, shut up, Twig. This isn't about you. Why? Because you're worried you'll have to share a cushion? No! Because I... Because I'm concerned! You barely know this guy. And it's dangerous out there for humans. Oh, that's rich and condescending. I am not an idiot. I know what I'm doing. You're cool with Twig moving in, right? Hell yeah! That's the right call! Twig's a creep! You think I'm a creep? You are a creep. Everybody better stop calling my boyfriend a creep. Effective immediately. You know, I just didn't realize I was a creep. Ugh, that's enough of this. Twig, let's go to the park. To... <laughs> to... to kiss? <laughs> yeah. Anybody got a fucking problem with that? Eesh. Sorry I said anything. Let's just get back to the bounty hunting. Can't wait to show you those new commercials. Welcome to Pepperoni B Palace. I'm Pete, the pepperoni salesman, and we are, we, today we have a great special. Get over here, oh, come on. Uh, I, I'd rather not, I'd rather not, I'm gonna go ahead and No, eat. get over here, sit down, eat the pepperonis, come on, eat. I'm trying, I'm trying, I'm trying. My pepperonis, I'm popping. Welcome, valued customer. A perfect fit for a little shit. Great! 
Now get out of here. All right, you're all set. I hope Jorb didn't bother you too much. Come see what I've got in stock on the food menu. Here's the skinny. You're all gonna need some major firepower if you really plan to take on Garmantuous. What? More, more than we already have? Uh, our team is mostly guns. Trust me, we need this. Klug sent over the details on an extremely powerful Gatlion. Oh shit, another Gatlion! That's right. Supposedly he's in the possession of another G3 officer. A scientist named Dr. John Giblets. And guess what? I can't find shit on him. I don't even know where he is. Okay, so what do we do? We do it the old-fashioned way, and ask around. Maybe we find out his coordinates and warp him in. I'm sending you to Blim to gather intel. I don't know. I'm fucking tired, kid. Maybe you'll appreciate me more if you do my job. Okay, Gene, all right. We'll, we'll, we'll try to find him ourselves. All right. Skip the portal door and just head out into Blim. Oh, and before you go, you might need a little extra help. I went ahead and unlocked a new feature on your bounty suit. You're welcome. Bounty Hunter, it's me, Sudo, again. I'm still here. I've been here the whole time. Welcome to detective mode. I'm here to help you sleuth out all those really big, crazy mysteries. Suddenly? With the fucking detective mode? Well, why haven't we had access to this the whole time? All right, let's see. It looks like you're looking for a... Dr. John Giblets. Is that correct? Uh, yeah. Oh, fantastic. Let me do a quick search for you. This will solve it immediately, and... No matches found. Oh, well, it's never that easy. Why don't you start by interrogating the locals? Okay, I figured it out. This thing's fucking useless. Thanks, Gene. Hey, uh, did, did you know anything about Dr. Giblets? What are you talking about? Hey there, it's me, Sudo. Looks like you're trying to interrogate a suspect. Let's ask them some questions. I'm really sorry. I don't know who that is, but <laughs> good luck, I guess. Hope you find them. Woof, they didn't know anything. That was a real D-rank interrogation. Sorry. Oh, well, maybe you could just find more people to interrogate. You'll get it next time. Hey, uh, hey, tough guy. We're, we're looking for a Dr. Giblets. You got, you got any leads? Slick, what the fuck are you talking like that for? Oh, Jesus Christ, leave me alone. Hey, where you going? There's still more stuff you can ask him. Hey, listen, uh, if you find a drum anywhere, my buddy Globo here, you know, he'd really love one. He's great. He's a good drummer. And I think it would help him. You know, he's a good musician. I think it would... He, trust me, it'd be worth your time. Yeah, you know, uh, we'll, we'll keep an eye out for you. Hey, sorry. Yeah, no, he can't talk. He just sort of makes that noise. Huh, that's, uh, that's unfortunate for him. Bounty Hunter, come see what I've got in stock on the food menu. Pill taking information with this new revolutionary pill distribution method at pillpeople.com. Hey, uh, do you mind if we have a moment of your time? Oh, uh, sure. Uh, what's this about, can I ask? 
bitch. Hey, quiet. Don't say his name so loud. I can't help you, but Blordo can. Mention my name, Michael Taint. Then he'll talk. But no cracks about my name. In, the, in, the, in my palace of palace, I want to stop everything, you know, that's happening. Holy shit, wow, you, we actually got something we can use. Okay, woohoo. That was an A-rank interrogation. Good for you. Let's head over to Blordo and mention Michael Taint. Let me show you an example of what I have accomplished with one of my clients. Listen, this guy changed my life. I started out as like a weak, scared, fragile, and now, I, now I'm going... Yo, Bounty Hunter, come see what I've got in stock on the food menu. Hey, what's up, Lordo? You know anything about a, a, a where we could find a guy named Jib, Dr. Giblets? Whoa, 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 where'd you hear that name? You can't just go asking around town for a guy like that. What, why? What, what, what's wrong with asking about Dr. Giblets? I don't know. Why do you think I know anything about Dr. Giblets? I don't know nothing. Now buy something, I'll beat it, buster. Ah, oh, that piece of shit. I'm gonna kill him. Ah, look, if you're really looking for trouble, maybe check out the new High on Life store in the slums. The Hyperbong 6 Midnight launches tonight, but you should be able to get in by now. Just don't mention my name. I didn't say nothing. Now get out of here. If anyone sees me talking here, I'm dead. Thanks, Blordo. We, we had a good feeling you were a true pal. Whoa, great sleuthing, detectives. That was an S-rank interrogation. I was just starting to think, maybe you did hey, like this something. Hey, this is my favorite VIP. Hey, you don't have to wait through any of this funny business. You are allowed right in, my friend. Yeah, you better head straight through. Yeah, yeah, so we're looking for this new high on life Oh, yeah, hey, hey, It yeah. shouldn't be too hard, uh, spot. I get it. You don't want to talk to me. I'm the broken hey, leg guy. Nobody wants to talk to the broken leg giblets. guy. I get it. Well, the Torgs are with the G3 now, so it's best not to stick your nose where, where it don't. Wait. Oh, shit. It's you. The bounty on his back. Look at us, look at us. Look at what we're making happen right now. trail and they said they were with the G3 now let's get moving and find high on life
Why'd you let me sit there gathering dust? Look, the slums have always been a mess, but I, I don't like what they're doing over here to this place. It's, it just feels weird. in a barrel. My trick hole's ready whenever. There's no way you're gonna lose this with all this armor on. Come on. Come back. just waiting to be used. Save me! I'm driving you down. You can run, but you can't hide. Oh my god, what are you waiting for? Run!
again. Thanks so much. Thank God they opened this new high on Life Store. I've been counting down the days. Hey, don't worry. Detectives can always cut lines. The rules do not apply to the law. Welcome oh, I just hope they don't make me buy a new adapter. Nine two three, your local Hyperbong Superstore. Please, no trampling of other patrons during the midnight launch. Well, well, well. I smell another mystery. I'm Pseudo, by the way. You know me. Hi, Pseudo. I'm a detective now. Yeah, you already know what I'm gonna say. Try interrogating all the employees here. Well, that's a great idea. You're an even better detective than me. It is my pleasure to welcome you to High on Life. Are you being helped already? I'm so sorry. That is a really fantastic question, but I'm not authorized to answer it. Have you considered buying a drop proof case for your hyperbong? High on Life employees politely request that you don't alert the other customers to the fact that we are part owned by the Torg family. That worries the other customers, and we don't want that. You know, I can't recall whether or not I've heard that name before. But I'm actually much more interested in telling you all about the fabulous features that come packed in with the brand new Hyperbong 6. Ooh, boy, they really want to make that commission, huh? Sorry, but I gotta give you another D-Rank. Oh, uh, uh, hello, hello, and welcome to High on Life. I'm Derek, and I can be a personal uh, High on Life uh, pro professional today. Um, do, do, that makes sense, right? That, does that sound okay? I'm, I'm new here. Oh, no, it's okay, I guess. Uh, it's the big Hyperbond 6 midnight launch, and we literally just opened, so, uh, I only been here for, like, half an hour, and honestly, okay, yeah, it kind of sucks so far, because, like, I can already feel my soul leaving my body. God, I'd really love to help you because you look very cool. But no, sorry, I, I, I have no clue. Hey, hey, it's my first day. Uh, can you do me a favor and not mention Dr. Giblets around here? They told us not to talk about him. Wow, nice kid, but not helpful at all. You get a big fat D ranking. Holy shit, this is a madhouse. Oh, 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 sorry. Hi, thanks for shopping at High on Life. I'm the manager here. Are, are you finding everything okay? That's right, it's a big day. I didn't think there'd be this many people lining up to buy hyperbongs. Probably a bad sign for our city. Oh man, this again. Look, man, I just work here. I don't know anything about the store or who built it. Or I'm, I'm kind of a fuck up. I lied on my resume. I got this manager gig. I never even met Dr. Giblets. I, I don't know what he looks like. I couldn't even point him out in a crowd. Slow down there, Slick. You're saying you know Dr. Giblets? Yeah, yeah, sure I do. He owns this place. He never comes around, though. I don't really know where he is. What? I told you, I have no idea where he is, and you're being really aggressive. Leave me alone. It's super fucking busy right now, and you're distracting the hell out of me. Okay, shit, not, not so good. It looks like we've uh, hit, a, hit a dead end, so let's get the fuck out of here and just give up on being detectives. It's all done now. Nice day for a shopping trip, ain't it? It sure is. I know I'd go shopping on a day like this. Except this wannabe bounty hunter doesn't seem to be shopping. That's right. Seems like they're poking their beak where I don't belong. Be a shame if something happened to your beak as a result if you catch our drift. Just when things started to look all rosy, two knucklehead lugs showed up to hassle us. You got a fresh mouth on you, kid. Be a shame if something happened to that mouth as a result. Part of my associate here, he's only got one good threat, but I assure you, he can back it up. That's right. A word to the wise. Stay out of this. Got it? We've got this covered. You get to meet a lot of cool, silly people when you're a detective. Everyone should be a detective. Abide. This was classic mystery stuff. Except it seemed very obvious this guy was trampled to death. Uh, yeah. My friend Davy Glutes got trampled in the rush. Pretty sad, right? One moment he was there, next he's gone. Squashed. Dead end, literally. 
Looks like we need to get our hands dirty and steal those mag boots off the stiff. Maybe we could climb our way out of this hole, see? Yeah, that's fine. Trick hole just waiting to be used. Another wave? Another wave! Do you think we should kill them like we kill all the other bad guys we meet? shot right out of my trick hole.
this feels good. Yeah, let's go into the toxic shit. Welcome back. We've got company. Hello there. You guys again. How are you? They're cool. We've been observing you. Hope that don't rustle your jimmies none. Because newsflash buckos, we're on your side. We'd like to formally apologize for how we treated you earlier. We didn't realize who we were dealing with. You'll have to forgive us. And we're sorry we still sound like we're intimidating you. It's the only way we know how to talk. Our wives hate us. We represent Magistrate Clug Nugman. Maybe you've heard of him. He's certainly heard of you. Here's the skinny slim, the Torg family, or what's left of it anyway. They got mixed up with a bad crowd, the G3 cartel, or more specifically, Dr. John Giblet's PhD. And Clug wants it squashed pronto. He says you're the right bounty hunter for the job. Says you're already helping him. Says the G3 is our common enemy. We've got a lead on Dr. Giblet. He's been warping all over, leaving behind a nice little warp trail for us. We're thinking you can follow those breadcrumbs all the way to the gingerbread house. That way Clug don't have to get his cute little hands dirty. You dig? This kid's fast. Yeah, check out Dale Earnhardt Jr. over here. Let's say somebody dies. Maybe, hypothetically, their name is Dr. Giblets. Well, should anything like that happen, we had nothing to do with it. We didn't even mention it. This conversation never happened. And Clug will be very grateful. Speaking of which, why don't you follow us? Clug wants to speak in person. Huh, all right, let's, let's go talk to Clug. Oh, welcome back. Thank you so much for all your help. Yeah, they've been aces. Yeah, real pros. Hey, Clug. Sorry about those two. They can be a bit intense. Really, I don't know why they talk like that. But look, you've seriously done so much for me. I hate to ask for anything else, but this election is really close. And, well, keeping the G3 out of blim, it's really going to help me lock this in. Do you think you could, you know, deal with... Dr. Giblets? Well, yeah, no, I mean, we that's what we want to do, you know, but uh, it's just the trail went dead. A dead end? Oh, no, we can't have that. Let me just leave this map data right here on my desk. Not sure what might be on it. Oh, that's how we get to Dr. Giblets? Whoa, whoa, even if this map data did take you to Dr. Giblets, we're not 100% sure it would be his actual base. You'll still need to do some detective work. Fuck yeah. All right, then we just kick the door down, burst our way in there, find him, grab him by the neck. Hey, 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 I can't officially tell you to do that. Not if I want to win this next election, at least. <laughs> Good luck out there, bounty hunter. Uh, we will do our best. How'd it go? Magistrate Clug came through. He pointed us right to Dr. Giblets. That's great. I kind of regret not voting for him. Now get out there and kill giblets. doing great work. Who in the hell are you? And what are you doing in this house? I just...
time to welcome you home, Jill. Mar Marvelous Mervo at your service. God damn, you scared the shit out of me. What the hell is going on around here? And who did that? I brought you some flowers. Oh, it looks like things have developed in a sort of weird way over here. Welcome to Highway Village. Our currency here is tires, and we sacrifice our younglings to the Lord Asphaltia, High God of the Way. Hello, friend. My old life was flawed. Now I live the way of the highway. Their work face budget must be astronomical.
Fuck off! Pieces of shit! miss you. Thank you for letting me get some beauty sleep in. I'm dying. Uh, oh, thank God. Thank God someone's here. I, I'm, I'm, I'm losing consciousness. Oh, oh. We stumbled across another body. It looked like a classic case of... Hey, what happened to you? A G3 base warped right through here. Right, 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 right where I was. And, uh, well, well it shot me uh, right in half. I got cut in half. A G3 base. That can only mean one thing. Not sure what, though. Oh, God. Hey, come back. Fading fast. Uh, uh...
Hey, hey, thanks for coming back. Are you really dying? You, you, you sound fine now. <laughs> no, no, no. Oh, oh, I'm dying. No, I'm actually, oh, not uh, for real this time, though. Oh, my God. Oh, stay. Don't go anywhere. Stay with me. Thank you. Oh, here, here I go. Oh, my God. Oh. All right, shit. I, I, I guess that's it, then. Hey, hey, what the fuck? You left me again. I'm, I'm not dead yet, assholes. Oh, come back. If you leave me again, I swear to God, I'm gonna kill myself. You, you had to do it. You, you had to put him out of his misery. It was like a really annoying horse with a broken leg, you, you know? It, it, do you understand? Is there an equivalent to broken leg? You, you following here? Okay, so is this Dr. Giblets's base? Where, where the hell is he? Oh, I'm sure we'll be able to find Dr. Giblets with just a little bit of detective work. Let's look around for clues. Jesus Christ! Okay, okay, fine. Oh, that's a lot of dead bodies. What do you think happened in here? Whatever it was, it's not a good situation for everyone who died. Looks like your typical work desk. Nothing too crazy. Uh, uh, you know, best I can guess is someone interrupted Dr. Giblets while he was doing experiments. I don't know, I'm just throwing stuff at the wall here. Hmm, a destroyed drone. Looks like it was deployed for combat. Nothing fishy there, that's what they're used for, that's what drones are for, they're for combat, that's not weird to see a destroyed drone. Someone was killing G3 mercs. You know what, that makes sense, everyone hates the G3. I bet people try to kill them all the time, I mean, look at you, that's what you're doing. Okay, yeah, I think I'm getting a sense of what happened here. Someone beat us to the punch. They attacked Dr. Giblets and all his men. Huh, we need more information. Let me hack the door so we can go deeper and look for more clues. All right then, let's, let's keep moving. Howdy there, cowboys. Uh, oh shit, sorry, wrong bit, wrong bit. I mean, howdy there, detectives. Ooh, this looks like the lab where Dr. Giblets did his experiments. There's gotta be something helpful in here. Let's get to scanning. We got Ooh, the Look at all these drone heads. Dr. Giblets was an expert at creating cybernetic organisms, but we already knew that. You know, I don't think this is a very helpful clue. I do think it's neat, though. It's cool to look at fucked up drone heads. Thanks for showing me this. Was he doing experiments on his own henchmen? Jesus Christ, that's fucked up, right? Yeah, that's fucked up. I know it's fucked up. I don't know why I asked. I knew it was fucked up. Dr. Giblets must have been losing his mind. These must be old hyperbone prototypes, way jankier than the ones they're selling at the High on Life store. Well, you know, we just pointed these out, now we can move on to the next thing. Alright, here's my new theory. Dr. Giblets was even more twisted than we could ever imagine. He was torturing his own henchmen. He wasn't right in the head. Although I guess that's what Douglas did too, so maybe that's normal for the G3. Maybe he was normal. No way to know unless we go deeper. I'm hacking the next door! I got no fucking idea what this room is, but I'm sure there's more clues in here, so go go find more clues, baby. Oh shit, that's a G Gatlian. A regular old Gatlian doesn't look like it's in good health at all. Probably should just let it be, honestly. Aha, so that's our murder weapon. Dr. Giblets must have used that modified Gatlian to attack his men. It's pretty powerful, did a lot of did a lot of damage. It'd be great if we could somehow get that Gatlian for ourselves. You think that's gonna happen? Uh, who knows, let's find out. Oh boy, did Dr. Giblets write this? He was really paranoid, huh? He really thought people were trying to kill him. And you know what? Uh, he, he was right, because that's exactly what we're here to do. So, okay, he was right. Not crazy. Normal guy.
Are these second place trophies? They're trophies for, for what? Science? Just science in general? Do they really give out second place trophies for science? Jeez, it looks like Dr. Dibbles was pissed he didn't get first place in, in science. Okay, I think we finally cracked this case. Dr. Giblets really did go insane. He was paranoid that someone was after him, so he killed his own men. While you were wasting time doing detective work, I was busy scanning the area for Dr. Giblets and decrypting the password on his security systems. Now you can just follow the waypoint right to him. Wait, so we didn't have to find any of those clues? Yep, sorry. I just love detective mode so much, I didn't want you to stop using it. Now go kill Dr. Giblets. In the end, Dr. Giblets took the easy way out. A little disappointing because I was looking forward to a fight. Jesus Christ, that was the easiest one yet. All right, let me at him. Dr. Giblets status report, no life sense detected. Entering full security lockdown. Uh -oh. If you're hearing this pre-recorded message, it means you've successfully managed to murder one of the greatest minds in all of super science. Congratulations, you killed me. But I knew this day would come and I was prepared for this moment. Now see if you can survive my retribution from beyond the grave. Another ambush. That's detective life for you. So many ambushes. Everyone called me crazy, but look at me now! I'm dead and you're trapped in here, falling prey to my glorious science you were ever so jealous of! That's right, Crimothy! I know it was you. But you were so cowardly, and for what? The inheritance? My lab? Or just a plain old space edifice complex? No matter! Just as you had no qualms about killing your own father, I shall gladly spill the blood of my firstborn! If you're hearing this, it means you just killed an enemy. This is fine. I expected you to defeat some of them, but you will lose the war. I recorded this message in the event that you're wearing a jetpack and use it during the fight. I don't really have anything to say about it. I just wanted to cover all my bases here. Good work using the jetpack. But it won't be enough! Why the fuck do they gotta heal? So dumb, I hate them. What the fuck did I ever do to you? Hello? Anyone there? If you're hearing this, it means you made it past my first onslaught. Perhaps you aren't my son, Crimothy. Yes. Yes, I was wrong. How could I have been so blind? I know who killed me now. It was you, Krubus. Oh, was it Krubus who killed him? Take this! These are fun audio recordings. Always complaining about being the lowest rung on the G3 ladder. You thought you could kill me and take my spot at the top, didn't you? Well, think again, because... Well, you did kill me, actually, but... But I'm gonna kill you back! Oh, more guys! How appropriate, Krimpus, that after all those years stuck behind mountains of paperwork, you finally got to get your hands dirty again, just like you wanted. I'm bad with analogies. Krubus, could this actually be about the time that I slept with your wife? And then convinced her to divorce you and marry me instead? And then I made her do an experiment for me and she died in that process? And you swore revenge against me for the rest of the days? 
Could be that? I feel like it's probably not, but I just want to make sure. I know you can't tell me because I'm dead, but soon you can tell me. In hell! Remember to rig that up later in time with this video. Note to self, rig up base to self-destruct. Rig up base to self-destruct. Rig up base, okay. count.
If only they were all this weak, you know? You're drone for! Off we go! Alright, that's gotta be it. Okay, this is my final message. If you're still alive to hear this, then I've made a great mistake. I was wrong. Only one person could have survived all of that. Myself! I killed myself! Finally! It makes sense, you know. I always hated myself. I knew I'd get the guts to do it one of these days. Good for me. Oh, that's dark. So, okay, I killed myself. Whoops. My apologies to whoever's hearing this. I hope you'll forgive me for making you go through all of that. You can leave now. Have a good day. Jim is out. R.I.P. Jimlets. Wow, okay, good, 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 good work. Uh, I think we can get back out through the trap door now. As I continue to study these humans, I find them to be more complex than I ever could have expected. Initially, I saw great potential in both the Fergals and the Gatlians, but now, I see how foolish I was. Those were nothing but dead ends. Humans, however, humans are going to change everything. God damn, what the fuck was the G3 doing with this guy? You know, is he even alive? You know what? Let's take him back to Gene. Gene knows. He can fix, get him all fixed up. I just wanted to say, you know, that today really meant a lot to me. And, um, uh, God, uh, this is so fucking hard. Um, your free trial of detective mode is up. So see you later. Bye. Oh, thank God. Okay, Bounty Hunter, you go through the menus. You find that detective mode. You shut it the fuck off. Never again. Okay, I'm serious. Delete it. J delete it. And if we, if you can't do it, we, we, we go, we go to, you know, we, it's a whole mission. It'll be a whole DLC mission. Every last pace. Wow, look at that. You found Dr. Giblets all by yourself. See? It's not so easy figuring out where these bozos are. Let it go. Come on over. Let's bow wow. Okay, uh, so we did find Dr. Giblets. Um, he is dead, but we also found another Gatlian. Oh, shit. That's great. I, 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 I don't know about that. I mean, he, he's, he's not really functional. I, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't think he's dead, but... Oh, God damn. Yeah, he's busted up real bad. What were they doing to him? Do you, do you think he's salvageable? Buddy, I'm not gonna promise you I can save him. That would be irresponsible of me. You would be careless to toy with your emotions like that. But yes, I can definitely fix it. Okay, th thanks, Gene. But you know, if, if you can't be saved, it, it wouldn't be, uh... What was that? Uh, nothing. I, 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 I was being shitty. You, you, you didn't hear me. You, I don't want you to hear me being shitty. Yeah, okay. Weird thing to say, but whatever. Sorry to change the subject, but, uh... Turn in your bounty real quick. I've got some good news and some bad news. Okay, come on over. Let me give you the news. All right, what do you got for us, Gene? All right, which do you want first? The good news or the bad news? All right, here's the bad news. Lizzie's been gone for a while. It's probably nothing, and I'm obviously not actually worried or anything because I, I hate her. But, uh, you know, you, you might want to look into it since she's your sister and all. Maybe check with Tweeg. He works at that Space Applebee's uptown. All right, well, I lied, kid. I don't have any good news. I was hoping you'd just ask for the bad news, and then you'd be so upset you'd forget to ask about the good news. I was trying to pull a fast one on you, and I failed. 
So, uh, it's pretty embarrassing. Uh, so, uh, yeah, that's everything. I'll work on getting us some new bounty leads if you want to go look for Lizzie. And, uh, I'm gonna see if I can fix up that busted Gatlion you saved. Jesus, that is a lot to take in, Gene. Hey, uh, Bounty Hunter, you mind if we leave the other Gatlions here with Gene and maybe we can go poke around for Lizzie and use that time to have a little chat with each other? You know, just you and me, uh, our favorite people, our favorite... Uh, you and I are best pals. Oh, sure. We can use a little break. It's nice to stretch out a bit, you know? Take a little nappy poo. Oh, yeah. Ugh. Change the channel, Gene, to porn. Have a good time, you two. We'll hold down the four. All right, bounty hunter. Let's head to Applebee's and we're, we're, let's find your sister. First. First what? I'm going to nibble on your ears. All right, guns. No funny business while the bounty hunter's away. Look at us, just you and me again, you know, just like old times, like the dream team, you know? Uh, so Applebee's, it's in the slums, which you, you know, you, you probably knew that. So your suit can point us in the right direction. So you take the lead, bounty hunter. You, you, you know, we'll talk with, you know, we'll, we'll, we're gonna, we're, we're gonna chat. It's gonna be good. It's gonna, it's all good. Don't worry about this. Don't get shooken up about the, I don't, I, there's no reason to be, uh, you know, d don't feel weird or uh, anything. You're back, I'm not trying, you know what come I mean? Come on through, come right on through. Hey, listen, I'm sorry about being weird back there. It's just, well, oh, there's something I need to tell you. Whew, this is this is hard. Just give me a second. Oh, you got this, Kenny. Come on. What are you doing? Broken leg guy's still here. See you later. Oh boy, okay, so that um, that dying Gatlion that we saved, let's do it. Let's say we can fix him up and he, you know, back alive. The thing is, oh, okay, sorry, sorry. I, I'm just trying to figure out how to say this properly or, or you know, like communicate um, how we normally do, right? You know, the Gatlion we saved, let's do it. Uh, he knows some things about me that, that, that the others don't know and it's, a, it's nothing too crazy, you know? It's, it, it, okay, no, it's, it's bad, it's really bad. Sorry, I don't mean to be cryptic. I'm just, oh, this is tough. You know, this is really hard. I, I just don't want you to hate me. I'm worried about your sister. You, you think Twig is working today? Welcome to Applebee's. Table for two, right this way. Oh, uh, actually, we're wondering if someone named Tweeg is working today. He didn't show up for his shift, sorry. Do you still want a table? Um, you know what? You know what? Maybe this is a good spot to talk. Uh, yes. We, 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 will, we will take a table. Enjoy your meal. Your waiter will be with you shortly. Thank you. Okay, listen, I I'm sorry for making us sit here at Applebee's. I know we're really focused on Lizzie and that's kind of the important thing, but would you mind if I kind of got something off my chest here with you first? Whew, okay, thanks. You know, it's just, you know, it it's gonna weigh me down if I don't say something. Okay, so you remember what happened on my home planet, Gatlas? It got taken over by the G3, like yours. You know, all my people got enslaved. Y y you remember that, right? You know all that, right? Sorry, of course you do. Well, um, what if it was kind of, you know, just a little tiny bit entirely my fault? Uh, okay, I, I can see you're at a loss for words. I, I, I know how it sounds. I'm not the only reason the G3 invaded Gatlas. I'm just the only reason they even knew about it in the first place. Hey there, welcome to Applebee's. I'm gonna be your waiter for the day. Can I get you started with one of our signature cocktails? Uh, not, not now, please. We're, we're kind of busy here. Okay, sure thing. I'm gonna go ahead and get that in for you. Uh, thank you. 
Okay, bounty hunter, so l l let me explain. Gatlas was isolated on the far edge of an asteroid belt. We were completely untouched by the greater interstellar civilization, j just like your planet. But, you know, I, I wanted out. Like, I wanted to see the galaxy. I wanted to see what everything out there had to offer. That's when Rel Del Mar crashed his ship into our planet. He was this crazy smuggler. He, he'd been all over and he'd seen it all. And, 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 and after I helped him fix his ship, he wanted me to be a part of his crew, you know? And he, he took me with him. And I'm back. Here we go. This is for you. All right, now what were you thinking for an appetizer? Uh, so I'm sorry. We're in the middle of something, please. Great, it's coming right up. Oh, I don't know why I picked Applebee's to tell you this, but wh where were we? Okay, oh, right, um, obviously a guy like Rel, you know, he had to deal with all kinds of shady customers, and, well, you know, that led us to the G3, and Garmantuous, you know, he'd never seen an alien like me, you know, a talking gun with endless firepower, and, well, looking back, you know, I see how stupid I was, you know, I, I really do, but at the time, I couldn't tell, you know, I was being taken advantage of. I was going nowhere. You know, everyone thought I was a fuck-up, you know? I, I just wanted to prove to everyone that I could do something, you know? Open up. Here comes the appetizer train. Chicka, 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 choo-choo. Thank you. I ho hope you like those. Now you better be ready to order that main course. You betcha. I'm going to get that order right to the cook. Okay, thank you. So... I led the G3 right to Gatlas. Do you see where I'm going with this? We fought them off at first, you know, but they came back with some super virus that damn near zombified everyone. You know, a few of us were immune. We formed a rebellion. It was led by Les Do It. He was my best friend, my mentor. He was one of the strongest Gatlians who ever lived, and I, I got him killed. In his dying moments, I told him everything, like I'm telling you now, about how I left Gatlas to pal around with a criminal, how I led Garmantuous and the G3 right to our planet, how I got everyone killed, except Let's Do It survived. Somehow, the G3 must have kept him alive to try to utilize his power. God, if we can really bring him back, do you see my problem, right? Like, I I'm gonna have to tell the other guns what I did, you know, or else he'll tell them. All right, I'm back. Hope those tummies are ready for some yummies. Bon appetit. Dude, take a fucking hint. Can't you see we're in the middle of a thing here? Emotional thing. Uh, you know, this is important baggage shit we're dealing with here. Take a hint and get out of here for a second. Uh-oh, someone's feeling grumpy. Oh, wonderful. Now, wh what the fuck is happening outside? Lizzie? Don't follow us. Twig and I are in love, and we're going to travel the galaxy in his space RV. Uh, actually, this is moving kind of fast. Not Help me, please. Not that sentence. We're in okay, love. Okay, we gotta get to them. Hey, you didn't pay your bill. Oh fuck! fuck okay, you. this this, this changes shit. This is bad. Days. That means in real life, too, not just in this game. I'm here live in downtown Blim City, where, as you can see, we have been invaded by violent and agitated G3 cartel forces. No one can say for sure why they're here. We're here to kill you, bounty hunter. <laughs> ah, okay. Well, there you have it. It looks like this is only a problem if you are that bounty hunter that they're trying to kill. I'm People Fuckerton, Blim City News. Stay safe out there. Hey, uh, so I've got some more bad news. Uh, you were doing such a good job with all these bounty hunting rights. That you really were, so I made some new commercials with you in them to drum up more business. And, well, let's just say they had your house's address and... Now the G3 knows where we are, so they're attacking the house. So get back here quick, or they're gonna kill me and the other guns. My bad. Fucking did as if it couldn't get any worse.
get caught. What are you doing? We, we gotta get to the house. Okay, come on, what are you doing? We, we gotta get to the house. Keep Broken up the pace. Still here. See you later. We have to get back to the house. That's right. Let's go. We're gonna hurry. Oh yeah, I've been here the whole time. But, but don't worry, I'll keep your secret safe. I'm, I'm not a snitch. Hey, what's going on, best buddy? Hey, just so you know, man, everyone's like really upset with you. What fucking trouble, you piece of shit. Shit, they're fucking everywhere! Get to the house! Come on, we gotta get to the fucking house! Surprised to see me, bounty hunter? <laughs> you fuck with the wrong crime syndicate. It's all over. Hand over the Gatlians you stole from us, and then let me heal you. Nice and easy. We know everything about you, and we still have two oh-so-special people who are very worried about you. Thanks for coming back for me. I didn't deserve your help. It's not your fault. Well, no, you know, fuck that. It is your fault. You fucked up enormously, but we'll deal with that later. Please, fire up the warp core. We're leaving. Got it. Hey, don't forget about us. What's the plan? Yeah, the warp's ready, but we can go with it. G3 won't follow. I'll handle that. Can you pull off a Hennison maneuver mid-warp to juke them? Can I what? Do you make that up? You mean scramble the warp? Yeah, scramble the warp! Bounty Hunter, bring me to the warp core! Gene, listen carefully and enter these exact coordinates! 862135-10! Capital what are you G, saying? Lowercase x dash WW capital bolt C4 
Fuck Dash. these are long coordinates. Nine. This is why oh, no one types God. space coordinates in Seven. manually. Fuck it. Five, five, five. That's right. Of the four, three, dash, two, one, one, eight, okay. seven, Got four. It. Scramble time. And here we go. That was close. I may be 230, but I don't want to die yet. Are we? D d did we make it? Yeah. We're safe. Nobody on our tail, but, uh, where are we? Am I missing something? I'm not picking up any signs of life out there. Then we're in the right spot. Kenny, where did you just take us? It was the only safe place I could think of. Careful. It's toxic out there. I set up an atmos bubble so you can breathe, so don't wander too far. Or do. What does it matter anymore? Welcome to Gatlas, my home planet. Jesus. I didn't realize it was this bad. Fuck, there's nothing left. This was our home? Pretty soon Earth is gonna look like this too. We have got to stop the G3, bitch. Sorry, nobody answered me. I asked if this was our home. Anyone? How is it out there? We, we, we don't want to talk about it. That bad, huh? Well, uh, don't get all depressed about it. We still got more guys out there to kill. Let's powwow real quick. Look, I hate to be pushy, but are you ready for your next bounty? You know what, kid? Maybe you should get some rest. Let's save the bounty hunting for tomorrow. Head on upstairs. I'll take care of things down here. I hate to say it, but Gene's right. Let's get some shut-eye. We'll make this right starting tomorrow. Hey, that thing's for well-rested bounty hunters only. Go take a nap, sleepyhead. So, uh, what kind of stuff did you do in here? Like, anything gross? Y y you have to tell me. Like, seriously, come on. We're best friends now. All right, you're finally up. Okay, let's get back to it, I guess, you know? I, I, I hope Gene has a lead on Lizzie. Let's go. Yeah, look who finally decided to wake up. You know how late it is? Because I don't. There's no sun on this dead rock of a planet. By the way, I got you a little something-something. A new suit upgrade. Extra overshield. You're welcome. Let's get to business. I've got something you'll like. You can breathe easy. I'll get right to it. I tracked down Lizzie's bio signal. Oh, that's great. So, so she's... She's alive. Don't worry. But she's on the move. Probably on a ship, so we have to act fast or we'll lose her. If you're ready, just step through the portal door. I don't know what I want. Okay, fine, I don't know either. Isn't the sex good? I don't know. I can't even tell if we're doing it right. We're aliens. None of our shit even lines up correctly. You could be pregnant and I would fucking wonder how that happened. My cum goes all over outside of your body. Well, okay. I don't know if it's good either. Your body is really confusing. God, I'm just so confused. Aren't we in love? You're asking me that, dude. You're the one who dragged me out on this trip. I wasn't looking for anything serious. I just wanted to get laid. But even that turned out to be some weird fucking Hellraiser puzzle. Oh, shut up. Don't blame this on me. There's plenty of ways you could have figured out how to use my equipment, so to speak. Hey, uh, sorry to interrupt. Oh, yeah, thank God. You came just in time to save me. Me is who you came to save. Thank you. 
Fuck your sister, dude. Woo. Cuckoo! Girls, am I right? Love is tough. What the fuck are you doing here? Uh, I don't know. We were a little worried about you. God, everyone needs to chill out. When have you smoked? What, you're a smoker now? Wait, what is it? Camels? Marble? 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 Marbleos? Marble? Marble? Marbleos? Marbleos? I don't know. What's it to you? What do you want? Well, I don't want to come home. It's not even my home anymore. It's Jean's jack-off mansion, and it's your little clubhouse where you can unwind for a few minutes between bouts of, oh, I don't know, murdering criminal gang lords. Hey, I'll go home. You can take me home. How about that? I'm your new sister. Congratulations. Just get me the fuck out of here. No, you're staying, Tweed. We're in love. Say it. Say we're in love. Okay. Never mind. I can't go. I have to be in love with your sister. Look, I hate to be insensitive, but it's dangerous out in space for humans right now. We even got chased out of Blimp City by the G3. Whoa, really? Yeah, it was rough. Listen, I get that there's a lot right now that's bothering you, but can we convince you at least to just come home with us and figure it out there? But I'm busy being in love with Tweeg. Uh, yeah, we're busy. Sorry. So just leave, unless... What else were you worried about? Oh yeah? How? Yeah, how about you just let me handle this on my own? You already decided to become a weird alien killing expert. Don't strain yourself trying to be a dating expert, too. Um, yeah, no offense, but you're kind of butting in, dweeb. Hey, only I can talk to them that way. And look, I'm sorry I dragged you out here. Really, I am. I know you didn't want to. But I just, I wanted to know for sure if, if we worked or not. Oh, yeah, it's cool. I forgive you. I just think, oh, oh, really? Even after forcing you to leave with me? Yeah, okay, it's fine, yeah. Did you know I almost sold you out to the G3? They were offering, like, a lot of pesos to find out where you were. And that would have been way worse. What the fuck, Twig? You piece of shit! Wait, what? Y you're joking, right? No, I really almost did it. Like, I had my phone out and everything. If Lizzie hadn't dragged me on this trip, I probably would have. I'm not good. I'm a shithead. Lizzie shouldn't be dating me. Gene was right. And it's a little fucked up because he was being a misogynist, but he was actually right. I do suck, and I'm fine with it. That's just who I am, and I love it. So fuck off. Love it. Well, Jesus, I was about to do a, a whole thing about how we should take a step back and slow things down, but you know what? Fuck you, Tweek. Yeah, th yeah, Tweek, fuck you. Hey, thanks for coming to get me. Seriously, it, it means a lot. Uh, okay, enough. Let's go. You got it. Smell you later, Tweeg. We're back. You're safe. Uh, I mean, fuck you. And a fuck you, too. Okay, happy reunion. Everyone's fine. Can, can we just get back to bounty hunting? Yeah, 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 yeah. Clug just sent over the data on Nipulon, so you can head out while I fix Les to it. Did you, uh, know how much firepower this guy's packing? He's gotta be at least ten times as powerful as any of you other Gatlians. Wait, you really think you're gonna be able to fix him? Yeah. Yeah, I'll probably have them all patched up by the time you get back. Y you're serious? That, that, that soon? Yeah. Don't worry about it, kid. Your friend's gonna be just fine. Old Papa Gene watched a bunch of GooTube tutorials, and now he knows his way around cybernetics. That's, that's, that's great. It's, it's just... What? You don't sound too happy. You know how hard I've been working to save this guy? Fuck. Whew. Okay. I guess it's now or never, Bounty Hunter. Can you set the other guns down on the table for me, real quick? Hey, everybody. I, I... I need to come clean about, uh, well, sh this is f way tougher than I thought. Spit it out. Yeah, spit it out. No, I I, I can't. I, you're going to hate me. Dad, th we, we don't have secrets. We're a family. Well, hold on. I might decide to hate him. It's okay, Kenny. You can tell us. Oh, just fucking say it. Okay, fine. If you don't hear it from me, you're just going to hear it from Les Do It when he wakes up. 
Okay, what if I were to tell you that I'm the reason the G3 invaded Gatlas and enslaved our race? We'd be mad. I, I don't think I could get over it. Yeah, don't say that. You know what? It would really suck to hear you say Kenny, that. Kenny, come on. That's not true, right? No, no, no. That would be impossible. Are you doing a bit? Okay, well, there's, there's more to the story than just oh, a... fuck. He's scrambling for words. It really is true. He really did cause the downfall of our civilization. Kenny, how? That doesn't even make sense. How can it be your fault? I left Gatlas before the G3 invaded. But, but how could that be possible? We didn't even have interstellar travel on Gatlas yet. I ran into an alien smuggler who crashed his ship on our planet, and I was going nowhere, and, and, and he took me with him on these adventures, and it was supposed to be, you know, this fun, awesome thing, and, but then we got mixed up doing the wrong job with the wrong crowd. Garmantuous and the G3, and I accidentally led them right to Gatlas. It all happened so fast, I, I thought they killed Let's Do It. I, I told him everything as I watched the light leave his eyes. I didn't know he, I didn't know he was going to survive. You mean you didn't think you'd ever have to tell us the truth? No, 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 that's not it. I, I... Oh, this is all sorts of fucked up, Kenny. I don't even know what to say. See? I'm not the biggest fuck up here. Not now, dude. Everyone, please. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I, I didn't know what I was doing. We're so close to taking down the G3. Let's just... Oh, okay. Let's just pretend you're not the reason everyone we know and love is dead, yeah? Sure. Easy. Done. What's next on the agenda? Forgive Garmantuous too? Come on. Th 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 that's not fair. No fight. I'm sure we can all figure this out. No creature. He can't just drop that bomb on us and expect everything to be the same. I I'm sorry. Look, I hate to be this guy, but we're running out of time. Nipulon may not stay where he is for long, so I know things aren't... The ideal, but, uh... Yeah, 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 yeah. We'll finish the job. And then you're out of our lives, Kenny. Come on, Sweezy, you don't mean that. Enough! Just pull yourselves together for this mission, at least. You're professionals! You're bounty hunters! Act like it! Mm-hmm. Fine. <laughs> okay, yeah. Gather everyone up. It's time to get back on track. Nipulon just flew back into his drug lounge on Port Tarine, so we gotta strike now. Can you handle that? Let's just get this over with. Woof! That was a doozy, huh? It's just one thing after another, isn't it? I don't know about all that, but, uh, I'm glad you got your sister back. Thanks for doing that. Hey, in the event that I manage to get Liz Dwit back online, we'll be ready to fight Garmantuous. And for that, you're really gonna need those Earth coordinates. Nipulon should have them logged somewhere in his office, in that big drug lounge he runs. Find those if you can, so he can take the fight to Garmantuous back on your home planet and finish this. Okay, we just need to sneak into Nipulon's lounge. Let's try... Can it, traitor? We'll handle this one. We don't want you selling us out. Kitty, do us all a favor and sit this one out. Hey, stop fighting! I hate it when everyone's fighting! We need to talk things over in a healthy way. No, 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 no. We just need to cover ourselves in goop again. It's not complicated. That's true, we should do that. But I also think we need to have a really fun time at the saloon, so go there first, please. Uh, whatever. It's it's up to you, Bounty Hunter. Head over to Dregtown and get gooped up, or try hashing this out at the saloon. How bad I feel about this whole Gatlas thing. I know they can hear me right now. I know that's sort of the rule rules we set up, but still, don't they know? Oh, you're going with my plan? It's an honor. I will not take this lightly. Shall we take a seat at an open table? Okay, creature, this was your big idea. What is there to even talk about? Thank you everyone for coming today to the inaugural big friendship meeting. First item on the agenda is... You don't have to do this, creature. No, no, I insist. Kenny doesn't deserve any of this hate, right, Bounty Hunter? Well, thank you, but I, I, don't, I don't know if that's true. Yeah, you didn't know what you were doing. Just because he's an idiot doesn't mean he gets off scot-free. Yeah, people died. We don't have a home anymore. No, no, stop it! I mean, let's be civil here. We're friends. Are we? 
Most of my friends don't trigger global genocide. Well, I don't know if that's the best way to phrase it. Oh, yeah? How would you phrase it then? Lightly assisting a global genocide? I didn't know. I, I didn't know what would happen. Oh, fuck off. Like, that makes it any better. But he's also trying to stop it. He's trying to make things right. We all are. It's not, not like he has much choice. You think he's doing this because it's the right thing to do, Bounty Hunter? Thank you, Bounty Hunter. At least you have my back. I have your back, too, Kenny. Yeah, thanks, Creature. Yeah, but we don't. Yeah, we still hate you, Kenny. Creature, this isn't getting us anywhere. No, it's going perfectly. It has to be going perfectly, otherwise I'll be sad. Then be sad, Creature. Tough shit. You can just blame Kenny if you want, like we're doing. It's pretty easy. Can we just bail on this little group therapy session we got going on here and get back to the bounty, which is more important? Honestly, I'm right there with you. Yeah, th th this, is, this is a lost cause. No. No, it's not a lost cause. Is it, Bounty Hunter? Yes, we will. Hey, look, look, fine. Maybe. Maybe. But let's just deal with Nippalon first, okay? Can we do that? Whatever. Are we done here? Can we go, Bounty Hunter? Sorry about that. I just wanted to help. I moved here for your convenience. Hello, sir. Can you get us all gooped up? Oh, no can do, partner. See, my little gooper trooper, you're as sick as can be. Looks like he's not gonna make it. Truth be told, I don't think I'll ever be gooping anybody ever again. <laughs> Unless we get him that medicine. Medicine? Oh, no! That's so sad! That's breaking me up inside. We'll help out however we can. Oh, no way! Thank you so much! Wow, that's so nice of you. There's a special flower over there on uh, the other side of Terrine Ravine. But good luck getting over there, because that ravine is Terrine through the valley, if you know what I mean. Those damn Mac and Cheese brothers are taking forever to build the bridge. I mean, if you could get them to do their jobs, then maybe we could get the flower and save my little Goopa. I think we can make that happen. No promises, but we do a lot of really crazy stuff like all the time, and it's usually fine. Well, shit. I don't want to get my hopes up, but thank you so much. Hey, you want to see my Kenny impression? Huh? Um, um, can, can, can you stop by the G3 headquarters real quick so, so I can sell out all my friends? Uh, Kenny's still our friend. No, it's fine. Let him go nuts. Wait, I can do one too. Oh, uh, nobody loves me and I. It's, it's a fucking tragedy. Hey, me too, Marky. Me too. You know, they were... Hey, listen, they were asking... Hey, 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 whoa, whoa, Buster. What are you doing walking on this as a life construction? Okay, so you're not leaving, are you? You're just fucking barging in. What do you want from us? We want to cross. Let us cross. Well, tough luck. You, you, you think you own the world? You want to get across the ravine? You got to wait for us mac and cheese brothers, brothers to do our work. Yeah. Yep. Ah, oh, that's a shame. There's really nothing we can do? No, sorry, pal. Listen. We got our own emotional shit right now. You know, we're, we're on strike until Papa Mac and Cheese Brothers, you know, he comes back from that goddamn saloon in Old Town and he tells us he loves us Mac and Cheese Brothers, his sons. Oh, uh, I'm sure he does. All right, listen, we just need to hear that he loves us. That's it. We ain't working until we find out, okay? Hey, we're the Mac and Cheese Brothers. Yeah, you can't do shit. You're, you're... Hello, friends! We're looking for Papa Mac and Cheese! Hey, how are you? Do you know Papa Mac and Cheese? Never heard of him. And if I had, I'd keep quiet. Hey, do you know Papa Mac and Cheese? Watch yourself. Don't want to go get yourself into trouble. Hey, do you know Papa Mac and Cheese? Man, don't look at me. I mean it, don't let them see you looking at me. Hey, do you know Papa Mac and Cheese? Hey, 
do that. Yeah? I'll tell you what Papa Mac and Cheese is. If you do this guy. What? No, not me. Please pick anybody but me, please. Sure, yeah, why not? You know the rules. Stand five feet apart, count to three, then draw. Last man standing wins the fucking door. Come on, man. I, I don't want to do this. Come on, it'll be fucking fun. Go on, then. Get to your mark. Perfect. Here we go, then. Jeez. I'll count you down. Shooting each other on fucking draw, all right? Three. This is so exciting. Two. A little scary, too. Oh, wait. What if he shoots us Run. first? Fucking draw. Whoa. That's some quick trigger finger you got there, fuckface. Oh, that's so nice of you. Is that guy dead now? Oh, yeah, he's dead, but it's fine. We hated him. He's a fucking piece of shit. Anyway, sorry about all that. I was just fucking with you. It's fun to do a whole big ten shootout thing, you know? <laughs> yeah, we love it. Anyway, I'm Papa Mac and Cheese Brothers. What can I do you for? We talk to your children. Oh, is that so? Yeah, and how are those good-for-nothing pieces of shit doing? They love you very much and want to hear you say it back. But I hate them. They're shit heels. They ain't fit for the Mac and Cheese Brothers' name. What? You don't love them? Yeah. Tell them I said I hate them, and I hope they all fucking die. Now leave me the fuck alone. You're a very mean old man. I'm not changing my mind. Seriously, you gotta fucking leave now. Maron, I'm done talking to you. You're getting the silent treatment from now on. Oh, look who's back. Hey, so what, what, what did Papa say? Huh? Does he love us or not? Your dad is in love with you. Holy shit, did he did he really say that? He said it with his eyes. Oh my god, I'm oh my god, I'm freaking out, you guys. He he fucking loves us. You hear that? He uh, papa, papa loves us. God, I can't handle whatever I'm feeling. It is it is what is 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 this love? Is this what love is? Oh god, I, I yeah. can't handle whatever this feeling is. Is this oh my god, is, is this love? Aww, we just witnessed a miracle. Uh, see Let us uh, not waste. Uh, uh, Cross the heart bridge. Uh, 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 <laughs> Fantastic work. Really great job, everyone. Let's get this back to the goop salesman. You're telling me? Oh, fuck. Oh, I can't believe ah, it. You're back. Oh, I know. Oh. What in the fuck? Yeah. Oh, see, you, see you later. Oh, fucking wow. bridge of love. Look who's back. Oh. Who knew we could just make a bridge with love? What? Oh, what a fucking rip off. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I know. Oh, think of all the work we could have saved. I ain't never you know? seen nothing like this. It's beautiful. Oh. Sorry if I'm not at my best right now, Bonnie Hunter. I just get anxious when my friends are fighting. And when I think about Ghost. And when I remember all the traumatizing experiments the G3 did on me. during the briefing. Who do we shoot at?
Wow, you did it! This will save my little Goopa's life! Thank you so much! It was no problem. But actually, no, it was it was really tough. Uh, but you're welcome, you know? Uh, yeah. Okay! Oh my god! As good as new! You really saved his life! I don't know how I could ever repay you! Oh, that's right! He could shit his goop all over you! Wow, you healed him up so nice, his goop's gonna last even longer than before! So you're gonna be covered in shit for such a long time! That's great! Ugh, all this fucking work just to get covered in this shit again! Wow, you look great! Real goopy, real shitty! Oh shit, okay, G3, don't forget, we're in disguise, we don't have to fight! Gooped G3 Minion. You must be here for your one free spa day. Please enjoy your stay. It's working. Hello, esteemed G3 Minion. Thank you for redeeming your one time only free spa day. Please, continue forward. Oh, uh, oh, thank you. Okay, this is going well. Just gotta keep our cool and sneak our way through. A guest. Please allow me to show you to a private booth. Right this way. Let's just play along. They might lead us right to Nipulon. We do hope you'll find your time here satisfactory. Remember, we're here to cater to your every need. You name a drug, we have it. Zero G, verticals, and yes, we're now serving every type of human. We've got young teenagers if you're looking for something big, or perhaps you'll prefer the gentle high of an elder human years away from death. If you're not sure, babies are a little more heady. It's less of a body high. Basically, whatever you're looking for, we've got it. Ah, the main atrium. You can see how much of a good time everyone is having. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So fast here. Holy oh, my shit. God, I swear, I can't even remember my own name uh, right now. I wish they lasted a little longer. We can suck these humans dry way too fast. Waiter, they hit bring so me six good. more humans. More babies if you got them. I like them best young and innocent. And now, <laughs> please follow me to your booth. Hey, waiter, can I get a few more humans when I get a chance? Of course, sir. I hope you don't mind sharing your booth with another guest. We're a bit overbooked today. Sorry. Yeah, you ever try human? Shit's amazing. <sighs> oh, yeah. Look how dumb they look. All hairy and weak. You're lucky they can't be so fucking hot. Otherwise, they'd be a waste of the species. <sighs> oh, fuck. I love seeing the light leave their eyes. Yeah, fuck this. Do what you have to do. What's wrong? 
Why are you giving me that look? Whoa, what the fuck? Security! All right, we're doing this! Okay, we're in it now. We just have to push through to Nipulon. Shut the fuck up!
Why don't we compare muscles? And you try surviving with yours. Shit, let's go straight to Nipulon. Woo! I feel so alive! Up top where we belong! Don't put me back in the holster with Kenny. I don't even want to look at him right now. Just keep me out. I'm the best gun anyway. Chin up, Bounty Hunter. When we ditch Kenny, we'll be a stronger team than ever. He was just dead weight.
alongside you and the other Catlians and all my kids is such an honor. Thank you. I won't. Nipulon will see you shortly. Just, you know, can I get you anything? <sighs> oh, hey, Helen. New job? Yep, you keep killing all my bosses, so I have to keep finding new ones to work for. <laughs> Why don't you take a seat for a moment? Good idea. Let's rest those legs of yours. You put in work. I'm sorry, I'm so sorry, but uh, how much longer will he be? Any minute now, we appreciate your patience, thoughts and prayers. Hey Kenny, you wanna skip the boss fight and just give ourselves up to Nipulon? Let him kill your friends for old time's sake? Great, just what I needed, some more time to sit and feel like shit. Uh, uh, you do understand why we're mad at you, right? Yeah, no shit, and, and, and I'm sorry, you don't think I'm sorry? Guys, not in front of Helen. Oh, don't mind me. <laughs> I love overhearing stuff. I call it the Erie Canal. <laughs> I, <want> my... <laughs> I don't know what I need to do to prove myself to everyone, but I'm sorry for my part in how things played out. I suffered too. I'm still suffering. Ugh, save the waterworks. Let's just stop the G3, and then we'll never have to see each other again. No holidays, no celebrations, no birthdays, no anniversaries, nothing. That's not what we want. It's what I want. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Understood. Okay, Nipulon will see you now. Well, look who it is! The Big Bad Bounty Hunter! Finally paying me a visit. You don't get it, do you? You still think you're the human? Wrong! <laughs> Save the monologue, freak. We got enough going on. You anti-drug crusaders make me sick. Evolution made you into the perfect biological drug. It's only natural that other beings take advantage. It's how things are meant to be. So you really hope you drug this much? Maybe you just haven't had a taste of how fun drugs are. Ooh, looks like it's really kicking in. Have fun. Oh, God. He fucking dosed us. Hey, kid. I've been meaning to ask you. Why are you doing all this? Don't you get it, kid? There's no hope for you. You're gonna end up just like me. 
Probably gonna lose your legs, too. I used to be something. Now look at me. Don't fool yourself, kid. This is your future. You're just Gene 2.0, and you're going straight down the drain like I did. You know that ain't true, kid. Look at me. No legs, no home, only two working eyes. I, I, I mean, I guess you only got two eyes yourself, but that, that, that's not the point. This is your future. I thought I was invincible. Bounty hunter. Sounds like such a cool job. But really, you're just a glorified garbage man working freelance to take out the trash for anyone willing to pay. Risking your body. For what, kid? So you can lose your legs? You find yourself all alone with no one to help you pick up the pieces because you killed everyone you ever met? Does that sound good to you? Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's true. They're evil. Okay, you got me. That trumps everything. You gotta stop the evil baddies, even if you might end up a loser like me someday. That's not even super likely. I, I might be an outlier. You're probably gonna be hailed as a hero for all time. Yeah. Well, see you later, kid. Let's dive a little deeper. So let me get this straight. You're mad humans are just drugs to be shipped around and sold off? Well, that's how things work, moron. It's a circle of life. We're just making the best of it. Be mad at evolution, not us. Yep, me again. A whole lot of me. Why are there so many nippy lines? One's gotta be real. Hey there, sleepyhead. Have you a good trip? How deep are you? <laughs> Don't worry. I'll kill you before it gets too bad. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's see how many hours you logged in Fortnite or uh, uh, Minecraft. Do you play those games? I'm trying to do a sort of psychopathic thing. <laughs> play games. Uh, let's just say you played 90 hours of Rocket League. Uh, wow. Quite the auto sports thing, yeah? Okay? Which one's the real me? Ooh. One of me move a little differently or something? What? Maybe one of me is slightly discolored. There's no way to know. How will you figure it out? It's mystery. many hours you logged in Fortnite or uh, Minecraft? Do you play those games? I'm trying to do a sort of psychometrics. Cool. Well, let's just say you played 90 hours of Rocket League. Wow. Mighty auto sports today, yeah? Which one's the real me? Does one of me move a little differently or something? Or maybe one of me is slightly discolored. There's no way to know. How will you figure it out? It's a mystery. Ooh, yeah. Hey, can we hurry this up? I gotta take a break. You know, work-life balance. <laughs> Maybe you're smoking one of your friends right now. Around. <laughs> A lot of guests coming in. Ooh. <laughs> hey, can we hurry up and get this <gasps> over with? I'm a busy guy. <laughs> Can we hurry this up? I gotta show face with all the big wigs downstairs. Yeah. Yeah, I have a two o'clock. 
Hey, can we finish this up? I gotta go rub elbows with whatever passes for an elbow down there. Nice try, loser. Oh, you got me. Big deal. Let's say you tack up another round of combat with your inner demons. Oh, oh, since Lizzie's here. Hey, idiot. You need to come talk to me or mom and dad are gonna be pissed. Do you really think you're doing this to save humanity? You do realize you're just playing the hero, right? Everyone else is dying, but you get to run around space with your little toys, pretending to be the savior of the universe. You're not a hero, you're selfish. This is all about you. Oh sure, and you think you're the only one who can do that. You think they don't have, like, space institutions in place to deal with villains like the G3 cartel? I'm actually asking. I have no idea. I barely know anything about space. It doesn't matter. The point is, this is all about you. You didn't do anything with your life, and now you want to play pretend hero. Well, guess what? It might actually be working. I mean, I don't know anyone else who's doing anything to stop the G3. This might actually be... It might be the right thing for you to do. Oh my god. You! You really are humanity's only hope, aren't you? Fuck. Another hole. What, what is this? The, the, the hit indie game Donut County? Which I highly recommend if you're playing this right now. But, you know, let me pick it up. It's, only, it's sometimes on sale. How you doing? Need some motivation to keep going? How about an award? Here, take this one that says you spent all your in-game playtime at an alien strip club. Oh, that's permanent, by the way. Everyone on your friends list can see that forever now. How are you holding up? Facing some dark truths? Maybe things are a little confusing? Well, I'll make it clear for you. You're our product, and I'm helping you learn your place. More Nipulons, they're, they're everywhere. <laughs> uh. ah. Hey, here's a hack for you. Switch to the other controller port, and you won't be able to hurt me. <laughs> Just kidding. There aren't any controller ports what? anymore. <laughs> <laughs> ah, ha, 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 ha. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you like living in the green land. <laughs> hey, you got the Metal Gear Solid reference, right? It's a shame when Konami did to Kojima, right? Ooh, you're right about that, <laughs> Was that even the real me? God, you're really having a rough go of it. How much longer can you hold on to your sanity? Looks like you're having enough trouble just keeping your little band of hero guns together. Where, where, where did everyone go? Bounty Hunter, where you at, buddy? Oh, fuck my head. Oh, Bounty Hunter! I'm literally so happy to see you again. You have no idea. I was for real freaking out. Oh my god, you found me. I was freaking out. I, I was worried. I was worried I'd lost you. There's my buddy. There we are. I was on the fence for a minute there, but deep down I knew you wouldn't leave me behind. About time? How'd you even manage without me, huh? Oh, great. Another blank void. How the hell do we get out of this? I, Kenny, 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 what is it now? I, 
I don't know. Oh, Kenny. I'm sorry, all right? I'm sorry I let everyone down. I, I was selfish and stupid, and I beat myself up for it every single day, and I'm so glad I found all of you because you've given me reason to live again. Oh, Kenny. Well, don't get all mushy about it. I, I, ju I just, I just want to make things right. You can. We all can. Well, to be honest, I'd given up on everything before you guys came along. Before I found all of you, but now we're a team and we're unstoppable. God damn it, he's right. You, you mean, you mean it? Yeah, dumbass. We've all made mistakes. I mean, not Kenny level planet wide genocide mistakes, but we've all made mistakes. And there is no way we're letting your big, big fucking mistake keep us from taking down the G3. So let's kick some fucking ass together. Yeah, that sounds good. Everything they just said sounded really good and smart. I love you all so much. You're the first real family I've ever had. Except for my little kids I spawn and shoot at bad guys. And the family I probably had before the G3 fucked with my brain and ruined all my memories. Let's do this, bounty hunter, as a family. Thanks, everyone. Let's fucking do this. All right, that's it. I'm going to erase all your game data now. I can do that. It's easy. You'll have to start all over. Here we go. You ready? Okay. Did that work? No? Shit, you're still here? I don't actually know how to do that. Never mind. Forget this. What are you doing? You're supposed to be spiraling into darkness, not growing stronger. This shouldn't be happening. I don't do it for real dog shit. Most people can't handle this. Stop fighting back. You're supposed to be dark compared to me. Okay, we're back. I think we're back. That was a lot. Is, is everyone okay? It, it looks like we really killed him at least. He's he's dead. I, I'm doing Kenny. I feel bad. And, I, and I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, me too. I love you guys. What's inside? I don't care. I just wanted to stab it. Okay, the Earth coordinate should be logged in here somewhere. Fuck yeah, biatch, we got him. Whew. Oh, okay. All right, I'm good. Let, let's let's cut a nipple off. Let's do it. Wrong wire. Wrong wire. Careful, you old bag of shit. You've already messed up everything else in your life. You don't want to mess this up, too. No, shut up. Like you'll want to talk after your little Winnebago honeymoon. How am I? I'm more worried about you. Are your guns still all uh, mad at each other? You all gotta get on the same page if you want to be garmantuous. I don't want you to fuck this up right at the finish line. Just keep it together. You've been doing a great job. You're sure you're doing this right, Jane?
50 pesos says Jean's gonna kill this gun. Hey kid, we got this covered. Go turn in your bounty. Whoa, be, be, be careful with him. Real smooth, Jean. That's supposed to happen. I know, I meant that sincerely. I just don't know actually how to be nice to you. Jean almost killed your super gun all over again. Don't listen to her. I'm about to do some real Frankenstein shit here. Oh, God, I don't know if I'm going to be able to look him in the eye. <sighs> That's fine. I think we accidentally severed his optic nerves earlier. What are you staring at, dork? Oh, for fuck's sake. You know, I thought you were actually going to say something nice. Yeah, or maybe thank you for watching all these GooTube tutorials on Gatlian surgery while you were out cutting off a guy's nipples. Fine, thank you. All right, almost got it. Stand back, everyone. Here we go. Is he? Wait for it. Let's do it. Les, is that, is that you? Let's do it. Oh, I might have fucked up his speech centers too. Let's do it. Let's do it. Talk to me. Let's do it. So what, all he can say is his name? This is sad. Listen, everything else I did was perfect. He can shoot, he can think, he can shit, he just can't talk right. But he's all in there, right? Like, he knows who I am? Let's do it. Les, I, I can't. Let's do it. I'm so sorry. I, Let's do it. I, I can't believe I didn't have to tell everybody what I did. Kenny, are you kidding me right now? Fuck off, Kenny. Kenny. Fuck off. What? What? I, and I'm happy to see my friend, okay? Fuck. See, I'm not the worst scumbag here. Wow, this is really it, huh? Let's do it. You got the earth coordinates, right? It's time for your final mission. Hey, kid. Looks like we made a pretty good team. It's been quite the journey. <laughs> this might be the end of the line, so make sure you finish up everything you wanted to do before we head back to Earth. You, uh, ready to go? You bet, kid. Take all the time you need. Hey, I know this has been hard. I'm, I'm really glad we have each other. But if you die, I'm gonna have to tell everyone about all that hentai I found on your computer. So don't die, because I, I don't want to have to tell everyone about all your hentai. Nobody's gonna give a shit. Everyone in space loves hentai. It's great. I love this. Come in, come in. Oh, 
I'm gonna miss that. Have a wonderful day! Um, we do really bad things to each other. Here, just sleep with my girlfriend. Watch. Okay, we'll see how this goes. Oh, hey, honey, how's it going? Um, it's going okay. Uh, I have one small request. Yeah, what is it? I want you to sleep with my girlfriend. Uh, I've never done that. Shut up. I know you've slept with him. Is it at the clear? Yes. this way. Comedy has been explored every which way. People have done funny jokes. They've done ironic jokes. Yo, bounty hunter, want to do some perfectly legal business? Hey, how you doing? Well, that was a waste of time. Come see what I've got in stock on the food menu. Hey, kid. Looks like we made a pretty good team. It's been quite the journey. <laughs> this might be the end of the line, so make sure you finish up everything you wanted to do before we head back to Earth. You, uh, ready to go? All right, then. You're gonna need Les do it. All right, let's do it. We got this. Let's do it. Let's walk this house back to Earth. Let's do it. Okay, dude, we get it. Let's do it. Wait. 
here. I'm too scared to look outside. Hey, kid, before you go, come talk to me. I got one last thing. Once you step out of the house, we're gonna warp away to safety until the deed is done. That means you'll be on your own. No, not alone. The power of Gatlas will be on a, a, at our side. Yeah, no shit. We know that. I'm just... Uh, God, it was just a figure of speech, Kenny. Look, Armantuous is tough. You might not be able to beat him even with Lesdort. So, if push comes to shove, use this. What is it? A remote atomizer bomb. Intel says Garmantuous has thick skin like armor, but if you can get this inside him somehow, then trigger it remotely? Well, let's just say his guts should still be easy to fuck up. This'll blow him up for good. Y you really think we're gonna need that? I don't know. Just don't want you to die. You are happy now? Happy that you forced me to admit I give a shit? Just take it. This thing was hard as hell to find. Thanks, Gene. You know, we, we, we care about you too. Okay, cool. Fuck off. Good luck. Don't you dare fucking die on me. We'll be waiting to celebrate with you when you're done, so... Holy shit, this is... This is awful! But, but there's still time to save your people! Let's do it! Let's do it! Holy hey, shit, that's the let's do it, I remember! God damn, he's a real powerhouse! Good thing we got him fixed up, huh? Oh, fuck, he's strong! I'm glad he's on our side. Wow, let's do it! You're so powerful! It's really impressive! Has everyone else seen this? You guys gotta see this! Fucking shit.
Squirts instead. Let's show what we can do. Trickle, yeah? Feeling we're, we're almost there. There's no time. 
time for feelings. Let's just focus on killing Comanchuas. Yeah, not the time for chit-chat, Kenny. Oh, come on, you're not still... Mad at you? Look, it's complicated. I'm kind of mad still, yeah. Yes, it's complicated. We all love you, Kenny. It's, 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 it's complicated. Like I said the first time, it's complicated. We had that powerful shared drug experience together, and we, we, we learned so much about ourselves and, and working together. Look, and Kenny, we, we, there's a lot of shit to work through here. We're not going to solve it in one drug trip. Maybe we did, though. You know we're here with you, Kenny. You're, you're, you're practically family, and, and we mostly only have each other. But it's not that easy. Yeah, so let's just kill Garmantuas and see where things go from there. We'll completely forgive you after we kill Garmantuas, Kenny. Creature, that's not true. But if not, not true. Okay, I, I get it. Let, let, let's just do this. Let's do it. And I'm here too. Knifey, your friend. Remember me? You know, she is really popular with, huh? <laughs> I mean... Let's do it! Okay, give it to me straight, guys. Do you really think we can beat Garmantuous? With Let's Do It? Yes. Big time. He fucks shit up. We're unstoppable. Yeah, I guess. We can do this, Kenny! Creature's right. We can! We can do this! I hope so. I just don't... I don't want to let everybody down again. <laughs> Not bad, huh? Old Gus still got it! How's it going? I'm just glad I can help too. See, I'm still pretty handy, huh? Shit, this is it. It's him. Oh, shit. 
Alright, now's our chance. We have to shove that bomb inside of him. Let's do it! chance we have to shove that bomb inside of him yes okay deep a little deeper there we go okay yeah shove that bomb all the way up his asshole into his intent or whatever's up there okay that should be good now pull out and let's blow this fucker up it's time for the g3 to become the g0 suck my ass okay what's wrong is, 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 is it broken god damn it gene the remote's busted oh shit Shit. Oh, hello. You're fucking done. Now it's time to make you really suffer. Let's make a deal. If you give up and turn yourself over to me, then I won't harm the two people you love most in this world. Fuck, he's got your parents. Behold! Uh, hey, it's me, Jack Black. Hi. I'm Susan Sarandon. Do, do we know you? Huh? Are those your parents? Parents? What, what the fuck are you talking about? I don't think the bounty hunter even knows these people. Yeah, we don't. But it's so nice to meet you. So what? You don't love these two? Because every human I asked said they loved them. Well, yeah, everyone loves us. I'm sorry, bounty hunter. I'm sure your parents are still out there somewhere, you know? They're alive. I, I, I can feel it. <laughs> okay, bounty hunter. Enough fucking around. Let's finish this. <laughs> you're delusional if you think you're going to stop me. I'm sick of fucking toying with you. Idea. Oh, fantastic! The, the, the bomb might still be functional. Let's do it! I know a way to detonate it. I knew you'd figure it out, Kenny! I'll go inside of his asshole, and I'll detonate it manually. Oh, that's not good. Kenny, 
That would mean... Yeah, I know. Kenny, we're not letting you do that, okay? There's gotta be another way. Can you think of anything? Actually, no. I can't. I guess this is the only way. You're gonna blow both yourselves up? Kenny, you might die. I... I know. Hey, bounty hunter. Fighting alongside you has been... Well, it's been the best thing that's ever happened to me. Thank you for giving me the adventure of a lifetime. Now shove me deep inside that monster slug's dirty asshole. Kenny! I, I want to do this. I, I need to do this. Okay. Okay. Well, I guess this is goodbye. You're the best bounty hunter I've ever seen. And you're an even better friend. See you later, pal. I'll always be with you, and I love you. Oh, 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 shit, it's done! Kamatuas is dead! He's fucking dead! Rest in peace, fucker. Good work, bounty hunter! What about... There's no way they could have survived that. What a noble sacrifice. I can't believe it. No fucking way! Oh my god, they survived! They made it! Let's do it! I'm... I'm alive? Is Garmantua is dead? We owe you big time. The whole universe owes you. Now you're a fucking hero. I'm so glad you made it. We did it. All right, we're back. We killed another evil alien guy. And it was actually kind of cool. This dude was like giant. Jeez, what took you so long? That was supposed to be an easy one. No, it was easy. It took like 15 minutes. We just stopped for burgers after and the line was really long. Aside from that, everything went smoothly. Yeah, nothing goes down smoother than the blood of a freshly cocked bounty. No matter how much they beg for their life. I don't care. Oh yeah, he did beg for his life. A lot. That sort of thing doesn't really register with me anymore. Military training, you know. Dulled my empathy levels. Yeah. We're all very happy you're ignoring your traumas. Now go turn in your bounty at the Bounty 5000. In other news, it's the two-year anniversary of the day a fearless human bounty hunter teamed up with a band of motley Gadlians to take down the entire G3 cartel. If you're not familiar with the story... So how was that bounty anyway? I feel like we haven't done anything really big and exciting since the G3. Except maybe that cartel war, the time we had to blow up evil earth yeah i know what you mean it's just the same shit every time stab this knife that you know i'm just i think i'm depressed i think the first time the first adventure was better anyway i don't know if we can top that ah hey knifey that reminds me someone tried to drop off a package for you a package for me Knifey? The knife? Yeah, I didn't answer the door because I don't have legs. And I didn't want to. They left a note, though. It's on the fridge. To the fridge, bounty hunter! Now! Let me have a sneaky gaze at that letter. <laughs> hmm. Greetings from Muxalon Delivery Services. Blah, 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 blah. Sorry we missed you. Yada, 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 yada. You can pick your package up at our distribution headquarters. Yeah, shut up. Wait a tick. <gasps> the sender. It's from... Bounty Hunter, we have to get that package now! Hey, you better hurry then. Muxlon HQ is a mobile facility. I bet they're stationed on Paroxys for a few cycles if they're delivering packages in this quadrant. I guess I'll just uh, uh, punch in the package as a new bounty. Uh, that's, the, that's the only way I know how to do this. Get ready, Hunter. Time for our greatest adventure yet. Mine, Knifey's Big Break! Take us to the Bounty 5K! <laughs> My head is a balloon. <laughs> Go on, click on my package. Alright, let's do this. What's our target? Just like a cardboard box or something? Yeah, G.I. Jane, a fucking package. But if I'm right, it's my ticket back to my home world. Let's go! Let's stop this DLC, you bloody legends! Knifey! <laughs> Oh. 
All right, Paroxys. Your mission is to help me find a tiny little box with my name on it. Now go, have fun. Hey, you. Welcome to Paroxys. Let me greet you. <laughs> Seriously, get over here. Okay, thanks for letting me greet you. Greetings. Was that so hard? <laughs> Oh, whoa. You sound really sick. Are you okay? I assure you, I'm fine. Welcome to Broxis. <laughs> Here you'll find a quaint planet full of whimsy and artisanal charm. And you best make sure to check out the crowd jewel of Broxis. Salt Lake City! Famous for... <laughs> Just give me a minute. Alright, yeah. Tell us about Salt Lake City. Come on, give us the whole deal. Crossroads of the Western Corkscrew Nebula. Once known for the beautiful and sacred native Paroxian culture and art. And it still is! <laughs> also, it's absolutely covered in salt. Full of friendly, sluggy faces like mine. We're all sick all the time. <laughs> Just a bunch of friendly, sick slugs. That's what makes Salt Lake City so great. Enjoy your... <laughs> <laughs> Do you mind if I cut this answer short? I need a minute. Ah, oh, shut up! How do we get to Muxlon HQ? I got me a package that needs slicing open. Oh, the big fancy ship out yonder. I'm sure you've seen it. Not so easy to get to as you might think, surrounded by toxic water. Only the duffel will go in and out of there. Maybe Sam down at the ranch can help you. Fine! Where's this ranch? Eh, it's a bit of a hike from here. Couple islands over. Maybe head over to town first and get your bearings. Oh, yeah, go on ahead. I need a minute anyway. <laughs> hey, hand over your valuables. Give us all your shit right now. Okay, but you're shooting at us already. Ask us to hand our stuff over before shooting at us, maybe? Come on, stop shooting us and give us your money. Venmo's fine. We just started doing Venmo. Wait. Are those XG3 we're fighting? Yeah, they're... What? No. Well, I want to kill you, obviously. Gotta say, I don't love that ant. Die, maggot! I mean ant. I know the difference. Sorry. Sorry! Do you have any... Seriously, what do you have? Can we just... Okay, you're pretty strong, I get it. We regret attacking you now, but it's a little embarrassing to back out to just kill us. Put us out of our misery. Ah! Lay off the violence, please! I believe it was Marx who said you should give us all your stuff. That's my name, by the way. Grab... Alright, finally! It's been a hot second! Now you see me! Now you're dead! Greetings, I am beckoning. Yeah, okay, bye. Start beckoning. Watch it. I'm gonna need you to slow down. Yeah, sure thing. Hey there, hot stuff. Why don't you come on down and learn Paroxo squash from the hottest coach on Paroxo? Okay then, be on your way. Hey, what do we got here? Another human. <laughs> Man, hasn't life been crazy for us ever since the whole G3 incident? I mean, us being drugs and all. Still a little scary taking vacations like this. I always worry someone's gonna try to smoke me. <laughs> Just kidding. I'm sure it'll be fine as long as that heroic bounty hunter who saved us is still out there.
back for more. So, learn Paroxo Squash from the hottest coach. Oh, oh shit, you're not a slug. Sorry, I'm not wearing my glasses. I thought you were a sylph from far away. Not gonna explain what that stands for. Gus got you, baby. Don't you worry, Gus got you. Look, you're not my usual type, but I'll still teach you Paroxo Squash if you're interested. I'm a pretty good coach. You got something to launch balls with? Nope, I lost this though. Maybe we got something in the lost and found bin for you. Go dig around in there and take whatever you find. Then I'll teach you the ropes. Whoa, who are these little fuckers? Oh, that's ball. It's an acronym. I forget what it stands for. But they operate the gun for you and shoot out balls. So there you go. Doesn't need to stand for anything. Just shoots balls. You ready to learn how to use it? I'll teach you. All right. Game's easy enough. Just use ball and try hitting those targets. Go on. Give it a try. Squad, baby. Fuck yeah. Good work. Amazing work. You don't happen to have a hot slug mom picking up after breakfast, do you? Now try taking ball out for a real spin. Play ball! Remember, I actually used to like this game, it's not just you to pick up the chips. Good one, buddy. Oh, we should use ball here. <laughs> Ugh, mice, are you serious? 
How'd they get here? Did they stow away in some packages? Stalactnids in their natural habitat. If I recall from my training, they're classified as a low threat level, momentum utilizing subclass of the arachnid genome. Wait, actually, that doesn't sound right. That, hey, don't listen to me. I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. I'm just making shit up half the time. Just go and be careful. remind you to not drop any more of your guns. You're lucky we found Harper and that she's almost the same subspecies of Gatlian. Seriously, you gotta be more careful. These are living beings. Anyway, sorry to lecture. Uh, I don't want to be the annoying old fart. Uh, I'm one of the cool guys, part of the team. That's why I installed this radio feature, so I can just talk whenever. And nobody forgets I'm part of the team, ever.
Wow, look at that big fella. Bet he can help us. And if he can't, well, I bet he's real nice to stab. Ah, oh, remember that? I do that too. Did nobody fucking look at the return address? It was sent from my home planet. But those good for nothing Muxalon delivery fucks smudge the full coordinates. Yeah, fine. I don't know how to get home. You got me. I woke up off planet one night after a fun filled, blood soaked evening and I never found a way back. But oh fuck, I miss it. A whole planet full of knives just like me. It's a bloody paradise, mate. Well, get stuck. That's exactly why I want to get home. None of you sick fucks even get me. You don't understand me. Sometimes it's nice just to kill a bunch of tiny things, you know? That's just my feelings on the matter. Just happy to share. Ah, feels good to talk. Hey there, buddy. Welcome to my back. Oh my god, look at this big chunky boy. You think he can help us? get to Muxlon HQ. Oh, hello there, friends. You say you need help getting to Muxalon? Oh, ho, ho, baby, I can absolutely help you. No doubt. It'd be my damn pleasure, in fact. You just gotta do me one little favor first. Oh, yeah? And what's that? All you gotta do? Join me in this delicious bath and take a freaking load off. Ah. Oh. Come on, I can tell you're a bit high strung. No offense. Get mad. Oh, fuck you. I'm not fucking high strung. No hard bad, friend. Just suggesting a nice bath. A little break to reach up. <laughs> Whoa, why'd you get out of the bath? Come on, don't be rude. Get back in. Yeah, deal with the bath. Oh, good, you're getting back in. That's great, because I'm not helping you till you suck with me for a while, okay? So I'm glad we're on the same page. Go ahead, take a load off. That's what I do. This bath is full of loads I've taken. <laughs> Relax a bit, come on. Hey there, Pseudo here. I'm gonna go ahead and give you a little God of War style tip that just gives the whole puzzle away. Go ahead and shoot those parasites on Toxo, and that'll give you health to heal and you can fight so good. No way. Uh-uh. You're still all tanks. I'm not letting you get away without a longer bath. Get back in here, you! Oh yeah, you almost died. 
I had to save your ass. Guess the bath is poisonous to your species. I didn't know why the hell didn't you say something, you son of a bitch. <laughs> that scared the shit out of me. I don't want to watch somebody die in my bath. That's bad vibes. Bad, bad vibes, baby. Enough of this shit. Are you going to help us or what? Oh. oh, yeah. That did the trick. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Now you help us get to Muxalon HQ, right? Sure, sure. One second. I, I just, um, you know, I'm a little embarrassed to ask, but... Can you clean a few more of those parasites off me? There's a whole bunch on my back. Just head around. Ugh, are you fucking kidding me? What? Look, I'll help you. I said I'm gonna help you and I'm gonna help you. I'm not a liar. You can trust me. It's just this one last quick favor. Just do it. And if you don't mind, please, don't take too long. I get a little self-conscious about my body. And especially my rear. Fucking hell, I swear to God, you're... Ugh. Fine, we'll do it. We'll clean your back, and then you'll help us. Of course, absolutely, Bathman's promise. Thank you, I mean it. And please, don't judge my naked body. Power slide. Yeah! Oh yeah! Oh god! Oh, that feels nice! Woo! Where'd you learn to shoot like that? Good work, team! Keep it up! I'd help if I wasn't a knife. I really, I really would. I'm not just saying that. Oh, uh, yeah, that feels slimy. Oh, wow, I feel so amazing! <laughs> oh, it's like my back can finally breathe again. Thank you so much. I don't know how I can ever repay you. I do! Help us get to Muxalon HQ, right fucking now. Sure, of course. Why don't you pop back over to my front side, huh? I can't keep talking to you over my shoulder like this, that's for sure. Hey, there you are. Yeah, yeah, shut up. Now help us already. I can actually throw you right over to Muxalon. Super easy. Good. Just one last thing first. It's just one last thing. And I'm even more embarrassed about this one, trust me. But, gosh, I really need you to clean off my ass. Right through this cave here, please. No, no way, no more, we've done enough. Look, I get it, you have. And I appreciate that, but uh, just clean my ass first. I won't be able to concentrate on helping you until my ass is clean. Jesus fucking Christ. Just do it, Bounty Hunter. Let's just get this over and done with. Just do it. Oh, you're a freaking angel, you know that? <laughs> you really are. Well, my ass is right through that tunnel. Just head down there and bang. There it is, huge ass. Can't miss it. But just don't spend too much time looking at it, okay? I'm self-conscious. Just get in and get out. No need to linger. There's nothing down there, right? It's just my ass. It's not like it's some sort of public spectacle. Just respect it. Thank you so much. Hey, good luck down there. Cleaning my ass. Making your way through a cave to a butt takes everything you got. Taking a break from an assless life sure would help a lot. Wouldn't you like to see an ass? Sometimes you want to go where you can drink under an ass. And it's a parody of cheers. Sorry that wanted to mention cheers just making sure you know this is a cheers parody also Frazier's in this one too we didn't even ask we're just using Frazier illegally what the hell is this so tell me 
How's the wife doing, Gorm? Well, Zam, if I knew that, maybe she'd stop yelling at me to listen to her better. <laughs> okay, this rolls. Well, I'll be, yeah, if it is an friend and bounty hunter. Oh, fantastic. We'll play along, but we've never been here before. Sure you have. All right, we, we did it. On we season two, off. episode now, six. Let's go. And Quit season fucking four, around episode down here. 17. Come over here. Let's all take a shot with the big shot. What do you say, bounty hunter? You know, a man who listens is very attractive to most women. Uh, sorry, Cyan. Can you repeat that? <laughs> she says guys gotta glisten nowadays if they want to get chicks. Sheesh. You got any baby oil I could rub on myself then, Zam? <laughs> sorry, Gorm. I just used the last drop we had back here. Is that you? Are you back? Oh my god, you did it. You really cleaned my ass. That's insane you did that for me. Seriously. I would have just helped you earlier, but I wanted to see how desperate you were. Oh man, you just cleaned a giant guy's ass. Are you serious? We, we were being nice to you. Can you please just help us? Yeah, okay, sorry. Calm down. I got you. Don't worry about it. Let me just toss you to the next island. What do you say? All right, throw us. You got it. See you later, pals. Ah, here we go. Direct flight all the way to Muxalon. Not if he's big and bad. Oh, shit, he didn't throw us far enough. You bloody drunk go. Ah, uh, great. Ah, uh, whew. Ugh, we tried getting thrown, now let's try, I don't fucking know, let's try slowly walking to that ranch over there. seen so many duffalo up close before. Hey, Beautiful creatures, wise eyes. All Jewish, too. Canonically Jewish creatures, actually. Huh? Well, mission parameters say we should find who's in charge here. Oh, no. Poor duffalo looks... Oh, brother. Huh? Well, let's deal with these buffoons. Well, that cowboy hat looks authoritative, so let's talk to him. Come on. Ask that rancher how to get into Muxlon from here. Oh, Elizabeth, poor thing. Good afternoon. What seems to be the problem here today, sir? Oh, hey there, folks. The name's Sam Schnock. You came at a bad time and... Hey, wait a minute. You're one of those poachers, aren't you? Just leave me alone. You already roughed up poor Elizabeth here, the runt of the litter. And for what? Just to steal some cargo from her belly? Oh, no, no, no. We're not poachers, sir. We're just looking for a way to get to Muxlon HQ. I don't believe you. You look like a poacher to me. I can smell the blood and violence on you. The duffalo can, too. They can sense that kind of thing. Beautiful creatures. Look, we're not fucking poachers, all right? What if we kill all the real poachers? Would you believe us then? What kind of mind games are you playing at? You really expect me to believe you're gonna go up to your big fancy poacher base on that rock spire over there and kill all your friends? <laughs> yeah, right. You're just as twisted as your leader, that blasted poacher king. Get lost and keep your hands off my prize duffalo. Don't worry, bounty hunter. We can change his mind. And these poachers sound very stabbable. So if we take out these poachers, we'll be one step closer to Muxlon. Don't fuck it up. Hey, we got intruders! Let them out! Whoa, poachers ahead! Kill them all! They're standing between me and my package! 
Hey, it's me, Pseudo, again. Uh, maybe you forgot this, but Gus can shoot giant discs from his body. Oh, there you go. Gus's disc. Perfect job. Good work. Keep doing these radio calls. Get used to it. Just uh, want to check in with you about Lizzie. See how you're feeling. I, I know she's been gone for a while, and those rumors, uh, well, it's, it's just not what I expected from her. Uh, at least she's making a name for herself. Uh, so, yeah, let me know if you ever want to talk about it. Not now, obviously, since you can't respond to me. This is a one-way call. I designed it that way so you couldn't tell me to stop talking to you. That would break my heart. Uh, so, uh, I'm just going to keep calling you and assuming you're cool with it. Love you, kid.
Oh, thanks for deigning to bring me back out. Hey there, Shuno here. Guess what? I got another little tip for you. A little tip that you already know how to do, but I'm going to tell you anyway. Deal with it. Those little nests over there. You launch one. Okay, there you go. You got a hook bug out of that whole thing. Good work. Shapeless sheathing, I'm gonna give you. You're dead. Do not poach anymore, okay? I said okay!
Hey, Sudo here. Uh, Harper's got a cool ability called a glob shot. You can pop that out of her trick hole with, uh, with the button that does that. So if you need to use the glob shot for something, don't forget that you can do that. All right, Godspeed. Reporting for duty.
Okay. Misunderstanding. I would have had my men attack you if I knew you were human. Wow, it's been ages. They they said you're gonna be a monster. You're not you're not a monster. Oh, yeah. No, none of these ants have ever seen a human before. They were terrified of me. Thought I looked gross. Let me be their boss if I promise not to kill them. So, what can I do you for? Oh, totally. That's all finished. You have my word. Because, well, you know, you killed all my poachers. But also, I'm just over it. And hey, as an apology, take some of my poppers on the house. Yeah, we use these to loosen up the duffalo and steal all the cargo muxalon stuffs inside them. But you can use poppers for other stuff too. I sure do. So, what else can I help you with? <laughs> Oh, great question. Yeah, uh, we came up with a plan for that, actually. I eh, figured it was too risky, though. The gist of it was, use the poppers to loosen up the duffalo, then climb inside, and let it smuggle you into Muxalon HQ on its return trip. Pretty genius, right? Hey, they don't call me the Poacher King for nothing. <laughs> It's sort of a, if you know, you know thing. Oh, look, it's nothing that crazy. I came out here on vacation with my boyfriend and we got in a huge fight, so I stormed out into the salt flats, met some ants who were terrifying to me, they treated me like their god, I bossed them around and told them to find me treasures and doodads. So they started poaching duffalo, and we figured out the trick with the poppers, yada yada yada. Suddenly I'm the poacher king. Well. You know, not anymore, thanks to you. But uh, I mean it. This wasn't the life for me. And I miss Carl. I think it's time I head home and try to make amends. Ah, uh, see you around, I guess. Old Jiggy Donuts will be leaving soon for his next big adventure. Who knows where this crazy galaxy will take him next? I'm getting fucking impatient. Let's head back to the rancher and see what these poppers can do. Oh, hello again, friends. Hope you're having a good adventure. Hey there. Gene again. Uh, just uh, got lonely over here and uh, wanted to say hello. Guess I kind of run out of stuff to watch on TV. A little bored. <laughs> and, I mean, not in a depressing way, like, uh, oh, I just sit here doing nothing, waiting for you to come home. <laughs> don't feel bad about leaving me here or anything. I, I don't need your pity. I just have no goddamn clue how to sincerely express that I miss you, so I'm making it weird and trying to guilt trip you or something. I, sorry. Yeah, just, uh, to, you know, good luck out there. Oh, great. Not you again. Don't worry. You're not going to have to deal with any more poachers. 
We killed them all. Oh my god, I can smell it. The blood of a hundred poachers. You really turned on your own people and killed them all? For me? We keep telling you we were never poachers. Oh my god. Well, that's great news. And Elizabeth here's feeling a lot better, too. Just about ready to send her back to Muxalon. Oh god, thanks so much for all your help. Even if you are a filthy poacher. Go ahead and let me know if there's anything I can do to thank you. Yeah, you can do something. Let us climb inside your duffalo. I'm sorry, what's that then? Whip out the poppers, bounty hunter. It's time to get dirty. Muxalon HQ, here we come. <laughs> She's opening right up. Oh, Jesus Christ! Elizabeth! <laughs> Ugh, this is disgusting. I love it. <sighs> Good thing none of us have noses. Well, except you, Bounty Hunter. I guess you've got a nose, don't you? Uh, yeah, sorry. It probably smells like shit, doesn't it? Probably the worst smell in the universe. Because you've got a nose. No, I don't have a nose. All right, I'm bored. How long is this gonna take? Uh, hello? What the hell? What are you doing in here? This is my duffalo. No shit. Hey there. No, seriously, what the hell? Get the fuck out! Sorry, we kind of need a ride. I'm going on a big adventure to find a missing package from my home world. You, you understand. But, uh, I'm just going on a big adventure to find a missing package. Who gives a fucking shit? Get the hell out of my duffalo. It's mine. You got that? Uh, all right, this is gonna be a whole thing. How do we handle this, team? Get the hell out of my duffalo! Uh, we're, we, we're, uh, not really here. We're just ghosts in your imagination. What in God's name are you talking about? Your ghosts in my imagination? Uh, so, so, oh, wait, wait, so, 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 I'm imagining ghosts, is that what you're saying? Or you actually are ghosts? W what is it? You're imagining us, literally. We're all in your mind, figments of your imagination. Oh no, I see what the confusion is. Yes, you're imaginary, but I'm not the one imagining you. The duffalo is. They're imagining me too. We're all emotions. What do you mean by we're emotions? What, what are you saying? Oh, come on, it's so obvious. We're all manifestations of each of the different emotions in this duffalo's brain. You know, happiness, sadness, anger, like the Pixar movie. I'm the newest emotion, poggers. It basically just means I'm responsible for any time the duffalo sees something really cool happen. <laughs> yeah. Uh, which emotion are you supposed to be? Gotta be chillness. What's the dictionary definition of chill? Uh, I don't think chillness is an emotion. Oh, trust me, it is. And we're it. Anytime this duffalo feels like life is good, that's on us. That's on us. All right, prove it. Let's see how chill you really are. What do you have in mind? What do I have in mind? How about we shoot the shit for a little bit, you know, so I can see what you're really made of. How's life been cheating you? Wow, okay, okay, right off the bat with a winner. How's life? Life is going, man. Life is going. I feel you. Wow, that's chill. You feel me? You feel me. Amazing. Okay, yeah. I feel you too, guy. I feel you too. It's hot time we dipped out. What? You mean leave? No! Oh, this is so nice. I feel so relaxed. I can't even remember what we're talking about. You really are chill. Sorry, bud. We got places to be, and this is our stop. We got a vamoose. They're real, though. I'll never forget you. Finally! Muxalon! Brian, are we in Muxalon? Bro! And over there, pals, I couldn't help but notice it's pretty dark in here. Let me just help you out with this flashlight, and then I'm gonna dip out, because it's, it's, uh, it's, it's scary here. I don't, I, I, I don't love it. Bye. Yeah, yeah, we get it, Pseudo. Wow, look at this place. Yeah, this must be where they keep the duffalo. Hey, it's pretty scary in here. <laughs> Shut up. Get moving and find my package. I can almost taste my home planet. 
Mmm, yummy. I'm not scared. Are you scared? I'm not scared. Calm down, everyone. We'll just grab my package. Uh oh, shit! What was that? My name's Stelson. I'm the last one left. You need to get out of here immediately. This place is dangerous. Muxalon isn't what you think it is. She can't be stopped. Enough. Is my package in here? Huh? What are you talking about? Uh, duh. We're here to pick up a missed package. What? You came here willingly? Oh, my God. Uh, yes, it's a very important package. All of my dreams of seeing my family and my home planet are riding on it. So where the fuck is it? Uh, if it's anywhere, it should be here. This is the Miss Package's room. But trust me, you should just forget about it and just leave while you still have the chance. No way. Uh-uh. We didn't come this far for nothing. Let's start tearing up these packages, Bounty Hunter. One of them's gotta be mine. Start knifing them. Funny. Just grow up, all right? Come on out! Oh, fucking hell! Who's there? No, you're intruding on my facility. Hey, it's all good. <laughs> no offense, men. We'll just pick up our package and get on our way. <laughs> I'm Mux, CEO extraordinaire of Muxalon Shipping Company. 
Do you know why you're dealing with me personally and not one of my millions of pathetic worm ass employees? Uh, because we trespassed in your facility and started fucking. Because you trespassed in my facility and started fucking up all my packages, yeah. You're pretty sharp, you know that? I could use someone like you. All right, we're sorry, we'll go, we'll go. Can you just please put us down? I can't do that. How are you going to pay all this off if I don't put you to work? Don't worry, we've got a nice benefits plan. Have a free parasite <laughs> on the house. <laughs> I guess our talk earlier convinced me to get out of the duffalo and go back to work. It's so funny running into you here, right? <laughs> well, let's do our formal reintroductions. I'm Gary Hellman, and I'll be your managing parasite. How about that? <laughs> oh, what the hell? Don't worry, it's only gonna sting a little bit, and then you're gonna feel a sharp pain down your vertebrae, and that's right when most victims start to involuntarily empty their bladders. But then it's fine. No more pain after that. Until about a half an hour later when you're going to feel more pain than you're going to Hey, 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 what are you doing? Seal up that box. What happened? Ah, oh, the fuck is happening? Are we working? No, you're not. And that's the problem. More work. More work. More work! Oh, I feel sick. Oh my god, thank you. Was that so hard? Idiot. Just do that every time. Oh my god! Oh my god, please help me! They're still using us as drugs! You gotta help me! Holy shit, they're trafficking humans! Fuck this! Please, no, don't shoot me up! What the fuck? Why would you do that? Hello? Okay, psycho! Yeah, sure, box up a human being! Thank you. Great job. Really great job. I mean that. Okay, and here's another one. Hope you're done grappling with your ethics here. Very nice. You're very good at betraying your own species. Seriously, stop boxing up humans. Keep it up, keep it up. Let's get into the flow, okay? Get into the fucking flow, baby. Please do not seal me up in this box. Wow, you're a natural. You must have a lot of experience being a traitor. When that human tracks you down and kills you in revenge, that'll be on you. Come on, baby! Let's keep that species traitor streak going! Hey, look, I cannot tell you what to do. I can't stop you. But... Look at you, gunning for employee of the month. Well, you're not eligible yet, but I'll put in a good word for you when you've been here for uh, 10 years. Seriously, cut it out. Look at you! You are in the groove now. You don't need me anymore. You just keep doing what you're doing.
What is the problem? Oh, if it's a pee thing, I told you, you could just piss in your suit. I truly don't mind. Just piss in your suit. Yeah, we're kind of professional human savers, so we're not doing this. What? It's not like you're culpable. You're just doing your job. Enough. We're not here to work or betray anyone's species. We just want my fucking package. And yeah, sure, we'll take this place down and save all the humans, I guess. Come on, let's move, Bounty Hunter. How the fuck do we get out of here? Uh, hey, 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 uh, you really need to get back to work now. Shut up! We don't want to make Mux upset, please. If we don't do our job, you know, I'm the one who's gonna get in trouble. Oh, thank God, there you are. Stilson, my favorite fella! Oh, oh no, you're infected. Stay back. What, this guy? Nah, he's harmless, don't worry. He can't control us. No, that's not true. I control you. I'm your boss! Hey, Stelson, what do you got for us? Oh, I found your package. I mean, if your boss will let you have it. I won't! Oh my gosh, my package! Oh, thank you, Stelson, you're the best! Oh my god, oh my god, this can't be real! Is this really full chainsaw mode? Oh, I used to have one of these back on my home planet! Fucking hell, I feel amazing! I'm more powerful than ever! Come on, come on, sweep me around a bit! Come on! Oh, yeah, that feels fucking good! Okay, now snap me into that nice squishy spot! Oh, God, you're really not gonna listen to me anymore, are you? My life is ruined. What are you doing? Try out my new chainsaw upgrade! Fuck you! Yeah, let's fuck everyone up! This is a nightmare! Dear, see that goop on the wall? I bet we can use my chainsaw to rip our way up it. <laughs> oh my god, this is so cool. We're unstoppable now, Bounty Hunter. God, this was really worth it, wasn't it? into so much trouble. Look, whatever you do, do not break the number one rule. What's the number one rule? Oh, right. I need to tell you the rule so you don't break it, okay? Muxalon Guidebook, page 37, article C. Employees are not allowed to slice up any of the link pustules that protect each of Mux's vital organs, especially not with a chainsaw. Huh. Weird that it says that specifically. In the event that those pustules are damaged, employees are absolutely not allowed to attack the relevant vital organ. Definitely do not shoot the vital organs scattered around the facilities. So you're not going to do anything, right? Oh, oh yeah, yeah, sure. De oh, yeah, fuck yeah! Take that, you disgusting, omniscient slime! Ah! What the fuck? That was my Flagoras numeral! I need that to understand numbers! I'm sorry, Mux. I'm sorry. I told him not to hurt you, I swear! Attention, employees! We have intruders. Not sure how many because of the whole I forgot numbers thing, but they're attacking me. Kill them now! Oh, God. Why would you do this to me? All right! That got the butt pumping! Now, I know we're here for Nipey, but it'd be a shame to not kill Mux and save all the humans here. Oh, fine, we can kill Mux, but this is mostly still about me. Don't forget. Okay. Okay. We should be fine as long as we don't attack any more of Mux's organs. The closest one will be the sort of facility. This up ahead, I think. Yeah. So don't go in there. Just let's go back to the station. Okay? 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 Oh, fuck me. Your objective just changed again. Have you washed your hands recently? They smell nice.
Yeah, baby, yeah! Signals gone, Doc. Hope you're okay and not dead or anything. Is a uh, God. I would actually be sad if you died. That that's real. That's the first time I've ever really put that thought together. But if uh, you died, it would seriously fuck me up. Jesus. D uh, d don't be dead, okay? So I bet you're wondering a bit about me and my whole deal. That's only natural. Well, uh, let's see. Oh, Muck spawned me in a brood of a thousand parasites. I worked as a manager for a bit. I was, uh, uh how would you put it? Not performing on par with Muxalon standards. So I ran away and hid in a duffalo for a bit, and that got old. And now I'm back for another go. Simple. Compelling. Well, that's that. Uh, I'll let you get back to whatever you're doing. Attention all on-site sex workers. Some of you are not so good at your job. Others of you, they're pretty good. Actually, very good. Yeah. Yeah.
Long time no see, soldier. Hey there, pseudo oh, oh, yeah. Holy shit! sorting room. Ah, uh, we can actually get some work done. All right, sort these packages by color. Are you kidding me? No bloody way. Please, please, just will you fucking do it for me. It's the only way to get to the next task, which will be even more fun. I'm telling you, it's gonna be a lot more fun, so you have to do it, okay? It's easy. Just knock the box into the right hole, just for a few minutes. A fucking couple of minutes. This is all you, bounty hunter. Oh boy, I absolutely love this room. Big conveyor belt. Look at that. Oh. You know, one time, Tommy, another parasite I work with, he loved this parasite. His host worked things up so much and put too many packages on the belt, clogged the machine, everyone was fucking pissed. Caused an override, whole big mess, forced the emergency. Oh, no, and now you're trying to clog the machine. Great. Okay, you're okay. Stop it. Can you stop it? Stop it. Stop! No! What is wrong with you? No, no, no! That's wrong! What are you doing? Well, there it goes! Emergency doors open, whole machines busted again. My life's ruined! Gonna get fired for sure. God damn it! It's almost like you don't respect me. Do you respect me at all? Attention, intruder, especially the knife. I took a peek at our internal shipping logs and I learned a bit about your little home world. Cute family you got there. What the fuck? Stay out of my business! Maybe after I deal with you, I accidentally drop off a shipment of high-grade nuclear explosives on that waste of a planet of yours. Leave my home planet the hell alone, you sick bag of slime! kill you.
Military school did you attend? The dumb fart academy? <laughs> Good one, Harper. Fuck it! All right, we just saved that human. I'm gonna go ahead and send them back to Earth for you. That's how we do it now. We have a whole system in place where we just safely send any human back to Earth if they need to be saved, and then they're fine, and you don't have to worry about them anymore. You know all this. There's no reason for me to say it right now. I'm just saying it because I am annoying, and that's, I'm sorry about that. Attention, employees. The intruder is still not dead. Not acceptable. Come on, guys. Killing them should now be everyone's main priority. This is all your fault, you know? I told you to follow the instructions, and you keep breaking all the rules. Oh, give it a rest. We got this. Attention, employees. Here's my review of not being able to pee. Oh, I'm so bad. Like, I really don't love this. My bladder hurts a lot. I've got a lot of bladders, too, so this is real rough. Careful, careful, careful. The admin office is just down the shaft, but it's really, really easy to die in here. Yeah, it's, uh, it's where we lose most of our employees.
cruel place for an employee bathroom. Oh boy. Oh, so you found the bathroom. I was hoping you wouldn't have to see this, but I'm glad you did. This is what I'm talking about. Pure evil. I've never been in a room more evil than this. You see this carpet, right? We need to take Mux down. Yeah, trust me. We're right there with you. below the admin office. Just pop on up there. Attention all employees, we are now entering a permanent crunch period, or as I like to call it, the video game industry. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. We have fun here, don't we? Mm -hmm. Hey, uh, thanks for all the hard work you do, Jason Schreier. that your employee satisfaction reviews are due today. Don't let the mayhem distract you. You gotta get that shit in immediately. Oh shit, I totally forgot. Okay, while you're killing everyone, do you mind just answering a few questions for me so I can get your employee satisfaction review all squared away? All right, I'll try to be quick. First question, are you satisfied with your direct superior's management style? Oh, that's me. Okay, now let's see. Uh, to answer, just uh, jump for yes or shoot your weapon for no. Oh! Wow! So you think I'm a good manager? Really? Oh, I wasn't getting that vibe at all. But I can't tell you how much that means to me. Can you let Mux know if she asks? Okay, let's move on. Next question on the survey. How satisfied are you with your current pay rate? Which I'm checking and... Yep, it's zero. We don't pay you anything. Are you happy with that? Move around for yes. Stand perfectly still for 30 seconds for no. Okay, great. You love getting paid nothing at all. That's good to know. We'll just go ahead and keep paying you that amount. All right, last survey question. Would you be likely to recommend to a friend that they get a job working here at Mar Attention employees. I know everyone's been ordered to hunt down the intruder, but I also want to remind you that your employee satisfaction reviews are due today. Don't let the mayhem distract you. You gotta get that shit immediately. Oh shit, I totally forgot. Okay, while you're killing everyone, do you mind just answering a few questions for me so I can get your employee satisfaction review all the right away? All right, I'll try to be quick. First question, are you satisfied with your direct superior's management style? Oh, that's me. Okay, now let's see. Uh, to answer, just uh, jump for yes or shoot your weapon for no. Okay, yep, I saw that coming. You know, I'm really not that bad of a master compared to the other guy. I'm a lot more mean. And you're not so great as an employee yourself, so fuck you. Okay, let's move on. Next question on the survey. How satisfied are you with your current payment? Which I'm checking and... It's zero. We don't pay you anything. Are you happy with that? Move around for yes. Stand perfectly... A 
Attention employees! I know everyone's been ordered to hunt down the intruder, but I also want to remind you that your employee satisfaction reviews are due today. Don't let the mayhem distract you. You gotta get that shit immediately. Oh shit, I totally forgot. Okay, while you're killing everyone, do you mind just answering a few questions for me so I can get your employee satisfaction review all squared away? All right, I'll try to be quick. First question, are you satisfied with your direct superior's management style? Oh, that's me. Okay, then let's see. Uh, to answer, just uh, jump for yes or shoot your weapon for no. Oh, wow. So you think I'm a good manager? Really? Oh, I wasn't getting that vibe at all. But I can't tell you how much that means to me. Can you let Mom know if she asks? Okay, let's move on. Next question on the survey. How satisfied are you with your current pay rate? Which I'm checking and... Yep, it's zero. We don't pay you anything. Are you happy with that? Move around for yes. Stand perfectly still for 30 seconds for no. Okay, great. If you love getting paid nothing at all, that's good to know. We'll just go ahead and keep paying you that amount. All right, last survey question. Would you be likely to recommend to a friend that they get a job working here at Mux Alliance Shipping Company? Turn to the left for yes, turn to the right for no. Oh, that's a shame. So you wouldn't recommend anyone? But you know what, actually, if they're anything like you, we're probably better off. I don't mean to be rude, but employees like you can really ruin the delicate company culture. Okay, that's the whole survey. Oh my God, thank you so much for doing that with me. I know you're in the middle of a busy day, but I just feel like this is really gonna help me make up for being attached to the employee that's destroying the whole company. Don't shoot me, shoot the bad guy! Don't forget to recycle! Glob shots ready! No organ above us. No. Not sure why you would think that. Don't think that. Stop thinking that. Let's just calm down and not go up there and destroy that organ. Love being in the air.
Whoa. Now, if you look to your right, you can see the Grand Canyon. Just goofing. Fans are on full blast. It's gonna be hard to get through here. You know what? How about we just turn around and go back to our station? Is that you like that idea? Go back to the station? Hey, uh Gene here. Just uh gotta assume you're dead at this point. Jesus, I really should have made this thing work both ways. Look, something's jamming your coordinates, so I I can't even come and grab your corpse or anything. So the funeral's just Gotta be empty casket, I guess. Anyway, I'll uh, try to invite Lizzie to your funeral, but uh, who the hell knows where she is, I think. Hey, you humans just love to get lost and maybe die, huh? Well, I cut it out. You know, I got nobody left. This house is great, but I, I like it better with you in it. I was scared you were gonna enter the central core and attack her brain. Thank God you're not doing that. <laughs> that would kill her for sure. Woo! <laughs> I can rest easy now. Oh, shit. Yep, don't worry. We're, we're not doing anything like that. It's all good. Yep, you ready, you slimy dickhead? Time to see what this chainsaw can really fucking do. Let's head inside the core. Ha, <laughs> 
<laughs> there you are. Seeing the color blue. Damn! No more blue for me. You know what? That's fine. That's okay. I'm more into seeing red right now. Your red blood, that is! Yeah, yeah, we got it. Come on, I need this joke! Let's just give up. Maybe she'll go and see us. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> now you're gonna die. Oh, if only you tried to understand things from my point of view. We could rule the galaxy, you and I, together. You as one of my many, many below minimum wage workers with a single bathroom break per week, and me as the senior mom, make you trillions of pesos a day from your labor. Her ugly face is right there! Show some initiative! Hey, that hurts! Ooh. Not in the face! Not the face! Not the face! Hey! I take that personally! Ooh. Take that!
That's all. I didn't help them. Ooh. Okay, everybody stay where you are. Sorry, I get a little handsy. Please don't punch us, Mom, please. I need a few seconds. Now I'm gonna throw some fucking grenades at ya. for the gas that thing guzzles up, okay? for the gas that thing guzzles up, okay? Her ugly face is one thing! Hey, 
That's not really what capital punishment means, by the way, but you did it! Mux is... dead. <laughs> oh, I never thought I'd say it, but I'm tired of killing. I think I need a vacation. Oh, it takes it out of me. Woo! That really was great work. Seriously, you really showed a lot of initiative today. <laughs> I'm gonna put in a good word about getting you promoted. Oh, shit. Shit. How does any of that work now? Does the company just not exist anymore? Oh, God, I, I don't know if I'm built for life outside the corporate landscape. Hey, guys! Stealthin'! Wow, you really did it. That's so wild. I thought for sure you were gonna die. You, there, Stelson. I need you to be the new CEO, okay? God, please, can you do that for me? I need things back the way they were. Ah, uh, I'm actually not super into doing a lot of work. Don't worry, that's perfect. The CEO doesn't have to do any work. Oh, well, in that case. All right, as new CEO of Muxalon, first order of business, you're promoted, bounty hunter. Fuck yeah! Second order of business, we've got to let you go, bounty hunter. Sorry, layoffs. Oh, sure, yeah, okay. All right, all right, enough. I'm trying to find my home planet here. Does anyone know how to track a package to its sender? One of the computers in here should do the trick, but that is the last time I am helping you. Thanks, mate. You're the best manager I ever had. Bounty Hunter, we're Thanks going home. To my home, specifically, not yours. Sorry. Nice, we're finally moving! Oh man, you're gonna fucking love it there. Seriously, think about it. A whole planet of knives just like me. A million knifeys. Oh, I'm so excited to see everyone again. I bet they've been so worried about me. Wondering where I've been. Oh. Does this ship have cryo tubes? 
I'm too excited to sleep. Maybe just freeze me. Well, you know what? Just knock me unconscious. Just hit me in the head really hard. I want to be unconscious. Wow. I can't believe it. We're finally here. My home planet, Australia 2. Don't get too excited, Bounty Hunter. Australia is just a very common planet name in space. Wait, 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 shh. Who's up ahead? Who in nice name ordered a package from Muxalon? Visitors run the risk of disturbing our peace. And just... How's it going, dickheads? Oh, dear heavens. Guess who's back? Did you miss me? No, 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 it can't be. Oh, not right now. Oh, not today. What are you talking about? What's today? Oh, it's happening. The great sharpening has begun. Let us rise to a new plane. It's the day of the great sharpening, you fool. You're not supposed to be here. You were exiled. I was exiled? Why would I be exiled? You're too violent, Knifey. An aberration of our species. We're meant to be a peace-loving race. We're knives. We weren't meant for violence. Okay, well, that's fucking stupid. Nobody told me that. Wait, so why the hell did you send Knifey a package if you hate him so much? We were just mailing him his old shit. We were trying to be nice and not just throw it away. Yeah, we're leaving this planet behind, and we just didn't want to take all his crap with us. He wasn't supposed to follow us all the way here. Wait, so are you saying you, you, you don't like me? Of course not. You're a complete psychopath. All you do is stab everyone around you. And you swear constantly. You know you can't go around saying the C word like that, right? You say it a lot, knifey. Yeah, you should probably chill out on that one. Oh, it's happening, my liege. We're ascending. And with no time to spare. What? No, please, don't go. Don't leave me behind. You're my family. You're not your fucking family, knifey. You're a piece of shit and we all fucking hate you. Oh, no. Don't let him bring you down to his level, my liege. You need a pure and peaceful soul to ascend to the next plane. This is all Knifey's fucking fault. Fuck you, you twisted cunt. Oh, you can't say cunt. Shut the fuck up, you reject piece of shit. Oh, fuck. No, oh, my liege. Knifey, you don't need these assholes. If you want a family, look around you. You've already got one. Come on. Right, guys? Oh, yeah. That's right, Knifey. Yeah, Knifey. We love you. We could be your family. Do, do you mean it? Really? Yeah, dude. I mean, sure, you're a little sharp around the edges, but hey, so am I. And it's nice having someone else on the team who isn't afraid to speak their mind. For real. We couldn't do any of this without you, bud. We're contract killers, and you love killing more than the rest of us all combined. Yeah, I am fucking great, aren't I? You know what? Fuck all you peace-loving knights! Ha ha ha, yeah, yeah! Welcome to Knifey's world, you dickheads! <laughs> Fuck these traitors! Stab them, bounty hunter! Stab that pretentious wannabe knife! Yeah, yeah. You fucking die! You think you're a fucking knife? You're not a knife! I'm a knife! Fuck you! Why didn't you love me? Why would you reject me? Why this? Die! Fuck you! Die! Die! Let's do this! Get them all! Show them the real true knifey! Knifey! What are you doing? Fuck you! Knifey? I thought you were banished. Yeah, I was, but now I'm killing you! You're Obviously. ruining all that we've worked so hard for! Yeah, well, you fucking deserve it, don't you? Fucking die! What's wrong? You. Nothing! I'm the only sane one on this whole fucking planet! Hope you had a good time on Proxys! <laughs> Hope you're having a good time dying! Ah. <laughs> oh, hello! <laughs> you're not mad about me firing you, are you? You're the one who's fucking fired! Wait, wait! I thought you were gonna hurt old Jiggy Donuts! I'll hurt whoever the fuck I want! Slugger like the stab. What the hell did you do to my poor double O? It 
that's not as bad as what I'm about to do to you. Oh, how droll. I'll toss your salad, you sick fuck. Ah, ah, okay, yeah, fade to black, whatever. Uh, we're gonna be doing this for a while, I reckon. What are these? Credits? Okay, sure, let's see who made this fucking thing. Jesus, look at all those names. What a sad bunch of losers. Friendly. It's not even a name. Sounds like a bag of chips or something. It's not even a name. Sounds like a bag of chips or something. What the hell is he talking about? Oh, he's having a breakdown. Everyone on his homeworld told him they hated him. Oh, jeez, Knifey. Hey, Knifey. Knifey! Knifey! Huh? What? You doing okay, bud? Yeah, yeah, I I'm fine. Knifey, I, I can't believe I'm saying this, but I love you, you psycho. We all do. You got your family right here. R really? Yeah, yeah, really. Don't make me repeat it. Sir, so, are you saying I can stab you again, maybe? Oh, Christ. Thanks, everyone. I love you guys. I'm gonna stab you now, Gene. Get ready. On television, but then we said that we want to be on television. They were nowhere near as tiny as us. I love you too, buddy. Wait, zoom out the camera. Oh, okay. Stop it. That's enough. What the fuck is wrong with you? You're not part of the family anymore. Bounty Hunter, go drop this knife for you. Drop Kenny! Alright, now that the main story's over, you want to go see what else is out there on Paroxys? Fuck around a bit, try to 100% this motherfucker? I know I'd like to do that. I'm not really doing anything else. There's actually five of us, but the other...